Not suitable for children or sensitive adults. Viewer discretion is advised. Share an all-new adventure with Atreyu, the rock spider. Meet Junior. The childlike empress, Falcor, and many more friends in the never-ending story do the next chapter. Rated PG. Plus, Bugs Bunny in the all-new cartoon, Box Office Bunny. Rated G. Folks start Friday, February 8th at a theater near you. My dad knows all about space vehicles. He directed me to the new Oldsmobile Silhouette. It looks our stellar. And the interior is perfect for the enterprising family. The modular seats pull out easily. There's a place for everything. Compared to other forms of space travel, Silhouette is the logical choice. Right, Dad? Eminently logical. This is the new Silhouette. Travel in space and style. Today, we have a special visitor. It's Rudolph Verkushny. He's going to play classical piano with Mr. Robinson. Gee, Mr. Verkushny's a better piano player than Mr. Robinson. But Mr. Robinson can really cream him at basketball. Bow! Yeah. This Christmas, from the director of Beetlejuice. It's not polite to stare, dear. Can I bring show and tell on Monday? Laugh with Edward. Whoa, suck of a handshake you got there, Ed. <laughs> Come on, let's get you sharpened up. Edward, um, would you? I'll be done. Edward Scissorhands. We don't want him rusting up on us now, do we? Ready PG-13. Now playing. It's Chevrolet Geo winter time where everyone can win with a best-selling line of cars. Sir, what Chevy are you looking at? This Lumina. That you are, and you can win with cash back and no payments for 90 days. And Lumina, Caprice, APV. Miss, ever buy a new car before? No. Winner! You can win with a first-time buyer bonus on Cavalier, Beretta, or Corsica. Ask me another one. You too can be a winner, so hurry to your Chevy Geo dealer during winter time. Children's Palace is going to save you money now. $100 million of inventory marked down. Save 30 and 50% on toys and games. Look for the red and green tag now at Children's Palace. Weeknights. Jennifer loves her work. It's probably going to be a long meeting, though, so why don't you get coffee for all the guys? I don't get coffee, Mr. Carlson. We agree. And never complains. Uh, listen, Andy, we've never had any calls before. If this pressure keeps up, I'm going to have to have more money. So, make an appointment with Jennifer Marlowe at WKRP in Cincinnati. Weeknights at 11 on Fox 19. How did she get away with that? Are you kidding? W-O-I-O. Shaker Heights, Cleveland. Maybe for you, but my hemorrhoids are killing me. Try sit again. For Still post. going. Nothing outlasts the Energizer. They keep going and going. What do you give a man who has the spark, the style, the edge? Preferred stock from the house of Stetson. The new, the now, the gift. Preferred stock. The extra smooth cologne for an extra special man. Make this Christmas an Olga Christmas. Imagine all the classics played by Olga Montero and her magic harp. They... Still going. Nothing outlasts the Energizer. They keep going and go. You better not shout. You better not cry. You better not cry. I'm telling you why. I think get the hell out of here. Halloween is coming to town. Oh, we don't play that. Catch it all new in Living Colors Sunday. While the other guys bring you the same worn-out Christmas stories... Oh, please, somebody shoot me! Fox presents a different kind of tale to warm your heart. When Al comes face-to-face -face with his guardian angel... You know I'm Al Bundy? I'm Al Bundy. No! ...and sees what life would be like if he'd never been born. It's me! She doesn't know you're there, Bundy. Just like when you're having sex. Sam Kennison stars in a one-hour Married with Children, a Christmas classic in the true Fox tradition, Sunday.
And now, the 12th annual Toyota Fun Coast to Coast sales event. It's on now. The event of the year. And we're dealing on every Toyota, Previous, Corollas, Camry, Forerunners, Celicas, and the all-new Tercel. Starting with the biggest Camry option package savings ever, up to $900, and incentives up to $1,500. And don't forget trucks. With your dealer's help, you could take one home tonight. There's what never been a eight? better Let's time go. to deal. Go, go see your Toyota Fun dealer now. All right, I'm here. I uh, hope the sound is okay. I'm not sure. It's kind of crap on my... Let me get, catch up with the chat here right away. Hi, Stutter and Stick and Chase. And Stutter and Stick says something fun. It said, I feel like it purposefully stream against my viewing schedule. I know. Uh, <laughs> stuff came up today. Prevented me from starting earlier. I'm go ahead and unplug this here. And I'm going to put this here in the back. Damn it. There we go. All right. What do we have here? So, yeah, the climatic is here. Yeah, it's a bit of a late one. Usually, I'll just say fuck it and don't bother, you know. Uh, it's 8.15 here, my local time, p.m. Uh, but I figure, you know, it's a, it's a ROM hack that we're playing today. So, uh, this week, I was showing a lot of new consoles, and I had more consoles to show. So, I did the Sega CD first time ever. Uh, Atari Jaguar uh, yesterday, first time ever. Uh, there was uh, another one. Oh, Dreamcast the other day, first time ever. And today, although this is not a new console, I played the Super Nintendo here plenty. Uh, this would be my first time, either on YouTube or Twitch, playing a full blown ROM hack. All right, before I did uh, little improvement hacks because I like them. Uh, for example, when I played Castlevania, Super Castlevania 4, I had a fast ROM, uh, sort of a hack as an improvement hack, if you're going to call it that, uh, uncensoring, so not changing the the base game. So this here, it's a Super Mario World hack, but it, it doesn't resemble Super Mario World. I mean, of course, Mario and all that. He's not wearing a hat. It's quite unique. I played many years ago. Uh, when I was into hacks, so I already played the vanilla game here, completed, as a matter of fact. Got out 96, right, the little star in there. So that opens the floodgates for me to play ROM hacks, which is something I really look forward to. I love being able to play ROM hacks on real hardware. is one of the main appeals for me when it comes to flashcards. It's excellent. Stutter and Stick is making tacos today, and the cowboy <laughs> looks gooder. <laughs> Good shit, man. Good shit. Tacos are awesome. I bet you, I bet you, you, you cook some good tacos. Uh, I learned my wife here how to cook it. I used to uh, hang out with a, a lot of Mexicans back when I lived in Florida, uh, and then some Cubans. And yes, I know the difference. Uh, you know, some people go, "Oh, you mean Cubans?" No, I mean Mexicans. There were Mexicans in there. So Mexican Cubans. Um, I dated this chick from Nicaragua and lived with her family. Uh, because I rented a, a, a room in a trailer, uh, you know, and her sister owned it. So, yeah, whatever. Uh, they had some good stuff too, good food, Nicaragua, you know, good stuff. A lot of uh, plantains and stuff like that. Awesome. Uh, yeah, and, and Mexican food is, is good stuff. Chase says they got some cherry coke. God damn it, I love cherry coke. We got some here, generic, it's not Coca Cola, but. Damn it, it's good, you know. It's, uh, I think it's Pepsi. I think it's Pepsi. I think so. I can't remember. I think it might be generic. Either way, it's damn good. I love Cherry Coke. Here's a trick for you. One Cherry Coke. Don't have Cherry Coke. You have maraschino cherries. Use that juice. Put it in there a tiny bit. Boom, you got yourself good Cherry Coke. Works, works every time. You know, I love mar anything cherry. You know, it's funny. I don't actually, I don't dislike, but when I eat, cherries like the actual fruit i don't find them as a, appealing to me you know they're not like on top there for me with, on my favorite scale uh, but uh, candied glazed cherries maraschino cherries good good shit you remember the scooter everything is a coke that's true because <laughs> that's why i said coca-cola because that'll be, you know, make a distinction yeah, for me. Everything's Coke. So if I was, I'd, I have this here, Tropical Crush Coke. But if I tell a, 
somebody from out there, a Yankee or European, somebody else, you know, they'll, they'll go like, what the hell are you on about? That ain't no Coke. Because I reckon for them it means Coca-Cola. So, yeah, Coke is just a generic word for for the damn drink that has more names than Satan himself, you know. Fucking soft drink, fizzy drink, pop, soda, soda pop, soft drink. I, I, I think I already said there's it's a lot of fucking names. <laughs> it's funny. Oh, I still got the fucking overlays here. Well, I guess the stream hasn't. It has started. Or has it? Let's see. So, but I, listen, I corrected my time more or less. It's just today I was busy during the day. And I couldn't get it done, you know, earlier. Stuff comes up, you know. We homeschool our kids. We have things going on. So I try my best to be here every day. And I, I've been doing an okay job of it. A day missed here and there. Uh, yesterday, the Atari Jaguar was quite tough because I, I was a red light. And I came in here and the fucking thing would drop the red collar. It wouldn't work. And I almost had to give it up. So I'm here fiddling with it for literally an hour. You know, with a toothbrush cleaning the contact with isopropyl alcohol and the damn thing just wouldn't budge. And then finally I got it. I was able to start. But yeah, sometimes it's hardware problems. It's all real hardware. Uh, so sometimes they fail on you, you know. I'm going to get my tobacco ready. Now, what 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 the hell is called a Cthulhu here? Uh, well, this is a... It's kind of, a, it's not spooky, I mean, for fuck's sake, it's Super Mario World, right? But it does have an eerie atmosphere. It's, uh, I never, I never read the, uh, the novel. Uh, I'm not very cultured. I, I haven't, I don't think there's any need for me to, I, now I read a lot like Wikipedia and shit on the internet. I, I like reading them. Uh, you know, I'm not a hundred percent dumb, but, uh, you know. I'm not a master of uh, literature, you know. So if you if you tell me, I know that is the Cthulhu thing is a book that a fella wrote. I've, I already forgot his name, uh, but you know, is there? If you read it, you're probably gonna get a lot of the references that uh, it is mentioned here. But if you're a stupid fuck like I am, then you uh, you know, it's just ooh, Mario does funny things. And oh, look at this thing. And half of the names here I probably won't be able to pronounce. There's some weird names. Even Cthulhu, I would have struggled with it if I if it wasn't for the South Park episode. I know Cartman hung out with Cthulhu. So <laughs> that's my extent of it, of the knowledge. Okay? I read a lot of Stephen King. That's about it. You know? I think the biggest book I ever read was. Uh, What's it called? By Leo Neuris. Tr Trinity, I think it's called. It's about Ireland. Okay? It's a very Irish uh, book. So I remember it's like 800 cent pages of fine print. So that took me a, a long time. Okay, so we're using here. And that's the only way you get your play this on real hardware. I'm using here the um, FX Pack Pro. It's a flash card, rum card, whatever you want to call it. And it allows you to do a lot of things. We'll dive deeper into it later on. Okay. And, uh, yeah, let's jump in. I think that's let's experience. Now, I played this a long time. Oh, I want to mention this beforehand, before I get started here. I do need to, I don't know why I'm grabbing a controller. I need to watch the intro here and have that. I need a thumbnail, by God. Uh, I played this twice. I played one time. I can't remember, man, if I finish or not. But let me tell you, there's a version of this hack. So the guy that created it, he withdrew it. it he, he, he didn't want anything to do with it. It took down the link and everything. And then some some of those patches, which are 100% legal, by the way, Nintendo can touch it. Patches don't contain their IP, right? So you provide the ROM. It's, you know, you do your thing. So patches uh, are 100% legal. Not that it matters that much. I mean, come off it, you know, but I'm just telling you. Anyways, the, there was one patch. So you have to collect those cat statues. And one patch was broken because one of them was missing. So I went out of my way to try to find one that the people say is fixed. And they mentioned in the comment, but the guy didn't seem that confident. So if I get to the end and 
it happens should be that ROM, I won't be able to finish a game. Okay? So I'll have to stop. Now, there's one thing I'm a little concerned about. It says this game encourages safe states, so I can't remember how hard it is. Okay? But let's uh, dive right in. Uh, I already started the game. Obviously, I got to adjust the audio and everything. So I call it Cthulhu. Let's go, and I'll be quiet for the intro. Okay, don't worry about this part being loud. I tested with the actual game and it wasn't as loud. Uh, we got Commodore Crash. Good to see you again here, sir. Uh, saying Call of Cthulhu, Super Mario World, Calor. And I'm just picking. <laughs> Caller me intrigued. Uh, Stutter and Sick got the beer out. Awesome stuff. Uh, I ran out. I, uh, I drank it all. It's over. I do have half a bottle of, uh, so half a liter of whiskey here. But I'm not drinking today because I drank earlier. So, you know, I drank off camera sometimes. Uh, so, yeah, this is a very interesting hack. It's one of the most, it's not a crap hack. It's not a Kaizo Mario, none of that shit. So this is this guy here. And I I, I know there's a bit of an overskin here. And when you play NTSC on PAL TV, sometimes the image is shifted here. And even if you go inside, which I did, and go all the way here, sometimes still missing. So what I'll have to do, I don't know why I didn't, something prevented me from doing it. I have to go over just a pot, try to make the image a little smaller, but then it stops here at some point, you know? It's not like a VGA monitor. Out of interest, did you ever play Time Crisis on the arcade? Is that, from memory, is that a shooting game that you have a a certain time the shoot thing is a shooting game right with a cabinet with a with an actual light gun am i correct if so then yes if it's not that then i'm sorry then no okay so yeah this game is it's interesting man rum hacks you know uh you play super mario world you're tired of it there's a gazillion rum hacks a lot of them are crap but there's a lot of good stuff too Light gun game, yeah, I did. I remember that game. I remember the name and I remember the looks of it when I was a kid, a teen, back in the 90s, I did play. Can we test your patience with Kaizo? Eventually, eventually. I did play it before. My patience was very thin with it, uh, to be honest. Uh, some insane stuff, right? I like, Kaizo Mario's is the kind of thing I like to watch, but myself, I, I, I guess if it's Super Mario World, I guess, I guess someday I might might do a, like a try different ones. I do a variety Kaizo stream, right? All right, let's jump in here. Come, come, come. Mario's deep asleep now, yet he feels completely awake. <laughs> Begin. Well, how that game worked, you had to press a foot pedal to emerge. Yes. And they ported the game to a PS1. They never made a pedal for it. Uh, so I just made one. Well, I, I know a fellow who'll be very happy with it. There's a friend of mine on YouTube. He does similar stuff to what I do here with the CRT, actually. I strongly recommend his channel. His name is Subtor, S-U-B-T-O-R-R. -R. Or if you just go on my page on YouTube, you'll see the recommended channels. 
outstanding feller, right? And uh, I believe he played that game and he would touch the controller with his feet to simulate the pedal. Okay? Now, I gotta say, I remember the game. I remember what it looks like because I've seen him play, so I remember from the arcade, but I don't recall the foot pedals, so maybe I only saw it and didn't play it then. I think that's probably what happened. I was fucked back as a kid because I didn't have the quarters. It was very rarely, and when I had quarters, straight to Mortal Kombat. So for me to get a couple of quarters and go to a different machine, it was a very rare thing. I think maybe Primal Rage and Killer Instinct. All my quarters, when I, whenever I had them, which was a rarity, it would go to Mortal Kombat immediately, nothing else. So I don't think I played that game back then, but I saw it. I remember the, the cabinet and, and the game on the screen. So there was a lot of arcade cabinets, right? It's pretty cool. There's a work to trim down a PS1 controller circuit board and put it inside a foot paddle about, wired one. The buttons momentarily... I find that awesome. I like it. It's kind of like... Um, not on that magnitude, but when I make my uh, arcade sick, it's my own shit. I like to make, you know, uh, custom things like that. I find it outstanding. Well, well done, sir. Well done. Uh, I'll mention that to Subtor next time I see him. Let's go on the video there, mention. I want a fella that made a paddle out of, uh, you know, but that, some people might not be handy with, with stuff. It's just nothing. After countless millennia, the time has finally arrived. Receive our tribute and wake up, O oh great master. Someone, please help me. Now what's with the voice? I just... Let's see, the shores of Relia. <laughs> so that's the game. Goombas, they look a, a bit fucked. Uh, look, this is not just going to be... Uh... It's coming here. They, they don't come out of the shell, so you want to be careful. They do come back. Can I get this? Yeah. Oh, fucking. Ah, should have let him go there. Damn it. There you go. So you got to get the, the cat statues. And let me tell you, I want to make sure... Oh, yeah, somebody done... T my book is gone, motherfucker. Okay, wait a minute. So my book is now this package. So I'm going to write down cat statues. I'm going to just put a mark here. I want to know how many I got because I want to know if one was missing. So every time I get a cat statue, I'm going to pause the game. And that's it. I can beat a, a whole house from the ground up, <laughs> but not a foot pedal. Yes, everybody has their trade, right? It's uh, it's interesting. You know, I I up. I like uh, shit. Okay, what the fuck? So this is obviously what is it called? The check and charge, charging check. Now, ah. That was a dick move. Come off it. I think instead of... Look, I can't remember. This might be difficult. The FX Pack Pro has, I think, if you get a third-party um, firmware, which I do. This is the one, right? This, this part here, it bothers me a bit because, uh, you know, there's a way of doing... Safe stage on the on the FX Pack Pro. I'm pretty sure of it, but uh, but I haven't figured it out. Now this game, I wouldn't feel bad to use safe stage because the guy the guy made it. He even encourages you. So of course, is a, a lot of trial and error, right? So it's made with a safe stage in mind. That being said, I would probably prefer then instead of making safe stage, if I was to be the one doing this hack. I would have given you infinite lives. I think that would would have the same effect. Because I don't want to use motherfucking save stays, but I, I don't even know how. I never actually looked it up how to do it here. But if it's like uh, impossible and the game is built around the idea of save stage, then I might have to see if it's, it's possible. I think it is. And see how I would do a save state here. 
uh, you know, if the game is built with safe states in mind. Can I? I always like to do this. Stuttering Six says, come saver? Never. But if a game is built, because I, I know some games that are built with safe states in mind, and the game says they encourage it, right? So I wouldn't, of course I would use it. It's either that or I end the stream because I can't do it. So, <laughs> you know, but I, I, let's see how far we go. I, I think uh, Infinite Lives would have would have been the same thing. And Commodore Quest says, and there's a timer here, so I got to be careful. Uh, the first... I first got into retro games through console modding, and so I learned to solder my interest. Grew, grew, when, when you learn to solder, me too, I didn't know soldering a few years ago. When you learn soldering, how would I... A little bit of a slow down here. When you learn to solder, yeah, because a lot of people, they, they don't want to do it. Ah, okay, I see. A oh, holy fucking slow down here, my friend. Ooh, I would have died there. When you learn to solder, it opens a lot of doors for you. So... I should have gone that way, right? There's gonna be a trick here, or no? Just... What in the fuck? Ah, uh, bit disappointed with a slow down here, kind of bit. Not too much, it's okay. Another cat statue. Ha! And that's another one for the records. But the problem, if I die a lot here and have to keep redoing it, then I probably won't bother. Because that'll be horrible. Yeah, when, yeah, but Southern Sick, when the game tells me safe states are encouraged, but I, I don't know if they're being, like, exaggerating it, or if it's possible. Uh, like I said, I would... Oh, fucking hell. Look at how cool it looks. It looks very cool here. So some kind of goo place. Goo times. <laughs> it's American dad. Okay, the... Ah! I'll kill you, you motherfucker. God damn it, there's always an asshole. Get out. Fucking, I got a new one here, but I would have had two of them. Let's see how far we go. You know? Let's see how far we go. Something down there? What in the hell? Oh, we dead. But we still talk. You find totems. You press up in front of them. We share knowledge. Alright. Now I see the, the bats, motherfuckers. Come on. <laughs> Alright, there's a totem. There's a new cat. And then I, I think I'll just remember how many here per stage. I hope I don't have to fucking use safe saves. Uh, again, I prefer not to. They, they bother me. Just give me infinite lives. If you're gonna make the game like... I don't know if this is a Kaiser Mario. I don't remember being that, that difficult. Collect gaunt tokens. Gaunt tokens preserve sanity. We not learn these. We die of madness. Cool, cool. Ah, yeah. Oh, got a life here. Gotta be careful because they do come back to life. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna trust the coins here. What the fuck's like a... Ah! Bastard! Up here, definitely. Let me see what's in here until I figure this whole thing out. Oh, I'll need him. Come. Come back to life. Rise. Rise. Rise again. Ah, fuck. Die, motherfucker. Shit, I forgot about the fucking timer. All right, let's speed this shit up. Speed this up. Damn you. I don't like timing those old games. I don't know why they bother. Four, just to memorize it. Let's go. Go, otherwise it means nothing. Uh... Okay. I'll mark down four. Lucky can jump here. No Euclidean path. So I know that's a book reference. I play Planet Mario. But what is the purpose of points if you 
A lot of, if you cross a finish, you vet after crossing a finish. You mean like the, uh, uh, like the little bar thing? Okay, write them down. I think if I recall correctly, it's supposed to be 27 statues. So we got five. Maybe the game uh, allows me to continue here. That, that'll be good. Well, on Super Mario World, when you have... But the points here that you have in here, they're garbage. They don't do anything. It's uh, a lot of stuff like Game Over sometimes. The music is awesome. You will recognize a lot of the music. A lot is from other games. Very cool. Yeah, the guy made a hell of a hack here. It's it's very good. Oh, need every coin I can get. But the, if you talk about like the points at the end of uh, Super Mario World, uh, when you get your 99, and I'm sorry if you already know that, look how good it is in foreground, you will get a bonus and you get a chance to get more lives. Okay, but up. Oh, look at this shit. Ah, uh, ah, you fucks! You can't kill the, that shit. Damn it! And I fucking kill him. Okay, let's ride it now. I'll just say the number out loud, no fucking way I remember. Pawns are tied our coins. Damn it, I could have... <laughs> no! Fucking every time! You fucking freaks, I'll kill all of you. Oh god, I hope... Mm. I hope it's not like dick move city here, like, oh, you jumped and now we can go back and there's a cat statue up there because I'll be fucking annoyed if that's the case. Oh! Is that... Oh, look at this. Okay. There's a lot of creativity here, you see it. Push block, make high platform. Block's good on acid too. Ah, there we go. Look at this shit, huh? Good stuff, good stuff. Ah! Damn it, you doofus, you fell for it. Ah! No! Bitch ass. God damn it. Oh, all the way from the beginning? No fucking... Holy shit! Yeah, I get it now. Uh... Oh my goodness, this is brutal. Why though? Just give me fucking checkpoints. So my first gripe with this game, shut up about the fucking save states. All right, uh, make it give give checkpoints. Like what's wrong with you? You know, there there we go. Already, already uh, having a little problem here because you should you should have ju just have checkpoints. Stop being an asshole. I guess it came in a time, 2012, right, that you wouldn't play, but even if you're not playing on real hardware, it's like, just give checkpoints instead. I mean, the guy programmed all this shit here, he could have done checkpoints if he wanted to, instead with the stinky ass save states. Ah, fuck you, man. Ah, bullshit! I fucking, I follow the coin. I don't, I couldn't see down there. This is fucking brutal, yeah? Uh, so yeah, there's no fucking way I'll finish this game, I don't think. Yeah, I encourage safe state. I encourage you to add checkpoints. If I, if I had to know how, I would. Uh, just checkpoints are enough. Checkpoints are limited lives. If you're making your, your, your game extra difficult, so you could have done that. Fuck you. You could have done that. You know, I think it works a lot better. Not to to throw shit at a guy. I mean, he did make an amazing hack here, but hey, I'll complain and bitch him on about it just the same. If there's stuff I don't like, why not? Ah, fuck you, man. 
Like the fucking jump is a bit awkward. Yeah. Uh, you know what? I won't use save states. I don't want to. It's stupid. Uh, and I do have a plan B if things go to shit here. There's another hack. It's kind of short. It's called El Maniero Spetrale. I think it's uh, the Haunted Mansion. It's Italian. It was made by Italians. Won a competition. I do have it here. It's a... Uh, oh. Let's jump from here, man. There we go. It's a similar vibe, but it's, uh, I think it's a bit shorter and it's with uh, Luigi. Let's go down here. There we go. Because I think this game is going to be quite brutal. I mean, no checkpoints, you know? I don't like that. I don't like games with no checkpoints. It's. Fuck off. Ah, you f. God! Parasite! Die, motherfucker. Oh, there's a lot of slow downs. Oh. The fuck? What was that shit? What was that about? Ah. That's just the first stage. Can't listen to the time. Time has finally come. Yeah, whatever. Uh, Stuttering Stick says, just a question, will you play, would you play a sports game? Only curling. I'm secretly Canadian. So, that'll be the only sport. It's the only sport you need. Curling, and that's it. Don't, don't ever request anything else. It'll be curling. Don't like it? You can go straight to hell. Uh, no, of course not. I barely even understand curling. Uh, I love football. I love NASCAR. And by that you mean sh no football? If I want to mean if I mean soccer, I'll say soccer. Uh, I could play a soccer game sometimes. I played soccer when I was younger. Uh, let me see. Um, I love hockey. I'm talking about sports I, I like. Now playing video games on them. That might be something else. Oh, uh, we got a new uh, follower here. Pupuzas. Thank you very much. And on that note, hi there. How, how goes it? You all right? Thank you very much for following. I hope the sound played out okay with a, like a Super Nintendo jingle. That's right. I'm going to change the jingle every time, that, depending on the console that we're playing here. So usually the boot sequence, but the Super Nintendo doesn't have uh, boot sequence. However, I did look up and some people imagined it, that it would sound like that, and it sounds cool. Pupuza says, no problem. Thank you. And uh, on that note, Fighter Peep yesterday, 16 hours ago, follow me too. Adnan, I already thank him, but thank you again, Adnan. Uh, I appreciate it. So yeah, uh, sports, right? I can see me playing a football game, but I'm I'm a college football guy. Uh, NFL is okay, but I prefer college. Uh, I know there's a college football game that was a. a I used to be a lot into college football. Um, you should watch it a lot. Lost track here because there's no way I can get it here. I used to be able to, but lost track of it. Uh, I don't hate the NFL. I just prefer college. There's a college football game on the PS1 that's definitely going to be played. Um, don't go that way anymore. Uh, NBA Jam is awesome. Be playing that, of course. <sighs> and then just down here, right? Hockey, NASCAR. Um... Dilby Racing Games, uh, my favorite, I just bought, I, I bought a game today, really happy to, that I already sort of had, uh, I used to like Formula One, nah, fuck you, I'm not getting me this time, you fuck, 
Okay, so there's this racing game called... Let me answer here, so... NCAA? Definitely NCAA. We're playing that. I love college football. Um... Yeah, we already read that. Wrestling, yes, fuck yeah, a lot of fucking hilarious, awesome uh, wrestling games, so... Definitely. Why am I counting? It gives me the, the number here. Huh. Yeah, wrestling games are cool. You know, there's some good ones and some very bad ones. There was a wrestling game that came with my Sega CD, because I bought the Sega CD broken. How did I... Oh, okay. Oh. And yeah, there's a life here, so I suppose if you make this far, you can always recover. There's a wrestling game that came, I forgot the name, with my Sega CD, and it's just complete fucking ass. It's terrible. It's a terrible thing. Oh, ho, 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 ho. We're wrestling, brother. <laughs> yeah, I like wrestling. Uh, is there a wrestling game with Big Boss Man? If anybody has a disposition, look it up. Is there a... Is there, so obviously it would be a retro game by now, by today's standards, but is there a wrestling game with the big boss man? If you ever take a trip down to Cobb County, Georgia, you better read the sign, respect the law in order to do some hard times. Ah, <laughs> man. Big boss man. Ah, fuck off, you fuck. Macho Man Randy Savage. Fuck yeah, I like him too. The Undertaker. I used to like John Cena, but he uh, he's a sellout now. Not to get political political here, but John Cena, am I right? <laughs> I apologize. Taiwan is in the country. <laughs> and now, what the fuck is John Cena doing there in Mortal Kombat 11 with a, a piss pot on his head? What the fuck is that? Is that what superheroes? I'll be very embarrassed if a superhero come to my house looking like that. It looks like you went to a hospital and he was short of ideas for a, cus a costume and he just got one of those uh those aluminum piss pots that they keep under the the beds right and he put on his head and then he, he became a guest in uh, sorry mortal kombat 12. so southern steak looked it up n64 has big big boss man will you will you mind writing down the name of the game uh, uh for me there southern steak i saved the chat so i can take a look at it Papuza says, I like the OG Super Mario for the NES and Banjo-Kazooie for the N64. Both lovely games, Papuza. I, I, uh, I did the OG Super Mario here um, before I stream, but it, you'll be on YouTube. Uh, it took me four tries to do without. Is the last Hammer Bros, right? It's a fucking asshole. If you get there without the flower power up, you're kind of fucked. You know, because you gotta, you gotta go under him or over him, and then jump. And there's fireballs in the battle. So I got there small every fucking time, and that's what fucked me up. There you go, Big Boss Man games, excellent. WrestleMania challenge, NES. There's NES, and oh, there's NES. All the games is in. Awesome, thank you, man. Yeah. Papuza says, Mortal Kombat 1 is awesome. I love it. I've been playing for 30 years. See, that's the kind of shit that's going to happen. That's the kind of shit I'm talking about. So, obviously, I'm assuming he's talking about Mortal Kombat 1, as in Mortal Kombat 12, the new one. Right? Because they call it Mortal Kombat 1, which is the dumbest shit I ever heard in my life. It really grinds my fucking gears. So, But is he? He might be talking about Mortal Kombat 1, the 92 one that I play here all the fucking time. Uh, either way, both are awesome, I guess. So I, I, I don't know. I haven't played a new one. It looks awesome. Uh, I want to say what's the uh, the scummy bullshit with the uh, that they did with Mortal Kombat 11. All the crap coming out from Injustice. All the the fucking currency, the online crypt, all that shit. Want to see it more? Ah, uh, whatever. You know. Uh, Mortal Kombat 9 is the best Mortal Kombat ever made, in my opinion, and also fact. But the Mortal Kombat 1, I was going to pre-order, then I didn't. So that's how we went down. Oh, I was talking about some games. I'm going to have a fucking break here. We, we, we have time. Tiny break, right? I started like, what, five minutes ago? <laughs> so, yeah, great work, Chase. Yeah, thank you, Chase. I appreciate it. 
Injustice is online crap, so delayed. For me, Papuzas, uh, Injustice is a, a pile of dung heap, garbage. I hate Injustice and I hate superheroes. I say out loud here, because people might follow, oh, play Mortal Kombat, play Injustice. It will never fucking happen. I despise Injustice, I poop on it, and I hate that fucking game and franchise. Leave your dislike if you disagree, and you can take it, and get the fuck out of my fucking face, because I hate that game, I'll never play it, I resent it. I despise a fucking game. It's like a tumor in a Mortal Kombat franchise. I, you should be, there used to be a time that I played Mortal Kombat and I didn't have to hear about fucking injustice every two seconds. You know? But of course, I'm not talking to you, Papuzas. You're welcome to say your opinion here. When everyone's more of a YouTube thing. You can't talk about a game in there and people... Nee! <laughs> like, I got more dislikes on uh, the Super Castlevania 4 uh, playthrough. And I know why. It's because I said I prefer Bloodlines. So how dare you? How how dare you not, you know, worship Super Castlevania 4? I like the I like the game. I'm not gonna suck his dick. He's just not doing it. It's a great game, but I prefer Bloodline. Sorry, my fucking personal opinion, you know? I'm not gonna change my personal opinion, though. Your fucking dislikes mean nothing to me. L leave them on. Soul Calibur is awesome, Papuza's uh, zero chance of that not being played here. Uh, Soul Calibur, I actually, mm, I don't think I ever played the game, but I'm very, I'm just looking at it, what I heard of it, but looking at it, um, it's awesome, and I will definitely play the guest characters, come off it, like Spawn, Link, of course I'm going to play that game. That game is fucking awesome. It's just Injustice, I resent Injustice first, I don't like superheroes. I, d I dislike him. I, I don't like him. I like the villains, all right? Don't don't care about superheroes. I, I don't like it. I don't like, and it, it it's so oversaturated now that it made me hate him even more. The problem I had with Injustice is that all the crap, the new crap that a lot of people don't like, but they stay quiet about on Mortal Kombat, the mobile game sort of bullshit, the, you know, the pay to win, the currency, the garbage, the modern garbage in there. I know for a fact that all came from Injustice. Now, when I decided to look up where it came from, there's people that made videos complaining about it. Uh, but either way, I hate Injustice, so that, that will never happen. Uh, um, huh. Midway presents War Gods. I had that game as a kid, Papuzas, and I still play it. Sci-fi. What, what's the other guys? Tech. Vala. Let me see if I remember the rest of it. Voodoo. Aukin. Uh, Maximus. Maximus is my guy. You mean nothing to me. <laughs> and, and and how about when he wins and he goes? And that's how he talks. I kill you and I take your power. It sounds like fucking Arnold Schwarzenegger or something. <laughs> uh, yeah, your voice really announced this photo. I played that game to death and I still play it. I'm not a master with the combos, but I'll be playing. I'm more familiar with the N64 version. Uh, I never played the arcade one. Uh, that would have to happen once I get a mister. I'm not sure how emulation. A lot of arcade emulation is bullshit. Don't believe me? Go look up uh, Mortal Kombat 4 arcade emulation. It's not very good. So I would rather have mister. I don't know if they'd have War Gods on the mister. But if there's good emulation out there, I will look into it. But I'm more familiar with the, with the, um, with the N64 version. Yeah, I play the PlayStation one as well. <laughs> but the, it's not a tumor. <laughs> uh, good shit. And Chase asks, uh, God, God of War arcade by Techno on Arcade Jamma has Big Boss Man. But then, what? Well, I have to have the PCB, right? I'm not buying arcade PCBs. Is it on the Mister? Declimatic says. Arcade is a bit difficult right now. There's a reason. I play some arcade emulation. Mortal Kombat, uh, God of War, God of War 1 and 2, of course. Uh, here's a confession. I never played God of War. <laughs> Crazy, right? It just didn't happen. So it'll be, it'll be my first time ever. You'll be here on stream. Yeah, never play uh, God of War. I told you I missed out on the PS2 for, for the most part. Uh, that generation. I, I really, I wasn't a gamer then. What is Mister? It's like emulation. No, uh, it's... Sort of, it's hardware emulation. So instead of emulating on software, uh, it emulates the hardware. A lot of the flashcards have FPGA emulation. I believe that is closer to uh, 
to real hardware. I mean, they actually reverse engineer all the arcade cabinets. They got Santa PCBs, right? Uh, it is very good. If you go look, it's more accurate. Uh, they'll say, no, it depends, a different kind of accurate. And, uh, you know, you open a whole can of worms. There's a lot of people are passionate about software emulation. And I think they have the right to be as good. Uh, but from what I've seen, it's more close to... For me, there's one draw, draw to the mixture that is it's just a lot easier uh, to connect to a CRT and have the, the real experience. I, uh, software emulation, uh, I don't have any reason to lie. I tune out from it. I bought a lot of consoles, so I tend to be in, in a flashcards. And, but if you are into a real hardware playing on CRTs and you have no lag and none of that, uh, you might look in a mixture. You would certainly replace most of your consoles. Do they have any S? SNES Arcade. Arcade is the main draw for me because I have an, a Super Nintendo right here and a Nintendo, so I don't need it for that. But Arcade is the big the big appeal. Uh, and I'll play here as I talk. The big appeal for me uh, of Mr. is the Arcade. Very accurate uh, Arcade. But listen, I play a lot of uh, emulated Arcade and I was fine. Play Ghostbusters, the Alien games. So Let's say I don't get a mixture here for a long time, then I'll look into having a PC here. The plan is as, as following, to fit the format here, is I upgrade a PC in order to to do video editing. At the time I was doing 1080p editing for YouTube, but it's still use, useful. Sometimes if the, the VODs are muted, I download them, it's fucked. And what I do, I have to download the VOD, which I do in any ways for my personal records, right? I take pride in what I do here, so I wanna I wanna keep track of what I what I play, the, you know, and all that. So I download all my vods either way. Uh, but sometimes that the vods are, are missing audio, so I record the audio separately. It's being recorded right now as we speak. Fuck my my flower, motherfucker! You fuck, damn it! And so if the vod is muted, I reinstate the the audio. Uh, which I think is kind of bullshit. Twitch doesn't allow you to, when you export it to YouTube, to have the uh, the sound because then you know it's kind of a YouTube's problem. It's nothing here, goddamn you! There we go. Eat it. So let me just get this. Ah, there we go. Uh, so either way, going back to your conversation, I, can, I think I fucking forgot my, my point here. Uh, they do have those consoles. PS1 is coming, N64 is coming. N64 emulation a lot of times is not good. I usually use it a lot, so it's not bullshit. Maybe it come a long way now, but, you know. Uh, I could not get, uh, fuck you. I couldn't get CRT emu driver to work. I actually got it to work, but not at, uh, it, it, it just stuck with 480i. It does not want to do 240p, so useless for me. Uh, okay. Cool, cool. Ah, fuck. What's your favorite Mortal Kombat game? Mine is MK4. A lot of people don't like that game. I love MK4. It's because it's rough, I think. I love MK4. It's awesome. I love Mortal Kombat Gold on the Dreamcast. It's my favorite version of it. It has fast gameplay. I agree with you 100%. Funny fatalities and funny endings. Yeah, funny endings and is are funny. The dialogue. You quest for vengeance is over, Scorpion. <laughs> the, the battle is finished. Uh, what, Quan Chi's voice is awesome? What is it? Uh, I needed the powers of a specter. Scorpion! <laughs> and it gets sand. Look up Quan Chi's and then Mortal Kombat 4 and 64 is the best shit ever. Shinnok. It's a good game. I like that game. Yeah. It can be fucked and broken sometimes, but I, I love it. Richard DeVizio, yes. He is the guy. Yeah, he was in because I played Mortal Kombat uh, Mythologies recently. And it, but that's the point they stopped using all the real actors, though, yeah. My favorite Mortal Kombat, uh, if I'm speaking from the heart, I would say Mortal Kombat 2 is the greatest Mortal Kombat ever. But as I played it for, you know, about 30 years, I remember that I had a lot of fun playing against, against 
people, my cousins, my friends, and now all I'm, la I'm left with is the horrible, disgusting AI. We sure you can learn to exploit, I have, trust me, but it's shit. So for me, if I have to, so from the heart, Mortal Kombat 2, but if I'm speaking of, you know, for real, Mortal Kombat 9. Mortal Kombat 9 uh, is the greatest Mortal Kombat ever for me. Uh, it is perfect, you know, just in every, the character, the roster. Uh, it was before all the injustice bullshit came over with the fucking crypt online and all that shit. It is the best. I can't wait to play it here. I'll play the story mode. I will play arcade ladder. I'll play in many different occasions. I, I, but I want to go uh, gradually reach there. So I did the last Mortal Kombat 1 that I'll do for a long time on the Sega CD. Then I'll do Mortal Kombat 2. And, you know, and uh, Pupuzza says Mortal Kombat 2 AI spoop. But then there yeah, you have uh, Trilogy is also sh Ah, you fuck! Trilogy is also shit. Uh, the AI is garbage. Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3, Mortal Kombat 3, the AI is trash. Uh, your force should just spam combos all the time. AI, Mortal Kombat, Retro Mortal Kombat AI is garbage in general. Uh, even Mortal Kombat 4, right? I... You can't spam the whole game just going forward and doing the, the full combo. I play that game plenty. You, you won't lose a fucking fight doing that. <laughs> so funny, this shit. But if you try to play legit, it becomes a problem. That's a problem. With it. And I think Mortal Kombat 9 onwards, or even the, the 3D ones, they are chill. You can actually play the game. Uh, there's no input reading as much as the, uh, the old ones. There's some bullshit, like Mortal Kombat 9, let me tell you the bullshit about that one, that it, it grinds my gears a tiny bit. The whole, oh, you hit Shao Kahn, but he, he had this shield, the armor, right? And his, no, dude, ah! It's like, no, dude, uh, give him more health, make him harder, don't do the shield thing. It's fucking stupid. You fucking, you avoid the guy, you hit him, oh, fuck off, this game is gonna be fucked. Uh, and then, oh, he has a shield this time, randomly. It fucking drives me nuts. Mortal Kombat 3 has hor horrific, horrendous input reading. Yes, it's fucked. Don't, you know, Mortal Kombat 2, as bad as it is, I, I, it's, I feel more at home. I, I got, fuck off. Oh, no, I need it, actually. Sorry, I thought it was uh, trying to steal my fucking flower here. Mortal Kombat, you know... They start reading it. It's fucked. Retro Mortal Kombat AI is disgusting. When you play Street, when I play Street Fighter Two, oh man, fucking how Peter Griffin and we don't know like grinds my gears. I think that's where I got it from. Ultimately, I don't think that was an expression that I used until I saw that episode. You know what really grinds my? Oh, it appears I've been fired. You know what really grinds my gears? You America. Fuck you! <laughs> then they kick him out of the studio. <laughs> oh, shit. Com you, Commodore Crash knows it. Mortal Kombat 3, yeah. It's the same trilogy. Sometimes I want to play those games, and I, I like, I really, I'm really, I love the game as far as atmosphere and everything. And I constantly go, like, ooh, wouldn't it be nice to play? I, I should. It's kind of, yeah. Like this game here is grinding my gears a bit on the ooh, safe stage. Just the guy's gone. And I was gonna, he's not going to revise this, but I would persuade him to stick with checkpoints. Fuck off. Because uh, safe states, you know, oh man, this fuck off, you know? It's stupid. And safe states like that, see people using it and they get it. Oh shit. Ah, oh, yeah, thanks for taking my flower. Okay, asshole. Yeah, I think this game was gonna be like sending me to the fucking beginning of everything, huh? Fucker. What was the problem here? Is the guy, uh, you know, going through some rough times here, I think? It's just, you could have made it so I start from the second stage, you know, where I made it legitimately. Ah, so if you're quick, but you don't need that. Let me pause here catch up with the chat and if anyone feel the game the music of the game is low again with this shit is it sorry it's low 
I'm gonna see. Test in. Test in a bit. Okay, I'll raise the, the music then. A tiny bit. 14. Well, I'll, I'll wait for other people to say because it might be your advice. You can't go by the advice of one person because sometimes it's uh, your device or something wrong with it. Uh, see here? I think. It's like they already know you're about to do a jump kick. They know. They, they do input reading all the time. I know that game like the palm of my hand. And they do they do input reading. Uh, anybody else let me know about the audio. Uh, if it's okay. Which version of Mortal Kombat trailer is better? PS1 is 100%. I mean, the N64, missing characters. It, the sprites are not as good. The sound is muffled. Oh, they play it on a tournament. Yeah, because there's no loading times, which the loading times are not even that big. I love when people talk about loading times. I turned on my PS5 the other day. If you were here the other stream, I heard me moaning about it. I spend hours trying to get the fucking thing going. I can't get past the fucking age verification. It, it doesn't let me. Nothing works. Their math is a shit, and I don't understand it. Pretty sure I didn't need any of that shit on the PS4, so... So my PlayStation 5 sits there forgotten. I'm not fucking doing it. Maybe in the future. No, the, uh, I remember the, the first time I saw PS1. I was playing N64 in a sort of a LAN house. My family were demonic about uh, Mortal Kombat or games in general. So I would go to certain places where you could pay to play uh, by the hour. Sometimes. Uh, fall here. And I was playing probably Mortal Kombat 2 on the Super Nintendo, right? And I looked to my side and there's some those older kids here playing PlayStation 1, which at the time I was unfamiliar with it. And wouldn't you know, the game was Mortal Kombat Trilogy. And I remember exactly when I turned my head and I saw the character select screen. And the first thing I noticed was Shao Kahn, Kintaro, Goro, and Motaro. Uh... I, I pretty much came on the spot. I think it was the first time I ever came. And... Oh! Oh, that's it. So it's five per stage. Is that it? Yeah, so I became a man that day. And all I could think about was Mortal Kombat Trilogy. That's all I cared about from, from that moment on. Um... And Papus says, this, this rum heck is kind of creepy. It is. It is a bit. It, it gets creepy here. It really does. It's all like Cthulhu, this demon thing. <laughs> so look, my grab here, if I die, so if I could do a save state, I would do it here, right? This is a safe place. Since the game doesn't let me fucking save, doesn't give me a checkpoint, I would that and tells me you should use save states. The game literally tells you to use save states. So yes, I would. Oh, you said the other day, well, I'm not playing a fucking fucked up rum hack that day. You know, I'm playing a... And who cares? I don't have to justify it. If I, if I change my mind here and start using safe states, it is the way it is. It's unlikely, though. Not for, and It'll never happen, I can tell you that much. But it's because I said so, not you, you know? So I'm <laughs> trying to tell you. I'm, I'm the, the big mamu around here. So, but this game... I don't know, let's see how it goes, but it's kind of concerning, the game itself. Clay Fighters, 63 and a third. Yeah, for the N64, I, I had that game for the N64. Uh, I know there's one on the Super Nintendo and the Genesis. Ah! Motherfucker. But I haven't played... I think I played it. It's terrible. I don't like it. It's. I, I don't even like the N64 one. Ah, you fuck. Give me that. Go, 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 go. Fuck off. Where's the... I didn't kill the fucking... But I didn't kill it, dude. I want to know what the fuck is in there. Can I kill those motherfuckers somehow? No, they're just like, yeah, they're like, I know who they're re replacing here. So, come, bitch. Ah, <sniffs> you fuck. Come here. What the fuck? What the fuck can I Get in here, dude. Okay, I can't. One coin? Ah, you f Oh, my God. And back to the beginning, is that it? 
All right, this game is kind of horseshit. I mean, save fucking states. Pupuza says there there are two versions for N64. They look the same to me. There's an easy way for you to know what is different. Uh, the cutting room floor. There's a website called the cutting room floor, and they nitpick all the differences and also hidden things in the code, prototypes, all that sort of stuff. So, uh, TC rf.com i think and just type mortal kombat trilogy and n64 they will have one for the playstation as well like i looked up uh one time there mortal kombat mythologies and uh, i was surprised at some of the animes they canceled because i think they had to hurry up at the end or some shit uh, there were some genuinely creepy enemies there from the prison a guy without his head his head is floating around but it's cut fucking awesome shit and they cut it and i only know that because of uh the cutting room floor uh stuff like all right you go play ghosts and goblins the japanese or or the uh, american version uh and then you go to the cutting room floor and you you kind of sort of know what's the difference they mention oh you, your dagger goes a certain it goes faster or this and that and you know which one is the easiest one to avoid and do the hard shit like a man and uh you know the way it is. The Pusa said, thanks, no problem. The Cutting Room Floor is a good website. You find a lot of interesting information there. You know, recently there was a Castlevania Symphony of the Night prototype for the game, the Tiger Game Com. Or game.com. I have one here, believe it or not. I don't have a prototype though. You went for an absurdity. As it should, I mean, as one, a single fucking unit, right? And God damn it, did they do a commandable a t tattoo assassin's at is that a where is that is that on the jaguar oh we have is that the one that says that we have a gazillion fucking fatalities and there's a lady that farts there's some real crap shit out there i and i'll definitely play that here's another good fighting game that blew my mind uh eternal warriors for the genesis and then the sega cd that's a gory fucking game tattoo assassins is that's horrible, right? Uh, what is what is the the other one? Oh, I think there's one on the Jaguar. Why? I think it is Vortex or something. But there's a guy. I like how they copy Mortal Kombat, but not like oh, we can't say win like Sub Zero wins because they say that. So go there's a guy named Lucius. It's a, it goes like Lucius is victorious. <laughs> I thought it was the funniest shit ever. Fatalities are so long. <laughs> and that one I'm talking about also which one is the one that the, there's a Scottish guy named Angus and it's got like a his fireball he lifts up his kilt and then a fireball comes out he's got a fire crotch there's a Native American guy too like a fat Native American guy I'm trying to remember that game is that on the Jaguar or somewhere else I'm trying to remember that fucking game So I don't know, man. I'm playing a game that uh, tells me I have to do save states. I uh, had completely forgotten about that because it's been a long time. To be honest, if I had remember, I would have picked something else. Or learn to do the save states here. I'm sure there's a way, I think. I'm not even sure. And now the other uh, flag, because see, this year is not really Cricks, kind of, is Ikaru, I think, his name. And... Uh, yeah, look up uh, Angus fighting game Scottish. Then you probably find the yeah. I should do that from the get go here. I forgot. There's a oh, uh, I remember and I remember everything about it now. It just came back to my old brain. It's called Kasumi Ninja. Kasumi Ninja. And there's a guy. The the announcer has a very heavy Chinese accent. <laughs> it's very funny. Choose your fighter. And that's how he actually talks. Uh. It is, I think it is on the Jag. Uh, I played a bit. I want to get a real shitty game, like, uh... X-Men on the Hyperscan. Probably need the cards, though. I have the cards for the Bantan shit, and that, that's tomorrow, by the way. If it all works out, I'll be playing that crap tomorrow. You get to witness the true horror 
of the hyperscan. And for that, I got, oh, I got an alarm clock, finally. A Sony one. Nah! Ah, fuck off. Damn it. I hate fucking power-ups that fuck you up. I needed, why would I want a, a mushroom instead of the fucking fire flower, you stupid devon? Um. Wow, well, on, on the original game, you can kill him. Yes, you can, shut up. You shoot him enough time. Fuck you, bitch. Shoot him enough times. Oh, man. I think I have to throw... Mm, I have to throw the thing in the middle there. I wonder what's going to come out of it. Come on, dude. Yeah, but it's... I, I can't just do that. <laughs> My wife's out here laughing. What is that you're drinking as? Okay, let's see. What is that you're drinking? I saw a small portion of that bottle on the screen. And it kind of looked like piss. Necessary? Is it necessary for me to drink my own urine? No, probably not. Well, I do it anyways because it's sterile. And I, I like the taste. Uh, so yeah, it is piss. Well, you, you're telling me you don't drink your own piss, dude? It's like uh, recycling, you know. So why, why would you want to waste all that uh, down the drain if you can just drink it and then boom, uh, less money spending on Coca-Cola, more money in your pocket, more CRTs and more uh, retro games, dude. Fucking no-brainer. Sometimes I wonder, am I am I the only sane man alive that still drinks his own urine? Yeah. Everybody's out here drinking Coca-Cola and all the fancy drinks. All I need is some water and I got my own lemonade going on. Fooling you here, tropical punch. <laughs> so Monstar Zero, thank you for following. Right on time for the, uh, you know, the discussion we're having about if one should drink their own urine or not. I appreciate the, uh, choose, choose your fighter. <laughs> Kasumi Ninja. <laughs> I definitely play that game here, man. <laughs> the announcer, like, is so cool. And they do have, they do have a couple of ninjas. So I was immediately drawn to them. But my boy is Angus, the Scottish guy with a fire crotch, right? And they have fatalities and everything. I'm trying to remember what they, they have. I know, I know X-Man for the hyperscan. I think he has finishing moves because you say, and I like it again in the same line as Lucius is victorious. Instead of saying, you know, fate uh, is finish him, they go end it, <laughs> end it. Uh, it's funny all those copies are spruced up, and it's a pretty horrible game. I was gonna say I want to make a fucking arcade stick for the hyper skin and take and actually take the game seriously and come here and and do well on that game, just like. Make it like a life or death uh, situation. To do well on X Men for the hyper scan. Very cool. Very cool. Like unironically. It's like I got this here arcade stick. It's for the hyper scan or hyper scan compatible. I can do the swap. I just need a controller donor. Monster from Silverhawks. I think that's a villain's name. Commodore Crash, I love the, the alert sound, the gauze sound. Yeah. And then it plays the uh, jingle or whatever console I'm playing here. Yeah, I remember Silver, Silverhawks, yes. Sp Space, Space Jam, man, I haven't seen that. Didn't they make a remake? Probably shit all over it. <laughs> Fucking remakes. All, there's a bunch of shit on, on the old classics. Okay. Silver Hawks, man, I ain't heard of that in a long time. Okay, let's not fall here. Okay, how, how could I... F Did I fall there last time? Or was somewhere else? Yes! Yes! Okay, be more careful here, because there's no... There's no fucking continues of any kind. So the game is... If you came in here now, the game is saying you need to do safe... Ah! You fucking sack of shit. All of you die now. But Monstar Zero, appreciate your presence here. Same with you, Pupuzas. Pupuzas. 
It is a funny name, the name. It's fun to say, Pupuzas. Wake up, you fuck. What the fuck is that shit? Just sitting there. Okay, just... Ah! Carry this guy. Ah! Ah! I need this. Oh, it's a lousy coin, wouldn't you know? And why am I bothered here with that? <laughs> Sometimes I forget I know how to play this, you know, the original. Look at this shit. You know, this reminds me a bit of that uh, cursed uh, painting. Uh... Despair or something. It's supposed to be a curse. It has a, an image of a person screaming. I think I'm not very cultured. I think it was is that about a, a Swedish guy, some somewhere from Scandinavia, Danish. Uh better than our Kelly peeing all over. Now yeah, you gotta be you gotta be able to recycle. But in all seriousness, is uh is you talking about this year? God, if I was paying this yellow, hmm. I'll be, I think I'll be, you know, I'll get, I'll get myself tested. Nah, it's Tropical Crush. It's, it tastes like pineapple or something. Toa Chu, follow this mammoth. Glad to have you around here. Thank you. Thank you for following. I really appreciate it. It's just called The Scream. There you go. A person of culture now. The Scream. Yeah, it kind of reminds me, doesn't it? A little bit. You know, I think it's maybe supposed to be this year reminds me of uh, this year reminds me of the uh, space jockey from Alien, like the top part. All right. If you look at it, it, this looks like the trunk here. And this this reminds me of the screen. See, now I know. I haven't forgot about the favorite cartoon of all time. I'm thinking here what would be my favorite cartoon of all time. Yet no, t my wife says Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That's way up there, definitely. The uh, original X Men. I thought you said you like you just like superheroes. Yeah, it was back then, you know, and it was still more awesome than than the superhero movies of today will ever be. Let me think about that. There's uh, so many Rick and Morty is pretty fucking awesome. Not sure how I was gonna go without Justin Roiland's voice now, but whatever. It's not. It's going to fail miserably. Ah, Rick and Morty is pretty good, huh? Let's make a distinction like old and new. Let me let me think about Spider-Man is pretty good. Toa. Two says, Man of Taste, Reach or Reach. I watch Reach or Reach. Batman, Be Batman Beyond. I watch a Batman one. I watch The Tick. Uh, Freakazoid. What is that? Pinky and the Brain? Looney Tunes, Super Mario, Super Show, uh, Earthworm Jim. Trying to remember what else. There was a Donkey Kong 3D, so it's not really a cartoon, but it was sort of, right? I mean, it's not really a cartoon, but you know what I'm on about. I'm trying to remember other stuff. Of course, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, X-Men, uh, there was Spider-Man, uh, Justice League, and then it was all the reruns of Flintstones and... The Jetsons. Uh, Tom and Jerry is awesome. Oh, Tom and Jerry is good, man. Hey, hey, Paisano. Here's the Super Mario Super Show. Do the Mario just like that. Ba -ba -ba. And then a little, a little trip. You got to do a little trip and, you know. Kirby. Kirby, I, only, I got Kirby on VHS for my, my daughter. I made it myself, but I never came across Kirby right back at you. It is actually pretty good, and I'm not even that big on Kirby. I like Kirby. I don't hate Kirby. I'm not a monster. But I, uh, I'm i not gigantic on it like some people are. Uh, but the, the cartoon is, is pretty good. I like I like Chef Kawasaki on that cartoon. Eek the cat! Wow, man, I I heard that. Probably, probably the first time I heard that since then. Eek the cat. Doug, I think, is a Canadian cartoon. Uh, but I I had it. I watched it. Uh, Darkwing Duck. Yes, remember that. Weirdly enough, Batman Beyond. B Batman the, of the Future. But now you're reminding me. Back to the Future cartoon. Watch that as well. Dennis the Menace. Uh, God, so many cartoons back then. And then a cartoon network as I was beginning to get older. Uh, right at the end. You know, I don't like Pokemon. 
Never played a Pokemon game. Have no interest in it. I don't hate you if you do. We're cool. But I'm not playing it. Not into it. But I did watch the Pokemon cartoon, and that was pretty good back then. I liked it, which is funny. I don't really care for the games. Uh, Cow and Chicken, Dexter's, Dexter's Laboratory, and Johnny Bravo, I think, was right at the time I probably stopped watching cartoons. See, Ed, Ed and Eddie, uh, I had, I think, stopped watching cartoons. I remember my cousin, who was younger, watching that, though. Uh, DuckTales, ooh, uh, what's the one with the squirrels, the two squirrels, damn it, Feeble, Feeble, a narrow card, I see here, games based on cartoons, Flamestone games, Rocco's Modern Life, that one I don't know, that one, it might, it might be past my time, I'm 40 years old, just so clear, so I'm not a young man here, so I might have missed some of those. Yeah, the X-Men theme song was awesome, Monstar. That's true. And thank you, and hi, Shiro, and thank you for putting the announcement, because some people might not know that all my streams, they go to, they go to, uh, yeah, it's Feeble, not Feeble. No, Feeble, yeah. The, it's like a, it's like a Old West, but with, with uh, rats. Um, yeah. Rocco was made in the early 90s. I don't remember. I don't remember watching that one. You know, I was a kid in the early 90s. Uh, I heard of it, right? But I don't remember watching it myself. Brave... Oh, uh, He-Man. He-Man and the Masters of the Universe. And then later, my... I remember my cousin who was a girl. She like, oh, now they have She-Ra. Shira, Shira, bam, 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 bam. Shira, Shira, bam, 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 God, I, I love that show so much. This one doesn't move. Come here. Commit suicide. Don't you jump on my fucking head, you mother... God, I almost lost my cool there. Uh, look at this shit. Oh, this one is like... Oh, this is fucked. Look at that. It's like a human head. They got human head, the motherfuckers. Okay, I'm... What the f- How the fuck am I gonna- Get out of here, you freak. And this is like a head- Oh yeah, I gotta push the thing here. I'm trying to be extra careful. Here, and then I'll- I'll take a look at- Thundercats I tried to make in the- 2010. Captain Planet, I- <laughs> I, I watched that, and- uh, Nowadays I wouldn't. Uh, but I, uh, you know. I like the- the, the villains here. But it's- yeah, they- a hell of a message in there, right? So, Captain Planet, watch that. Yeah, they have the fire, the ring fire. There's a guy from the States. Then there's a guy from Africa. He is the Earth. Uh, is it? Yeah, Earth. And the lady from Russia, who's the... Uh, well, back then, I think it was Soviet Union, maybe. Um, and the guy from the States, the red-headed guy, the ginger man, he always trying to get with her. She rejects him. I think she had the power of wind. I can't remember the the there's a South American boy and he has the power of what was it talking to animals or something like he he didn't have the full power of the ring or something. There's the Asian lady too. Yeah, they had like every race, of course. Uh, nothing wrong with that. I'm just saying that's a fact, right? That's called a fact. Uh, they have like from every continent and every race, and the uh, the animals kept on planet to get sick often with pollution. Yeah. The theme song was so catchy. I can't remember the Captain Planet and the Planeteers, right? Huh. Heart. He was Heart. There you go. Toa knows. It's been forever since I thought about that fucking cartoon. Blast from the... Pe Inspector Gadget? Yes, I watch Inspector Gadget. 
<laughs> uh, it reminds me every time now, though, I think of Spe Inspector Gadget, I think of Mike Matei. Uh, Gummy Bears, Goof Troop. I watched those. I was very young then. Very young. Darkwing Duck, DuckTales. Chip and Dale. Thank you, Rescue Range. That's the one I was trying to fucking remember. Chip and Dale. Yeah. Watch that, too. Yeah. Those are some good cartoons. How come you ain't talking, bitch? Come on. Talk to me. Yeah, let's go push, push that in there. Uh, Y'all very culture with the cartoons. Good. It's a uh, good reminisce about those cartoons. They're good quality shit. Oh, I think I can lock myself in here. So let's be... That motherfucker disappeared. Right? Damn it. <laughs> I'm afraid of locking this thing here. Because I, I could make it as it is, right? I'm gonna... Out. Does it matter? Fuck it. Fuck it. Let's go. Because the time, dude. The time. Can I make... Oh, this guy. I want to... Don't disappear, scumbag. Okay, but I gotta be careful about dying here. <laughs> oh, I gotta die. Ah! Mother... Ah! Fuck! It's too risky. Fuck this shit. <laughs> Fuck off. No way. Yeah, but then... Oh my god, you fuck. How the fuck am... Oh, I gotta bring the block. Alright, fine. This might be tricky. There's a certain momentum to it. Uh, fuck off. <gasps> oh! Oh shit! Oh. Does that help? Yeah, it does. Those fucking turtles with the human skull are fucking bizarre looking. That's definitely influenced by the screen then. And see, leaving and learning that. Oh my god. I hate blind jumps. I mean, I know they have the coins, but do, do we trust it? How can I... Can I go down there or not? I can't... I think so. Oh, there we go. I want to be careful. Yeah, I have to move it. There's no... Let me out of fuck. Ah! Jesus. You motherfucker, you. Oh, I need him. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, bitch, wake up. Urgh! Shit. Okay, come down here. Urgh! There we go. Oh, yeah. Let's see here. Pupu says I can whisper you the link from YouTube. If you links are allowed here, put the link. Let me see what's going on here, because I, I, my chat is very tiny on a very tiny on one monitor. It's fucked. So sometimes some of the episodes are really dark. Let me see here. Oh, uh, let me see here. Uh, dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. Uh, Not the mama. I love that show so much. That show is awesome, and that one actually had some some dark episodes. But I'm see here. Uh, Powerpuff Girls. A little bit at the end there. I don't think I was no. I, I don't think I was watching cartoons anymore. I was too old for that. Beetlejuice, yes. Tailspin, Dexter's Laboratory is awesome. Ben episode. Oh, they did. They did Ben one. I really. I love that show. That show is awesome. I was watching actually as a grown ass man recently. I downloaded it and. Uh, Introducing my kids to some of those old shows. You think the Ninja Turtles movie is worth a watch? I resent what they did with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and y'all know what I'm talking about. The, the garbage one that they look like monsters. They look horrible. They look disgusting. Terrible. Terrible movie. Terrible. I hated a fucking movie. Horrible. Some of the episodes were really dark. Uh, oh, Courage of Cowardly Dog. God damn it, that's good. That was right at the end too, but I did watch that one. Thank God I was able to still catch that one. 
Eureka's Castle, lame. Fuck. <laughs> Dinosaur as well as live action. Come on, stop being nitpicky. Come on, Dark Crash. It counts. It's, we're, you know. When else are we going to have the chance to talk about that? <laughs> it's cartoons. It goes in. I, I changed, I banded, I banded the rules. I banned the rules. I banned your doofus. Can't even use banned in the past. Uh, it's, so cartoons and live action. There you go. The, the rules have been changed. With the, with the fellas yesterday here. Come on, our crash, the actually guy. <laughs> I hope you're taking good, you know, good humor, buddy. Uh, I still love Jenny Bravo has the best lines. Yes. I uh, just remember my favorite cartoon of all time. Uh, not the not what's coming up now. Uh, because I forgot. Now that I see it, Lois. Uh, Family Guy. I like Family Guy. It's the best cartoon. American Dad will be a close second. Just because I like the show, don't mean I like what's coming out now. I stop watching. To be quite frank with you, don't like. I don't like the new stuff. Uh, Family Guy. Family Guy is he. You are come on, Dark Crash. I can tell you are the actual guy. Like, actually, this is a live action. Like I didn't know. Like I didn't know it was a fucking not a cartoon. <laughs> what are you telling me? The, those are not hand drawn. I watched the whole show. I'm pretty sure I remember them being cartoons. Of course I know they're not. <laughs> they're not fucking cartoons. But it's a good show, you know? And the last episode is quite dark. And it was huge. It was huge back then. Everybody loved it that I know. Uh, not the murmur. Oh, even I know that dinos. They need to look it up, though. It is awesome. Yes. Scooby Doo that looked like Family Guy. The Scooby Doo that looked like Family Guy. What is, what is that one? The Scooby Doo that looked like Family Guy? I watch a lot of Scooby Doo. I don't know if I like it. I, I, I don't think I even liked it back then that much. I don't hate it, but it was a lot of the times I was bored because, you know, I got to understand when I was watching Scooby Doo and some of those old shows, they're very old. I can believe what they're uh, 60 shows. So some of them didn't didn't click with me. I did watch it a lot. I mean, I would watch it. I would sit down if it was on and, you know, what else am I going to do? And I would watch it. But, uh, yeah, I was not too big on it, to be honest. Uh, I preferred a lot. I was more enthusiastic with a lot of other. I know. I know right now is like a very popular. You know, I'm trying to get rid of this band in here, the color band in. Just give me a second. There's like a certain band in here with the collars. Yeah, I kind of did. It's a collar band in there. It's pissing me off with the light. It's under the table. Yeah, that's better. There's nothing more important than being technical or correct. Yeah, for you, I, I could see you think that. There's nothing more important than being technically correct. I don't know if you... If you... I feel like with that statement, if you're, uh, you had the Tenerife disaster, there was some miscommunication. Uh, I think if you're a pilot in a plane doing a life and death, I think that talking about cartoons is not really that important to be technically correct or the, at the expense, <laughs> at the expense of like, you know, it's, you could have just taken it, I guess. It's, it's, it's fine. You know? And I, I'm never like pissed off or anything here. Uh, and I'm, I've known plenty of actually guys. And you know, you recognize yourself, you are. Uh, but I, <laughs> I don't think it's that important. <laughs> okay. It's funny though. If you think that they made two episodes, I think, I know you're being sarcastic. So I know, uh, they made two episodes, uh, episodes of what? Which one? The Scooby Doo that looked like Family Guy. I know. Actually, can I change it? Uh, my favorite cartoon of all time, it's Velma. The modern Velma. There you go. That's the only right answer. Anybody who doesn't list Velma as their favorite cartoon, it's a racist piece of shit and a monster. And probably associated with, uh, I don't know, some terrorist organization. So, yeah. Velma is the greatest show I'll ever... <laughs> <laughs> no, I know come with dark crash. You, uh, I know you're being sarcastic. Sometimes my sarcasm can be mistaken as uh, hostility. Hostility. Uh, I assure you, if I'm being hostile here, uh, it's sarcasm. 
most likely. Okay? So they were clear. It's very rare for me to lose patience with people, with things. Yes, I get angry here. I, uh, but you notice I never break my hardware, right? So I, but with people now, I actually have a lot of patience. I'm not a pushover, you know, but I do have a lot of patience. Uh, oh, Ghostbusters, uh, the best movie ever is also Ghostbusters 2016. Is there even a question? I mean, come on. Of course, it's the greatest fucking movie ever made. Anybody who disagrees with that, it's a, a chauvinistic, sexist motherfucker. But you know what? No review. I refuse. <laughs> See who gets the reference. <laughs> 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 oh, my God. Uh, is the humor is terrible. Why not Velma? You're crazy. You can't say that. Uh, I like the nostalgia trip we're on here. It's good shit. <laughs> Velma. Message much? I think it's Velma. Uh, Velma? The, the, you know, the... Uh, movies I have, if you ask me, my favorite movie of all time immediately is Alien. Uh, Predator... Creator is awesome. All those, the mask is awesome. Uh, of course, the mask chew is the best. N no question about it. It invalidates the first movie. You don't have to watch the first movie if there's mask chew. It is right up there with uh, Ghostbusters 2016, obviously. Classic, instant classic. Don't you dare to berate that movie here. Uh, Shira says, even I die a little inside thinking there are people truly believe in this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the thing and yes I like the remake I think it was a shame uh, and I know it's stinky right but I think it's a shame that the guy made all the physical shit they had to drop it and uh, it sucks you know they went with the CG you know it could have been done but it was already done but I don't think it was a uh, Horrific. Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. And, and yes, and now that you mentioned, it was a cartoon uh, when I was a kid of the uh, Killer Tomatoes. I watched it. I remember my... Uh, yeah, they made a cartoon back in the day, too. There's a movie with a killer tire. It's a tire with telekinesis or something. And then goes like... And your head blows up. Some foreign movie, I think. I don't know. It's. I watched it. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if it was good. It was weird, you know. Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. Good. Critics are good. All good shit. I'll play here. Mask Two has nothing to do with anything. Same as Ghostbusters 2016. <laughs> yeah. You remember when he killed? He killed a lady that was just like a maid. It was cleaning the. So the, and I think. I, I can't fucking remember it. I think the uh, tire took a shower after or something to that effect. Very bizarre movie. Now, I do have a mainstream movie that I would list two of them that is not like gigantic movies that are on my top. And I usually call it my top, but I come to reevaluate and just realize and recognize that Alien for me has to be on the top and The Matrix. Uh, the first one. I don't care for the other ones. The first one. Um... Not watching a new one either, please. <laughs> thanks, but no thanks. Uh, Slain Blade with Billy Bob Thornton and Dwight Yoakam, who's a country singer but plays amazingly well. And there's a boy there who's a grown-ass man. I forgot his name now, but he's been in other, other movies. Uh, and now another movie I really, really liked when it came out back in 97 is The Edge with Anthony Hopkins and Alec Baldwin. Uh, and I don't know his name, sorry, the black guy from Oz, the series Oz, which is right up there is my, one of my favorite series. Sorry, I forgot his name. Uh, yes, I will call him black because that's what he's a black guy. So it'd be easier for you if you, if you had to look it up. Is the black guy from Oz, O-Z, the series, right? not the movie The Wizard of Oz. Uh, but there's references to Wizard of Oz in that on those series. So he's the main character of Oz. And he was in the movie The Edge from 1997 and it's awesome that movie if you never watched John, John Wick is awesome uh, 
they don't make movies like that anymore. No, they don't. The thing is really scary. For me, the scariest movie ever is The Grudge. I can be anywhere, anytime, no matter how old, I will get the goosebumps when I think about The Grudge. Can I? Oh. Yes, The Grudge. And and it's funny how tasty. Some people think it's ridiculous and not scary. I, I, it gets me, man. Japanese horror can't, ah, fuck, tend to get me somehow. Is there a cat down there? Oh, now I can see the fucking bottom. I'm scared of things being in the bottom here. I hope not. You motherfuckers better not hide anything down there. Okay, clearly I have to move the block here, I know, but... So I have to... I hope I'm not making a fucking mistake by bringing the shit down here. Can I kill those motherfuckers with this thing? That'll be cool. Let's test. Let's test our theory. Come on, you fuckers. You kill things. Come. Oh, I'm eager to know that. <laughs> fuck! Yeah, get out of here, you fuck. There was another one, right? No? Uh, the Matrix is right up there with Alien. I still prefer Alien, but The Matrix, holy shit, what a fucking movie. When I watched that movie the first time, it blew my fucking mind. I was thinking about it for months. I couldn't fucking stop thinking about it. Uh, all the horror movies I watch and love, horror is my main thing, but when I mention uh, The Matrix, holy shit, that movie is good. Terminator 2 is awesome. The first one is good, too, but Ter Terminator 2, Jurassic Park, Alien, and The Matrix is a movie I can watch like right here, right now, without feel feeling bored or like, oh, I just watched it. I watched Alien, like, I don't know, fucking three weeks ago on VHS for the gazillionth time. I would watch those that again right now. Like, you know, I would sit here and watch Alien quite happily. Not, it wouldn't be a chore. Internet is going bad. Let me take a look here. I'm, get, I'm on red. Uh, it's going to drop my stream. It hasn't happened in a while. You went on red a tiny bit. Let me see my speed here. I'm beginning to suspect that uh, Twitch might have a problem, not my really my internet. Let me see. No, I'm at 8.8 .8 megabytes per second. There's no problem here. Yeah, skip frames. I can see, see the bar here when red, but my internet is fine, but there's a game like the Grudge on PS2. Forgot the name is a first-person shooter, and there's a creepy girl that follows you around. Yes, Saeed. <laughs> Skip frames there, but I think he's on green now, so it's just a little hiccup. I don't think. I hope it didn't split my VOD. I hit when that happens, because that means I have to. Whoa. Oh shit. Okay, gotcha. Acid. The guy mentioned acid earlier. See, but if you don't, you don't do the safe state. Oh. <sighs> oh, my God. Come on. Okay, yeah, that would have killed me. Talk. Angles all wrong. Distances broken. Mind confused, can walk properly. Better run than walk. Okay. Oh shit, this is kind of fucked up. <laughs> the fuck am I to do here, bitch? Oh! This fucks with your mind. It's very weird. I have to play to understand what the fuck is going on here. Okay. <laughs> Don't tell me it's back to the beginning, man, is it? So in other words, without save states, it's not possible to beat this game. It's fucked. It's, it's just not fucking possible. The game is made with save states in mind. You keep your fucking lives. This is so weird. I never, I don't remember ever playing a game that tells you you should use save states and then you have to, otherwise there's no fucking way, right? Very bizarre. This is one complaint I have with this game here, definitely. <sighs> Fear. What was that even, PSU? Hellraiser is awesome. 
What's your pleasure, sir? <laughs> and Pupuza uh, said it's fucked. You can cuss on the chat, by the way, if you want. You don't have to. Uh, but if you want to, you don't need to censor yourself here. No one does. Except for the three words that uh, Twitch ban. So just look them up. We use codes here. It's Symposium or the Simpsons. Simpsons. Yeah. Virginia. And what's the other one? Intel. Halloween is awesome. Every Halloween we watched it, but uh, I think we skipped it last year. We didn't watch Halloween. It's a tradition here. This room hack is kind of fucked. I would have much preferred. I, I don't like the system here. It's. I don't. I don't even know if it's possible to use save states on the uh, on the Super Nintendo. I never had to do it. Anyone watch Can Candyman is awesome. I'm not watching the new one though. Not for me. Candyman is good. <laughs> scared the fuck out of me when I was a kid. A lot of those Freddy Krueger scared the fuck out of me. The, the, the part there's a part that the lady comes out of the fridge and she's all swollen with foot. It's very fucked. Fucked me up. Uh, Child's Play is awesome. That's a, I think another type of movie I can sit down and watch. It did scare me as a kid. Uh, Jason Voorhees is my guy. I love that man. Uh, all the staples, man, the horror movies are great. We watched the black and white Dracula, so classic. It was awesome. The 1930s Dracula, me and my wife watched it together. I was introducing her to the movie. It's very good. Have you played Terror Drum? <laughs> yes, but not. I didn't get deep into it, but I know I'm very aware of it. Yes. Yes, I'm very aware of Terror Drum. It's pretty. It's a bit choppy, but it's it's definitely something I want to play here at some point. You know, love that game. Very cool. Very fucking cool. Yeah, it has all the the characters. Pretty awesome. Even Chuck is in there. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna drink, drink some here. How would it look in a CRT? I bet it would look great. I think so. I think the type of graphics that they have there is sort of, sort of reminiscent of Donkey Kong, right? The old Donkey Kong, like, uh, what do they call that type of graphics? Goddamn, I'm forgetting all the fucking words today. Pre-rendered, right? Uh, I think it would look good on the CRT. I think it would look very good. I want to test it, but... Problem I'm having with computers is uh, having them no output in 240p. I got the CR CRT emit driver to work. It was a massive pain in the ass. Horrific. Complicated as fuck. Uh, but it does not do 240p. I tried. It makes a, a, an actual 240p image. Uh, another option I could do is downscale with the GB, GPS control. Uh, so if I can output 480p and then I could do downscaling with that to 240p yeah 480i it belongs to many games but not that type of game it has to be a progressive a fighting game right so I think it will look good uh, okay uh, I need to look up if there's a what can I do here I mean the game is telling me I have to use save states I'm not how often? I, I don't understand. Maybe at the beginning of the stage, maybe we can do that. But I don't even know if it's possible to do the save states here. I mean, if you ask me, like the N8 Pro EverDrive, all the other ones, I, I'm, I know that you can do it. Uh, I guess I'll reset. Oh, reset the game. All right, let's go back to the menu and see what it can do. Because there's, I'll be just repeating the first and probably the second. It'll be a very long time. Time I don't have. You know, I do have to sleep at some point. And Pupuza says, like, convert. No, I have some tools here. Uh, I don't like, uh, it says, play another ROM hack. I don't like to do a variety. I like to stick with one. Uh, I want to check first. I like to do one stream. Not always, but, like, when I play Atari, it's a bunch of short games. But I don't like to come here and play a bunch of different shit and be all over the place. I tend to be a very focused person that when I play a game... That game has my full attention. That's just the way I operate. So for me to come here and do a variety of streams is not something I'm into, usually. Even if the chat will should be into, no disrespect. Uh, 
if a game is completely fucked, uh, I will then, obviously, then I'm forced to, to pick something else. But I want to see if the game encourages safe states, and I think it might, and it is needed, obviously. It's made with safe states in mind. The game is designed with safe states in mind, obviously. So I want to see if it's possible to do safe states here, right? On, on this flashcard. Uh, if not, then it's probably, I'll probably play a couple of more times and we, then yes, then I'll consider changing it. So let me see, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, awesome. Uh, let me see here first, so options, right? A menu. All right, configuration, I suppose. Browser setting chip, in-game settings, save state settings, there you go. In-game save state, so they're off. Say, move it, a motherfucker. Save states lots one low delay frames. I don't know what that means. I'm not. I'm not experienced with save states here. I never use them. Uh, um. I I I guess. Well, how would I how would I call the menu though? I'm pretty sure that that should be. I'm familiar with the other advertise, but uh, select. Now it. Okay. And is that, yeah. Uh, how would I call the menu? So in-game hook, in-game buttons. Starts sheets in it, or is that reset your menu? I, I turned it off, I'm bright, Ms. Lena. This is for the one chip stuff. Evil Dead is awesome. Mortal Kombat, the movie, I have it on VHS here. It's pretty good. Transient fix. Don't need that because this is this is a one chip. It's a one chip 03, But the, the brightness and all that shit has been fixed in hardware by me. I soldered a fucking tiny ass capacitors in there, and I did all the fixes that need to be done. Uh, in game hook. But how would I change the combination here, though? Is a preset combination? And goddamn it, I don't have the fucking. There's a movie where this guy dates an AI or a robot. The sick fuck. Get a life, get a real girlfriend. I think I heard about it, though. I, no, I heard of one that he keeps like them as sexual slaves or something. They, they rebel against him. It's a modern movie. I haven't watched it. Browser settings. Cheap options. I'm lost here. I didn't expect this shit, the game, to be designed with fucking... Hardware. In game safe say Yeah, but how do I call the menu, you motherfucker? Okay. I might need to. Super Mario Bros. the movie. The new one is garbage. The old one is the greatest movie ever made. No, I'm kidding. I love the new one. I thought it was awesome. And I hated the old one, but now I think it's kind of like so bad is good sort of thing. So I love both, in other words. Uh, yeah, it's very funny. Uh, I'm having trouble here. Does anybody, can anybody look up on the internet, if possible? Uh, what is the menu here? Because I think I had a, a file somewhere, but I changed computers recently. My keyboard is horrific to plug in here because I don't have enough uh, USB slots and everything else like the microphone and things that I need. Can anybody see if they can find... Um, what is the menu column here to call in game menu or save to save state for the FX Pack Pro or SD2 SNES? Because uh, they're not telling me here. I, I, it says in game hook, in game buttons. I, I don't know. I, I remember reading a, a file somewhere that said that uh, you know teaches you what's the shortcuts i can i can fucking figure it out here they should have they should have told me here what's the that's the best policy right on on the normal ever drive you can go in you can change the combination yourself so this one i don't think it allows you to do it i didn't know how charles martinet uh voice characters in that movie like jump man and mars that i know the guy the jump man you're talking about but i didn't know about mars dad he did huh? <laughs> i love that movie kind of looked like talon talon from primal rage the dinosaur 
I know it's something, something else. I'm just not, I don't know who it is. Shiro Surgeon. Thank you, Shiro. Is a FX back? Oh, it's written on the screen here. I was going to spell it, but. Uh, so there's a menu. Right? And while the, while you look up, I'll play some Mortal Kombat here just for fun. While I, so I was not looking at nothing here. So why not? Arcade soundtrack. Nah, I just played the regular one. Just play Mortal Kombat until Shira looks up, because that game is not playable without the save states. Uh, it's just, it says it right there, you know. Zelda Ocarina of Time. I never played Zelda Ocarina of Time, wouldn't you know? Uh, but I know which one you're talking about now. I remember the, I, I am familiar with the game, I just haven't played it yet. Uh, not because I hate or anything, it just hasn't happened. Yeah. It, it does look like him. I know which one, which guy you're talking about. The guy that owns horses or something, it does look like him. Yeah, I need to play Ocarina of Time. It'll happen here eventually. I do want to play the original ones first, which I did play. The image is a bit dark here, buddy. Yeah, yeah, fuck off. Ah, uh, it's maximum brightness. Motherfucker. Some wilds faster than fighter. Feel free. Looking for uh, what is the combination of button for the FX Pack Pro menu? Because otherwise that game is not going to be playable. It's made with safe stacy mice. There's, there's no checkpoints. So I think it was it was 2012. So it was made before uh flash cards were available i believe so it's made specifically with emulation and you have to do save states the guy didn't want to do checkpoints so it is not possible to play the game and i do want i do want to play it and i remember now yeah you need save states i did play it on emulation with save states is needed fuck come on How to create and load safe states with FX Spec Pro. Yeah, pretty much it. Pretty much, I activated uh, the save states. I, I got the uh, the firmware. Bright green reptile here. But I don't... I don't know the button combination. I had a... I, I, it was a problem before. I had a, a screenshot. But it's not on this new computer here. So I don't... I don't know what the combination is of buttons to, to call the... I don't know if it's the menu or the save state is directly. And then what I'll do is I save at the beginning of the stage. It sucks that the guy didn't add checkpoints. I mean, even if it was emulation, it's kind of dumb to force people to use save states. I, I don't know. I don't like that part of the, the hack, but I do want to play it. Uh, it is very good. Ah. Nah. So and then when they find it, I'll reset here uh, and go back to the ROM, knowing how to do it. Because without without safe states, the game is just not it's not possible. I won't be scum saving though. So, because people, eh, I know Mr. Leifer hasn't been here in a while, but he would be the first one to say, oh, "Are you using safe states now?" Yeah, I thought you said they're evil. No, scum saving is evil. I would use safe states to, uh, and it's evil for me. It's like I don't want to do it. You know, like if you do it, don't matter. Uh, but the whole issue is scum saving. So, like, if safe state, for example, would keep me from having to have my console on the whole time, fuck off, Jacks, you fuck. Is it? Okay, I'll pause here, right in the middle. Six to nine, nice. Come on, dude. I hate this about Mortal Kombat. I can only pause here. Fucking stupid. 
Reptile's awesome. He looks awesome in a new one. Finally. I don't like the Sub-Zero scarf under their hair. Boom! Papuzas, welcome to the family. I fucking hate the man bun bullshit. It's horrible. Put the hood back on. You're a ninja. They keep fucking with the masks. Keep fucking with the hoods. This, man. This looks good. Let's, let's do something with that. Stop with the man bun. Stop removing the mask. Stop with that, all that nonsense, please. For, for the love of God, Ed Bun. Stop. Ermac, put the fucking mask back on. You look pathetic. Horrible. Imagine Ermac is designed there if he had a mask. Put the fuck. We don't want to see your stupid ass face. Put the mask back on. I'm going to save this year. Uh, so I, I, I get you, Shira. Thank you very much. So start in the arch, save. And start an L to load. Select D pad to choose slot one to four. Damn it. Off. Start. Can I go up, motherfucker? Okay, so, so I need to paste that somewhere. Can I create a text document here? Something without using the keyboard? Yes. Paste that here. Bingo. Thank you. And let me see if there's anything else in the chat here for related to that. So default slot is one. So I just need a one slot. One slot would do it. Paste it here too. Yeah, ninjas are awesome. Yeah, isn't it funny that... Uh, not sure if it's correct. We're going to try it. Uh, yeah, I was just going to say say that. Uh, it is in, hilarious that Smoke had the horrible hair in Mortal Kombat 9 that everybody hated universally. Only a few goobers liked it. And now he has the good hair. And I hate that ninja's hair. I don't like man buns. Sorry. Oh, it's tradition. I don't like it, dude. Uh, I don't like it. I I don't like the ninjas with it with the hair. I don't care if it's in the beginning. They're ninja. They have the mask. Why not have the hood then? The hood. Look at Reptile. He looks awesome. Yeah, he was fucked. Uh, I never play with that hair. I play with uh, his uh, other care uh, costume. Uh. So yeah, let's let's try that. Okay. No, oh, I want to see you. Play Mortal Kombat 2. I'll go to fucking YouTube then. I play that game a gazillion times. You know? Play a gazillion times. So let's see here. Call it Cthulhu. And let's we'll try. I'll, I'll clear the first stage and I'll try the, the thing. If not, I'll pause it. I'll reset. It don't matter. Ah, I have a small gear. All that plays out. Give me that thumbnail. I was looking for thumbnail opportunities. <laughs> Yeah, they fix his hair. He's got a good hair now. His hair looks good. Sub-Zero and Scorpius. See, I'm not the only one. I don't like it. I complain plenty of times here, Pupuzus, about the uh, the hair. I hate it. It put me off. Like, it actually put me off the, the, the characters. I'm more interested in... I don't know. I'm interested in Reptile. Okay, looks cool. I'm not sure about... I get it. The shit... You know what call shape shifting, but I would prefer if you was just human and every night, and just fatalities and shit to turn into a, a monster. I, and I, I know I haven't watched the lore or none of that of the new one. I don't have the game, but think about your shape shifter, right? You're hiding yourself from others. You know, if that's the impression I always got from shape shifters. So, uh, and do other things like uh, Shane Song, get a bunch of shenanigans done and fuck with people, right? So. But then you're showing yourself all the time as your true form, then what's the fucking point? Pupuzo says, uh, what other fighters are you going to play in the future? Over the years, all of them. Uh, the problem is, fighters are a bit peculiar. I'm not particularly good at them. And I do want to get good at some of those games. And so I think there's two options to do. You know come here knowing nothing and do some bit of practice in some games have a training mode i believe killer instinct for example on the super nintendo has a training mode right uh, practice some combos maybe have a way to watch uh videos here so i can follow the combos because that's how you learn you know yeah you could stay here and be kicking and doing things until you learn the combos 
because play on my spare time is hard because I don't have a spare time that much. So yeah, like Killer Instinct, I only know how to... I played that game in the 90s, but I never got good at it. So I only know how to spam shit with Cinder. Pretty much forward, forward, and Y. You know, the weak punch. Quick punch, I think they call in that game. So, yeah. Anyone here like Austin Powers? Well, unless Dr. Evo's in the chat. <laughs> I love Austin Powers, I think. I bought, I remember buying the VHS back in the day. I actually bought, it was one of the first VHS I bought with my uh, tapes. I bought it with my own money. And I couldn't stop laughing with the first one. It was so awesome. And the other ones are also good. They're awesome. Austin Powers is awesome. <laughs> I love the puns. They have a lot of puns based on linguistics, like misunderstandings. Like it goes like, uh, oh, and you're right about uh, the Italian babe. I shagged her. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, Austin, did you use protection? I was like, yeah, of course, I brought my 9mm. No, I mean condoms. And it's like, oh, come on, only sailors use that. And it's like, not in the 90s. And it's like, well, they should, they stop in every port. And see, the misunderstanding is what's funny. Hey, everyone, I'm from the Netherlands. Isn't that weird? <laughs> I like... Gold! The texture of it, the smell of it. <laughs> A little smelting accident. What's that? Is the, the cigar thing? A pipe and a crap? Uh, no. Then there's no please in you! Yes, 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 this is a keeper. <laughs> Save me from myself. <laughs> uh. Pupuzas, people nowadays are so easy to touch, you know, fan. Yeah, that's why the movie sucks, comedy sucks, everything sucks. Yeah. The message. Alright. Let me try the thing here. Shiro went through Great Land, so I'll keep the page open here. Eat the page. So look up Oz, if you don't know what Oz, if you only need a clip from Oz and know what Oz is all about, look up Oz, O-Z on YouTube and eat the page. That's all you need to <laughs> eat the page. That show is awesome. I love Oz. Watch a lot back then. Watch a rec I need to buy the DVD fucking collection, my God. Okay, I suppose we can test it here. As soon as I get in, there's no reason to delay anything, right? Move a tiny bit and then try to save. So what is again? So start R. Start R to save. And start R to load. There we go. We got a ball game. We can play the game finally. Wow, this is... Thank you, Shiro. Thank you very much. Very convenient, my good sir. And, uh, you know... It's necessary for this game, so I don't have anything against it. I, I would prefer checkpoints. Nah! So finally I can play the fucking game, because there is... There is a lot of awesome uh, stages here. Get out. Uh, it's very cool. I just hope that... Uh, can go ahead and close this, because it's very easy to remember. I don't think I need to remember, but save it anyways. I looked it up one time, yeah. So most cyber drives, you don't need to know the combination. Thank you very much, Hero. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We can play the fucking game now after... Because I'm coming from the... From the frame of mind that save states equal scum save, right? But on this game here, it's just if you either save state or you 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 can't do nothing. The game is not... There's no checkpoints. And it's going to get difficult later on, so... But I won't be scum saving, I won't be saving, I'll, do, I'll make it a rule here, I'll save it at the, at the beginning of the stage, that's all. So, as, as it should be, as there should have been a, a checkpoint in there. Now, let's... A fucking coin, come off it. Ludicrous. All that trouble for, for garbage. And as, you don't even need to be in a hurry here, because... Uh, there we go. Ah, because, yeah, there you go, you, you know what to do there. Checkpoint every 
three levels? No, I think every every the beginning of the level I think is fair enough. Uh, I won't do a, ah fuck. Like an actual level, if I pass a level, I think it's simpler. Three levels now because that's that's fucked. No, I'm not that hardcore. There should be a checkpoint in every level. Like you you beat a level ah, and that's it because I think we only made what the second level here. So I will do with every level, like there's a cutscene, right? The thing in the middle. I think that's fair enough. With that, but we still... Yeah, save state every five seconds. That's how a lot of people play like that. <laughs> I won't do mid-stage checkpoints. Unless I feel stage is very long and it should have had a checkpoint. But so far it's been fine. It's just like going back all the way to the beginning. Why? I, I don't understand the logic. Uh, and most most uh, most of them are not like that. <laughs> save state every five. Yeah, see many people they start using save state, right? Start small. And then before like they go here, save state. Oh grab this, save state. I jump here, should I say save state? There's a hole, save state. Oh 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 my god, I should have saved state. Save state in the middle. It's like, where, you know, then what's the point of playing a fucking game? I wonder. Just gotta keep an eye on those fucking coins. So, the game will let you proceed without the, the coins. And another thing too, uh, which is good in every stage, by the way, Shiro, because I was talking about, if you don't collect, I think from what I understand here, it might be five coins per stage. I don't know how the fuck that's gonna add up to 27, but either way, you get the red thing. Uh, the sky glow glows red when you get them. And if I make past a level and I ah and I didn't get it, uh, then there's no point because uh, you cannot be the game without getting getting everything. Like this is fine. I fucked up and I should go back to the beginning. It's a hundred percent okay. There we go. I'm happy now we get this to work here, be able to play this game. Because you see in that level there is all, it kind of fucks with your head, right? It's, there's a lot of interesting mechanics here, I remember. And that's one of the, the things I really like about Castlevania Bloodlines. They have a lot of that, a lot of creativity. And you bet your ass I prefer it over uh, Super Castlevania 4. That doesn't mean I hate Super Castlevania 4, you, you give on. Just means I prefer the other one better. All right. Not nah. every time, motherfucker. Ha! A fucking coin, I mean, honestly. It's not interested, it's a coin. Fuck, well, unless maybe it's a special coin, but I, I don't think so. There's no reason to rush here. Just do this, you, you're done. <laughs> like here, I will not do the save states here, none of that, just, it's too much. If I die here, you should repeat it. There should be consequences. You, you playing badly, you know. But I, I, yeah, yeah, nice one, asshole. With that, but we still talk. You find totems. You press up. Yeah, we know. Right. Come on, bitch. Tokens, call tokens, preserve sanity, whether or not learn this or die of madness. I'll let the chat talk now and I can concentrate the time to be in the game here. I'm excited about being able to, to play it now. It's great. Be careful killing those fucking turtles sometimes. Sometimes you need them.
fucking die of stupidity here last time. What's down here, dude? Fucking cat stash, look at that. Ah, you motherfucking cunt. Fuck you. Slow down. It's like a hippo or something. I think he could have done something a little more, I don't know, intimidating than that animal. Yeah, you know, say that, but hippos are fucked in real life. They're very intimidating. They're fucked. They kill a lot of people every year. I don't fuck around here. And if you hear, I don't think it will be picked up by the microphone, but if you hear any popping weird sounds, just the rain is raining here. It's been raining the whole day. There you go, see? That's it. See the eyes? It's very cool, this rum. Rum hack. Uh, so I think, well, what is leading me to believe here is that once you collect all the cat statues, the gaunt, gauntlets or whatever the fuck that guy called it, there we go. Now we can save after this, right? The non Euclidean path. You kiss me first, damn it. And press start, and then now it's. There we go. Cat Crashers just raided the channel here with a party of 10, 12 viewers. Thank you, Cat Crasher. See, uh, last night I wanted to raid your channel. You was on. I couldn't fucking do it. Uh, my internet crapped out right at the end. It, I went to the parachute little thing. It wouldn't let me. It wouldn't load that page. And I couldn't uh, couldn't get it done. And thank you, Cool Runner, for following. Muffin Killer, thank you very much. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I hope y'all like the content. It's just me playing on the CRT here. We're playing a ROM hack called Call of Cthulhu. It's a quite unique Super Mario World hack. And it references the book that I didn't read quite a bit. So if you're well read, you will get some, uh, like I just mentioned, non Euclidean path. I have no idea what that means, but I know that people who read the book, they know. Ah. And thank you all for following. I appreciate it. CRT lovers here. Nice to raid you again, Cat Crusher says. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. I'm sorry I couldn't raid you last night. I just couldn't get it done. I tried. It was even on my video, if you don't believe it. As at the end, I'm trying. Like, I play the anthem, as I usually do in the sign-off thing. The Indian hat test pattern. And then I'm, like, trying. And then I, at the end, my internet just crapped out right at the end. You wouldn't let me. I somehow managed to do the first loop of super goes and goes. And goes. So the internet is going red here. Go back to green. There we go. Thank you. First loop of Super Ghouls and, and Ghouls on stream. Ah. See, it's funny. I, I love uh, Ghosts and Goblins, the NES and the arcade ones I'm familiar with. Uh, but I actually never play the Super Ghouls and Ghosts and none of those. I will, though, obviously. I want to play Ghosts and Goblins in here first, so I need to play the arcade one first. It looks pretty awesome. Ah, there we go. I don't... Some other fucking coin at the end here. I'm not... Nah! Motherfucker. It's a coin. I don't get this. Why would I... Ah! Give me the cats. Oh, uh... Dr. Cat's Professional Therapist. I love that show. It is awesome. I got just a fucking coin. Like, why? And see here, beautiful art in this rum hack. It's very beautiful. It's very nice. The guy did a very good job here. The only weird thing about it, and that's what the problem we've been having here, Cat Crashers, that he made this with save states in mind. And it says, we encourage you to use save states. I'm a bit hostile to save states, but not really save states, but save, save scumming, scum saving, yeah? Which is not something I do here, but... And then I play without it, but basically if you die in the higher level, and the levels, you go back all the way to the beginning. You can keep your lives, but you always go back to the beginning. So I'm playing on real hardware. However, I'm playing with the flashcard, and I never use the save state function on it, but I think I was somewhat aware it was there. And then uh, Shiro helped us out, looked it up online, how to bring up the menu, 
and I saw it was there and now the game is playable. So I have to save before in every stage. Yeah, once. That's it in the beginning. Done. And the game is playable. I would have preferred a guy that made this hack had made checkpoints or something to that effect. But at the time, 2012, I don't think flashcards were a thing. If they were, they will be not as well known as they are now. Cool Runner says, I have a really nice 17-inch NEC. I use mana, but that's all digital. So it's like a VGA monitor. Uh, NEC is good quality. Uh, good quality monitor. What do you think about the arcade one-ups, Rex? Thinking of getting one. Go for it. They look awesome. I think they look cool. I think it's cool. I mean, uh, the price is high, but I, I see it. This, I think it's reasonable. I thought of getting a Mortal Kombat too, but I think I'm just going to build my own with the, with the CRT. That's why I got this shed here to begin with. I wanted to build arcade cabinets. AccuSync 70. Awesome. I don't have any NEC ones here. Shiro has an NEC, I believe. Does he? I think it, I think it does. Uh, Shiro here acquired for me um, an FW900. I'll be paying him uh, in his country. He because the supplied right up here. And uh, so in the future, my dream monitor, an FW900, the GDM, Sony GDM FW900, so I can play some modern games here on CRTs. I never have to to look at a, you know, a flat panel here on the show because I don't want to do it. Um, so, yeah. Cool Runner says, I like my arcade one-up cab. Yeah, I've seen a lot of videos of them. There's that guy, Daryl Sung, Sung, that does the... Uh, a lot of Mortal Kombat video. He uses an arcade one. You can play online and shit sometimes. It's pretty cool. Uh, with the Mortal Kombat 2 Deluxe, you can actually go online, which is a lot better than playing a fucking AI, wouldn't it? Thank you for following uh, JF96Joe. Hi there. A lot of followers today. Thank you. Uh, thank you for following. Uh, I appreciate it. I hope you like the content here. Just be playing on CRT. That's pretty, pretty much it. Cat Crasher, where you lurking? Shiro got a Lacey. Yeah, he got a Lacey. Cool Rana got the Capcom head-to-head -head cocktail cab. Very cool. You got a lot of cool stuff then, house. I got a, the highest monitor I have here is a Sony, I can't remember the name, E400, I think that might be it, come on. Uh, but it's 4x3, so for the modern stuff, I mean, it can be done if you like black bars, but I don't want to have them on the channel. It has been my dream monitor. I have my favorite monitor that I have now, Let's see what this guy has to say here, push block, make high, yeah, we know. Uh, my favorite monitor of now is the BVM 2011P, which is also, also known as the BVM 1911. I fucking love that monitor, the tray, uh, how easy it is to adjust things. It is very good. Okay, I'm gonna... Nah, I'm not gonna... Ah! Fuck, I almost died here. I don't wanna risk it. It's, it's fine. Let's see here. Just follow Cat Crasher. I have a couple... What's your rarest? My rarest CRT monitor? Oh, that's easy. I'll, I'll go and say, I have a monitor here that is not even mentioned. Like, there's nothing about it online. That's a difficult one because uh, I have some monitors here that are basically irreplaceable. My good luck getting a Trinitron KV1300 uh, from Japan. I got that one is from the, the 70s. Uh, I It's hard to find even pictures of it online. There's a PVM 1300E, which is also from the 1970s, and but I've seen other people have them. It does pop up every now and then. <coughs> Rarest monitor. I have a PVM from the 70s. So, yeah, the 70s ones, I, I think, because they're a lot older, so it'll be hard to get. I have a black and white 20-inch. I forgot the fucking model. Uh, that's uh, <coughs> no information about it online whatsoever like it never existed cool runner says do you use vga crts i use it uh recently here i mean what when was the last one yeah i use a dell e771 i have four i have four of them uh a yama i'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it i have a yama two dells 
Uh, and uh, Tweenatron. Let me see the name here so I know what the fuck I'm on about. I just go to my YouTube. If you go to my YouTube channel, you'll see a lot of different monitors when you have time if you want to. <coughs> Every monitor that I can use here. I have a lot more monitors. They're bigger and they can't come here for the content. But uh, CPD E400. And then the other ones, I don't know the models because I haven't used them on the channel yet. I will. And I'm I'm looking to get more. I'm looking to get a 14-inch Trinitron VGA monitor uh, because uh, some of those games, 20 inches too much. If the console is too small for it, I don't like it. And the one that I use here, yeah, I just used it two streams ago. Dell E771P. It's a 768 by 1040. Uh, yes, most of the, those use Trinitron grills. That's true. Yes. Uh, there you go. I'm going to close that. Yeah. Let's see here. Joe. Some of the Muffin Killer. First time chat. I have the set you use in the garage. That's the one I adjusted the yoke and shut myself down. <laughs> oh, shit. And Cat Crasher saying, I'm doing good, just exhausted. Go to sleep soon, buddy. I know you, he stays up past his time. I wish I can convert my app, Apple ADC monitor. Just go, join the stream. I've been busy the last few hours addicted to Mario. <laughs> Mario, I love Mario. Yeah, I like I like my survival horror and all that, but Mario, it's king. It's, it's awesome. I love Mario. There'll be a lot of Mario. There'll be a lot of hacks. I won't be like a Mario. It's not like, okay, let's say I'm playing Mario and all my Mario gets views, but then the other shit doesn't. I'm more of a I don't give a fuck kind of guy. So I play Mario, got, I don't know, six billion views. I'll be playing the Atari Jaguar next and for the next like two weeks. Then when I want to play Mario again, I play Mario. That's the kind of guy I want to be here. Uh, Apple. Scrolling through YouTube and you have some kick SS. Thank you, bud. Now, thank you for checking it out. It's all there. Do you know if they still make CRTs to these days? Uh, no, there's one guy that makes it, but it's very niche. It's a very small scale. Uh, our, a Bob from Retro RGB, I interviewed on him. There was a factory in India, but they, they stopped. So as far as I'm concerned. Oh, the Chinese also make it, but I heard they're pretty terrible. That's what I heard. Um, Yeah, so they don't. And they're not coming back. All the assembly is gone. It's gone. It's not the trend. Go look like the assembly. There's videos. And cool run the Apple. I don't know if it's the same one. I don't know much about Apple stuff. Uh, but with the Apple, you know those colored monitors. I had a chance to to buy with the cool colors, right? I forgot what they're called. Like they have a like a translucent back of sorts. Uh, I want. I really want to buy one of those and use it, but the problem is it doesn't look like you can connect anything to them. Damn it! Get out! Fucking thing! What are you? Jesus Christ! Get out! Move! I could. I. It's. It's, it's, it's fucking coins in there usually. Nah! Damn it! Fuck. Okay. Urgh. Urgh. There you go. I told you. It's a fucking coin. That's what this game is. Those tiny ass coins, man. It has no relevance. Yeah, I could have done the whole thing, but why? There we go. Let me just. Ah! Okay, you want to go from. from here? Uh, says here, oh, let me see here, catch up with the chat here. The ADC is proprietary, yes, I have two of those, you just need that. Apple color so nice. You're saying 
you know, I know I uh, I play a few streamers. If you see my uh, one of my VGA monitors, I'm doing um, Mortal Kombat 2 on the Genesis. I use uh, the OSSC uh, and to show people that if you can't afford a PVM, but you get a VGA and you put the scan lines on it, it looks awesome and it looks PVM-like playing retro console as long as you have the scaler. And when I played Xbox, I used the GB, uh, GBSC, GBS control, to pretty much as a transcoder, but I use it for downscaling too. I have one of those as well. I don't have the retro tank. I want one though, by God. Uh, and, but what are you saying here? You use OSSC? I wonder, with the Apple, is there any hope to use consoles on that Apple on that Apple one, the Apple colored uh, with the proprietary stuff. Is that possible somehow? Or like ridiculously hard? And JF96 Joel, uh, heck yes, it is. It's a heck. Call of Cthulhu. You get that nice sharp digital image on a CRT. Yeah, it is very nice. I love, I love VGA miners. I, I always recommend it. Uh, That was my whole point. I get it. That the PVM. Poor man's PVM. Yeah, it's, it's very good. Before I got PVMs and PVMs and other shit, I, uh, I, uh, I used to use that. That's what I did. I would play Mortal Kombat on my, my Dell at 480p. And with the scan lines, it's perfect. The BVMs, Muffin Killer says BVMs don't have speakers. Some of them do. Uh, they're mono. You, <laughs> it's funny. There's a meme that goes, spends thousands of dollars on a PVM play on a mono speaker fuck that uh for me my this tv is muted right now the sound is being uh extracted from a scart uh audio splitter and going straight to your ears well to an rca to usb and then to obs and all that shit uh i never use the sound on my tvs i think i'm very picky those things are old by now and i'm very picky with the speakers blasting inside there especially if it's loud shaking everything I used to have a TV that had a problem dropping collars because of a cold solder joint. And if you had the speakers loud, it would drop the collar again. It got fixed. But uh, I, and I'm not interested too much in speakers, even if they're good. Mm. So I do, I do surround sound at home or at worst headphones. So especially on BVMs, a lot of them don't have it. And when they do, it's sort of garbage. A to C is transparent, but no color. Is the only true flat? Apple, can I post a link here? You can post a link here. It didn't use to, to, to be able to, but we changed now. You can post a link there. Yes. Oh, I need this guy to, to reach up there. <laughs> you fuck. Damn it. Come on, man. The time is ticking here. <laughs> there we go. Bitch. Fuck yeah, let's head on up there. I'm so happy we're able to save now. Fuck is this, come on. Ah! Damn it. Well, that guy disappeared. Can fuck around here to time, yeah? Come on. Okay, I'm gonna trust this one, yeah? Oh, yeah, oh, get up there. Those guys are fucked. Ah, oh, fuck that coin. Let's kill myself because of that shit. Okay, and I'll bring this here back. You wearing headphones right now? Yep. Oh, yeah. If you were here, uh, you hear nothing. Like, if you're just standing next to me, it'll be all quiet. So, yeah, I don't tend to use speakers on TVs now. Not really. Ah. Okay, okay yes, yes, yes. I remember when I was there. There we go. <laughs> Not this time, Nancy boy. Get fucked. Although sometimes they get you like you need the. Uh... I go and I think this will be at the next stage. Is it? Oh no, next phase here. Angles all wrong. Distance is broken. Mind confused. Can walk properly. Better run than walk. I died here last time. Hey, <laughs> JF96 Joe. I'm off to play more Mario. Night. Good night, bud. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for following. I appreciate it. 
I think I saw a bald spot there <laughs> with a hat. We got extra x-ray vision like fucking Superman. You'll come though. We were talking about baldness yesterday and how some men go bald and they don't go graciously. Uh, and with the two pays and the fucking transplants. Fuck that. You're bald and get bald. It happens. Don't, you know. I always wore a hat anyways. That's a hat. It's a trucker hat. Yeah, I'll show you the back of my head. There's no... There's no bald spot there. There you go. It's solid black. Well, it's dark brown. <laughs> I'm getting a lot of gray hair, but my hairline on, on the front is receding a bit. I mean, it's always been, I always had a kind of a big forehead, uh, but I think it's not receding like, holy shit, but it's like over the years, like, is it receding? Is it receding? It looks like it is. I'm, I'm like, not bother. I'm just curious. And then I think it is. Yes. <laughs> Let's see here. Yeah, Joe. It's Joe. My name is Joe. Okay. Yeah. See you later, Joe. I appreciate it. Our cat crap bald. Cat crap. That dude. Cat crap. I remember a conversation yesterday. I wonder who is it. it said that dude looks fucking gross. All I remember from yesterday is that Rex loves superheroes. Can't get enough of them. Live for them. All of them. I know every superhero ever made. Can't wait to play as John Cena wearing a piss pot on his head. On Mortal Kombat 12. Oh, the... Well, okay, wait to see. See here. I'll click on the link here. I see it. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So with that one, you can use VGA? Well, I see Retro Gaming on it. Can you use VGA on it? Oh, Jerome is here. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Hi, Jerome. How goes it? I want to know, who is that dude that looks gross, Cat Crasher? Who is that? Trying to find out here. Is that the John Cena with the picnic on his head? I lost track of the conversation. Not on the ADC. I was using a Power Mac. That's the thing with the Apple I tune out. I, wanna, I wanted to use the collared ones. It looks like the best that I'll ever get is a prison TV if I ever get those. Oh yeah, no, we read that. That's the thing with the app I don't like. Proprietary this, proprietary everything. Although I, I like their old stuff. I can't stand the new new shit. Not for me. So, but how would I... When I try to jump... This is so weird, dude. The f Not yet. No, how the f... Ah... So you gotta run. Oh, oh no. Is that it? What if I enter here? What if I go that way? Aha, it's a puzzle. Ah. Well, what's that fucking door then? Just probably the bullshit, huh? Ah! Bitch ass. So this here, I don't know if... See, have you seen John Cena prank call on YouTube? I lost interest in John Cena completely. After he sold out of China. It's just money, money, money. Uh, you lost all respect for me when he went nuts with the Taiwan thing. And I know I say no politics, but I'm just saying the reason, you know. Uh, I told you I have rocked the shave head in the past. And shave head, I like to have some fun, so I kept the sides. Shaved <laughs> the top and made an echo face and took a picture. And I had put on weight because of anti depressants. One time I did, because I like shaving head every now and then, too. It's good. And when I was young, when I was 18, I liked to have a shave head. Oh, I see the... <laughs> 
<laughs> I see them, I see it. It's hilarious. Yeah, one time, Alicia, I went and shaved the top, right? And just left the sides. You see how, how I look as a bald man that doesn't cut his hair on the sides. And uh, <laughs> uh, very cool, very cool. A man of humor. I prefer the NSC, but the Apple's got to be talking to himself here. I just realized it, yes. Tio does an emote because he told her. Like, if you don't run here, you're not going to make the jump. See, it's kind of fucks with your head. Oh my god. It's very weird. It's. I tell you, if you have the chance to play this game, you like Mario, do it because it's very. Damn it, it's very interesting. Fuck! Like, it looks like I'm struggling here, but it's a, like a compelling force. Give me the cat. Damn it. You die, motherfucker. All right, uh, I'm gonna... Don't fuck with me, you did. Oh, it's the other side. Oh, oh shit, I fuck. No. No. Oh, no! I fucked up. Get, uh, no, get fucked. Thank you. There we go. Well, there's a glitch with the music, so I didn't play the music here. I don't know what gives. Uh, and so Jerome, because Jerome is here. I don't know if Jerome is, is Jerome talking. Papuza says, what's the... What's this... What's the backstory of the CRT Rex mascot? It's like a dinosaur with a CRT ha head. Good question. Yeah, there's a, a bit. So when I started a channel, I was looking for a mascot. Right? Rock into the CRT and dodge. Love you. Hope he's wearing a diaper and a condom. Okay, that's a conversation I'm not familiar with. Uh, see, uh, he feeds on rage and hate and despair and discord and negativity. Well, but anyways, okay, so I was looking for a mascot. So I'm a big fan, <laughs> moderate fan of, no, scratch that. I'm a big fan because I think it's awesome. We have nothing to do and you have that. It's cool. The Google dinosaur the offline dino adventure somebody ported that for the game boy by the way you can play on a game boy that game you know when you're offline you're using google chrome personally use firefox but if you're on google and you're offline you can play that game right so i'll explain a bit about the, the mascot thing <laughs> the conversation <laughs> uh, good shit so, I know you aren't trying to be funny, but it's so funny. Sometimes I say stuff that is not meant to be, but people find it humor in it. <laughs> it's good to hear. Kind of, it's kind of funny, I guess, now that I read it back. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, the offline. I'm a guy, I don't do online, right? I don't go online for, for most things and for playing games. Uh, didn't catch on for me. Uh, I tried a bit on the Xbox 360 time era, but it didn't. It just didn't pan out for me. So I'm not. I did play a bit of that by the other. So I'm more of an offline solo player kind of guy. Uh, you know, I try to avoid anything that's online. Kind of irritates me that is needed. But here I am playing online. No shit is screaming. I don't know what I'm. What else am I supposed to do? So, uh, and dinosaur also implies old. It's an old things. I like retro games. I like old stuff. So, but obviously I can just pick up their mascot and start using it. So I modified, right? Fair use, modified quite heavily. Then I made a lot. I have a sheet of a lot of sprites that I use because my old videos, I have intros, full blown pixel art intros that would take me two, three days to make, usually a couple of days, but of every waking hour, like working hard frame by frame. So, yeah, so basically I combined with the CRT, cause, and then the CRT Rex, CRT Rex. Uh, 
I became aware later that CRT racks was already a concept that was used. It, I swear to God, it was after I came up with. First, I wanted to be called Cathode Ray Dude, but then there's a guy, very awesome channel on YouTube, and his name, he, he took the name already. So uh, even though I came up with the name, somebody else already did, as most things happen, as, as things go in life. You know, you think of being clever, somebody else already beat you to it. Uh, so CRT racks, there's a song and an Astrobot song. Uh, but I... I I mine is un, so I did underscore. So I say I, I'm gonna keep. I'm not fucking picking. I pick a cathode ray dude. Didn't work. CRT. I'm keeping CRT racks. It's just it works for me. I had to write it down the mascot and everything. Uh, so it has a CRT for a head. You know, CRT racks. Uh, yeah, that's that's about it. Really, that's about the extent of the the lore. Uh, Cathode Ray Dude is a very interesting guy. Yeah, it's funny. I came across him because, uh, him because of that. I came up with the name. I got the perfect name. I was thinking about a name for my channel. Now. Cathode Ray Dude. It's fucking bulletproof. It's awesome. Let me see if anybody picked his name. And there's a guy, and he's quite a big YouTuber. It's not like somebody picked a name and never used it, because then I would have done it, right? Somebody just had a handle, and they never fucking used it. They had zero videos uploaded. But no, he wasn't. I couldn't possibly do that. It would be stupid. It would be dumb. So I back to the drawing board and CRT Rex it was, and then I looked it up. I was like thinking, thinking CRT Rex because the CRT Rex it ends up. I love T Rexes, by the way. My my daughter's middle name middle name is Sue on account of the Sue T Rex, and also because I like it sounds Southern. It is a good name, a uh, middle name. So yeah, not for a boy though. A boy named Sue. Remember Johnny Cash the song? You might be too young to know that. Some 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 of you. Johnny Cash has a song of a boy named Sue. Anyways, that's the that's the lore. I'm exhausted from playing this fucking game for five hours. Not built for this fucking game. It's nerve wracking. Uh Dead by Daylight, Puza says Dead by Daylight, game of survival side. Tell me about it. I reached level 50, whatever that means now. That game changes so much with Ladderface. I love Ladderface. So I just wanted to play as Ladderface and Oof. I don't know. It gets crazy. <laughs> it's very... The post game chat, the flashlight, the teabagging, the fucking uh, palace to the face, the looping endlessly. I just reached a point that I just had enough. Awesome IP. I like watching sometimes people play it, but when I have... The killers are cool. A lot of new killers, a lot of new content all the time. I don't like two things. That, it's kind of makes me very angry, that game, when I play it. And... The perks, I feel like to learn all that shit, you have to go, it's like you're going back to school or something. It's horrific. I can't, I, it's too heavy on the perks, too complicated. I just, I don't, I don't think I want to fuck with it anymore. If, uh, if I had friends here and we all, we talk about it with <clears throat> Mr. Liffer and Shiro here, we could play, uh, we could play, um, we will play, um, what's it called, fucking hell? Sea of Thieves, and if they have enough people, then Dead by Daylight, yes, as a private lobby, you know. Cat Crashers knows when Highwaymen perform in Nassau Coliseum. Oh, he likes that one. I love Johnny Cash. He's awesome. I've always liked him. I like both, because I've met some people. It's interesting. I met some younger people who are familiar with his American records, eh? Uh, the the later ones, they're somber and tone, and they're also awesome. They played it on the uh, Dawn of the Dead, the remake, which I love. is my favorite zombie movie of all time, the remake. I love it. I love that movie and them all. But the original is awesome, too, of course. The concert's on Spotify. People should check it out. 1990. You should play it on a CRT. What I should play on a CRT? Let me see here. Sometimes I forget what the fuck I'm talking about already. I should play it. I will be playing everything on a CRT. And once I get the FW900, I'll be playing everything on a CRT. The only time I use flat panels is modern game, which is, is good enough. But if I, once I get the FW900 here home, that's it for me. Gaming CRTs. The FW900 is quite, it's awesome. It's, I will be sticking with that. Thank you very much. And of course I'll be streaming, so. Everything I play lately, I've been streaming. So I feel like playing a game, I go and I stream. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, I'm gonna check. You fuckers, I hate those guys here. Come on, uh, let's go. Now, don't. It's, it's motherfucking coins. Why would I want that shit? Just can't f forget where the uh, cat statue is. Sorry, I'll be, I'll be paying attention here a tiny bit. Nah! Too many ways you're supposed to spin. You're <laughs> careful. Yeah, when the man comes around, I love it's my favorite of the newer ones. I know they have a lot they play. I think they play a lot more. I think God's Gonna Cut You Down might be more popular. Oh no, Hurt. Yeah, his remake of, uh, his re-recording of Hurt is very popular. Uh, but I like uh, When the Man Comes Around. I love that tune. And I heard it first on the, uh, actually on that movie. The, uh, from uh, Dawn of the Dead, the remake in the mall in Wisconsin. God, I love that movie. That's another movie I can watch at any time. Let me pass you, piece of shit. Fuck. Get in there. Mm. Mm. There we go. Be surprised when many modern games support 4x3 and... F yeah, I found out. I was surprised. I asked Shiro to look up Cool Runner says. You'd be surprised how many modern games on PC. That's a thing, though, because I'm more of a the console guy, but... Uh, I will be arranging here for PC, I guess. Uh, and Papusa's FW900. Yeah, this is a very, my favorite, like my dream monitor. And Shiro, Shiro got the uh, the monitor for me. You will have as much luck to get me to play that by daylight as you will get me to play League of Legends. None. You will play it. You will love it. And that's the last of it, Shiro. You will play the game. You will enjoy the game. You will go to Steam. You will log log in. And you're going to leave a very positive review. And that's the end of the story, my good sir. Okay. All right. You'll be, you be surprised. Wide bo Boy Trinitron. Trinitron. Yeah, that one is awesome. I do have some widescreen standard Trinitrons. That do 240p. And yes, there's place for 240p widescreen. Just remember, uh, movie Big Trouble in Little China is awesome. Yes. Very good. The song Highway Man is good. I, I love Waylon Jennings, by the way. Love that guy. I love the old country shit. All of it. All of it. Nearly all of it. Uh, Waylon Jennings is awesome. And the, the, the tune for Dukes of Hazard is so cool. Just the good old boys. Ba -bing, ba -bing. Never mean to know. All right, I'm not going to be singing there. Bitch, all you ever saw been in trouble with the law since the day they was born. Dan -dan -dan. Straighten the curves, flatten the hills. Someday the mountain might get them, but the law never will. Dan -dan -dan. Making their way. All right, I stop. <laughs> <laughs> sure says you could play Sea of Thieves on an Xbox. I could, but let's not. No, I'm kidding. I, d I don't know what I'm talking about. I know it's physical. Oh no, no, let's not. I have to pay. I have to pay for a Game Pass. Uh, I got to master the art of chatting and playing. Yeah? Ah, you fuck! Fuck off! What the hell? What was that? What the? What in great vagina's name was that? Fuck! All right. Not even a jingle? You piece of shit. You forget I'm a captain? Ah, fuck you, you fuck. Load, motherfucker, load. Oh, it's not loading anymore? Oh, there we go. So we lose the music here. It's kind of fucked. If you pause, it doesn't go back yet. Yeah, the music is gone. Uh, you have to pay it for online. Yeah, I will not. I refuse. No review. I refuse. I'll be doing Steam. If I have to go online, uh, Steam. I'm not, you know. Uh, had wide, wide consumer. Muffin Killer has some wide consumer sets. 
Shirobana says, I, my review on Lack was poor, should leave a good review. <laughs> of course, I'm joking. I have to play that game. I get it. Yeah. Uh, so, my consumer sets, but uh, have they add geometry and convergence on the set? I hate. Oh, I hate. Yeah. I have a Samsung here, Slim, slim Line. WS32 something. And it's, it's fucked. Oh, sorry, the music. Okay, let me explain what's going on here. So this game advises you and tells you, pretty much forces you to use save states. I had never, I have no experience with the save states on this flash card. I never used save states. There was no need for it. Uh, but this game is a hack and is made with emulation in mind. And it says we encourage save state. You have to use them. So I'm doing one per level is where, where there should be a checkpoint naturally, right? Problem is, uh, I, it comes to mind now, it's a bit glitchy, so this this music here, that's why I should have been clear on that. The music the music is, is supposed to be different, so the save state is fucking up the music. This music is from your when you're on the, the overworld, so at the very beginning. So the music of the stage is gone now, that's what I mean. Sorry for the confusion, y'all. Playing 5K on the CRT with Rex and play with some of your followers. I think once we get, get big enough here or something, I, I will arrange something like that. That would be cool, you know? Of course, uh, I tried to register on a PS5 the other day. Finally, all right, I'm going to go on a run on a PS5 here again, but it, it is fucked, you know? I got a fucking, uh, the thing is collecting dust there. Uh, that's it. And I'm, while I'm having fun with the older consoles here, they're, they don't want to scan my fucking butthole and that shit, you know? Fucking, uh, the, 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 the fucking age registration. Fuck off. Can't confirm with your phone. Can't confirm with your debit card. Oh, yeah? Fuck you, then. I'll go play fucking Dreamcast. Fucking killing my enthusiasm nowadays, man. Killing me. Killing me to shit. It, it, every generation is like from it, it goes worse and worse and worse like what the fuck where's the silver line in here none that's where give me the coins a sack of shit you're not gonna pull me out of the fucking coins you fuck worth it i now want the coins you're, you're not man enough to kick me out of the coins here can i kill fuckers damn it I'm a tiny man again. Give me power ups, bitch. Imagine playing games like Ninja Turtles, Metal Slug. How many updated did you have to load before playing? Playing what? I didn't play nothing. I fucking put the thing down. I actually dropped my controller. That's how angry I was. I spent fucking three hours trying to do the fucking age registering bullshit with a fucking console. You fail every time. Oh, you could go. You you could go on without it. No, I can't. I need. I, the only game I have for is Mortal Kombat 11. The fuckers, but it's the physical, right? They put the half of the fucking physical on a disc, the base game, and the motherfucking uh, all the DLC. Everything else is on a on a on a coupon, right? Have to enter a code. So, of course, they're going to ask for my fucking age. So, it's not viable. It's not, you know. I want to confirm. I'm a fucking 40-year-old man. I want to confirm my age, but they don't let me. It's fucked. And then the other option is to scan my fucking face. Or God knows what. The credit card don't work. It's a debit card. I don't have a, I don't have a fucking credit card. I don't want a credit card. A credit card. <laughs> Come in. Fuck you, you fuck. And, uh... Yeah, I, I fucking laughed. I fucking laughed. I'm not, like... I waited on the updates. Yeah, there was the update. Update fucking hours updating that shit. And then I know once I get the game in, if I was you, but I didn't even get to that point. It pretty much, I had to open, I had to open the, uh, I see, I'm fucking, I can't even talk when I get as angry. I had to go on the browser. And there, I've been through this rant before. It won't let me. It doesn't confirm with my phone, even though everywhere else, I buy, va I buy fucking nicotine here. No problem. What's on the PS5? What the fuck? You know? It's a, it's fucking dumb. It's the dumbest shit ever. What? Imagine the, NES, the Super Nintendo here come here to say, oh, uh, to continue to scan, uh, you need to do your age requirement. 
I don't want to. Yeah, okay, but then you won't be able to play Mortal Kombat 2. Okay, well, I do want it then. So, okay, what do I need to do? Like two hours later, nothing. And it took it took money off my fucking debit card. And only after I read it, oh, if you try with the debit card, it won't work. And there might be a charge. Imagine Super Nintendo charging me here. That's fucked. I'm not, I'm not fucking doing. You have to register your age, yeah? Update the fucking controller? Like, fuck off. I already had a very bad impression with X, with the Series X. It did not work well for me. I bought the fucking console to play Alien Isolation at 60 FPS. They have the patches, not on the PS5. I love Alien. I want to play that shit. No. I, I, I bought... Fuck off. I bought the Ripley edition. Without the extras. I didn't get all the extras. The fucking DLC don't work. I had to fucking contact fucking developers from a hundred years ago. And they said, we're not even involved with that fucking game. And then I got, I got, I had to get in touch with Sega because they published. And they, a lady helped me in there and helped in quotes. She just fucking Google shit and gave me answers I already knew that didn't work. Fucking 15 fucking days, 15 days later with just a base game. I want to play a Susan, uh, uh, Susan Sarandon, you fucking moron. Sigourney Reaver. Sometimes I mix them up. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, God, I should have done this here. Asshole. So, in other words, I bought a, in other words, make, make it simple. I got a fucking Xbox Series X and I got a PS5. The Xbox Series X I'm done with the fucking installments. It's how long ago it was. It was. And then I got a PS5. This is about a month ago. When I, when I went to turn it on, it was like three days ago. And I haven't played either. That's my enthusiasm for, for this shit now. I'm just... I'm just not into it anymore. I'm sick of it. And, and now I hear the leaks that uh, Xbox, they're gunning down physical i know that we all know this day will come but they're really pushing it the day it all goes digital uh i'm out digital is the future yeah okay I'm, i don't want to be part of the future okay you play i'm happy for you you're playing the game you're having fun i'm not gonna i'm not gonna fucking you know do anything with your with you i'm not gonna affect you i just i don't want it myself i'm not interested in it uh, uh I don't care what's in the disc. I need to have it. I don't. Oh, here's another one. Here's something that happened uh, today. It was fun. So who, who here ever heard of um, fucking Bloodstained Curse of the Moon? Right. And by the guy that I, I, Igarashi, I'm terrible at Japanese names sometimes. Iga, right. Uh, I really wanted the first one. I got to start it somewhere. I really wanted the first one. I'll talk and walk and talk, walk and talk. Um, and, oh yeah, motherfucker, eat this shit. So yeah, I really wanted that game, the first one, but holy fucking shit, it's limited run and rare as fuck. So, uh, you fuck. No, that's when it fucks you up here. No, Higurashi, no Nuko Karani. I don't, I don't know anything about anime. I watch zero anime. Uh, maybe the old ones like Sensei and Dragon Ball Z back in the day. And I guess the Pokemon would count. And back then we didn't even call them anime. It's not, not in what I knew. We call them cartoons. Uh, so I'm not, I'm not, I don't know anything about anime. Like that's the last thing that, uh, that I know about, to be honest. Uh, don't hate it. Don't judge you. I know most people are into anime, but I just, I'm not into it. I don't know what's going on. But Sensei, I know Sensei. I have the DVD collection. So I guess I do, I did watch it. I just didn't, anything new past that, I don't, I have no idea what's going on. But I love Sensei. I love that, that one. It's from my childhood. It's dear to me. And it's fucking awesome. And I bought the DVD collection. And I'm very happy to have it. My wife was into anime, right? She is into it. She knows all that stuff. Uh, she did know Sensei, so that's fucking awesome. You know, and I got to fucking drink here a little bit. Shiro, if you want to talk anime, is your guy. 
Lost all your games and saves. I have a lot of bullshit story stories. So, confirm it was hacked. Can do anything. The hacker changed the email password. They aren't allowed to change that themselves. So the only option is to delete the account. So I lost all my games and saves. Could not even transfer those because I need access to my fucking account for that. Fucking hate them. Welcome to the future. And another thing I hate the most is people who are obsessed with the digital. They hate physical. Why? It's not fucking affecting you. Shut the fuck up. Enjoy your digital. Stop hating on other people's stuff just because you bought another thing. You know? I hate Ford. Why? I have a Chevy. Okay. Are they? How, how is that affecting you? I don't, I don't get that mentality. It's all over the place. It's all fucking over the place. Pegasus, yeah, there's the dragon one, Andromeda, the, the pink one. I kind of hurt, and, and there's games, by the way. I can't wait to play the games. I, I'm going to I'm gonna get the games. Definitely get the games. It's an awesome game. I don't know if it's three. I prefer fighting games should be in 2D, personally. I want to give an example here on the physical digital. So, when I got back to gaming, it was thanks to the 360. At the time, I liked digital. I bought some digital. I was into it. And then I was like, I don't want this shit anymore. I want to buy my discs. It was fun in games for a while. And I stopped playing for a while. Got busy with work, working all the fucking time, right? So, I go back to it, right? And I get a, an Xbox, a silver one, a Halo edition. Because I love silver. It's my favorite color. And I was like, all right, go play my game. So I want to play Mortal Kombat Arcade Edition. I bought it digitally back then, right? It was only available digitally anyways. Doesn't work. Um, you, you just can't. If you get your hard drive and you put it in there, it, it, it won't work. You can't just transfer it. You have to do a bunch of bullshit. You have to transfer your games. And, you, and get this part that I hate. You need, and don't tell me you don't, because you do. All right. I know there's some updates you can do with USB, and I've done them before. But you prove you own your games. Y you have to go to Xbox Live. It tells you there. But you go to Xbox Live, you have to sign in. You have to pay. So you're telling me I have to pay 40 whatever it is, the fucking money they're asking per month, to prove that I own my games on the 360. And what, when, what about when the server shut down for the 360? Then what? So I can only play on my ba black... Xbox 360. But guess what I can do? I can get my fucking physical disc and play them anywhere. All the Xboxes. My Mortal Kombat 9 Complete Edition. Any fucking Xbox will take it. Bingo. Done. Physical. I'm done. I don't want digital. Thank you. No thanks, but no thanks. I'm not into it. I don't want it. If video games cease you to be produced from here on out. Completely. Stopped. Forbidden. I wouldn't have enough in my lifetime to play the retro games that I have here and some of the modern games. There's a gazillion titles. So I'm not... I, I go, go to hell in a handbasket for what I care. Fucking kill kill everything and, and you know, and fuck off. And they go, Jerome says, same here. I lost 350 games when I stopped paying for games for gold. We say you should say we would own forever. Yeah. Give me the disc or you're not seeing my money. I will pirate you. You bet your fucking ass I have no morality. I'm a monster. I will pirate the fuck out. As soon as the console is hacked, watch me. What about the developers? Yeah. Okay. Ah. Okay, so the, the key here, we're back here again. The key here is not, you can't stop. And that door is, is bullshit, right? Ah, uh, we made it again. This is such a mind fuck. This place. Ooh. See the sound is a bit uh, so weird. This, this part. Ah, uh, I'm dead. I thought I was dead. So do I continue here? Uh, oh, it's bizarre, dude. Yeah, there's a ah. How? <laughs> Did you see the size of that hole that's worse than Castlevania? The odds! What are the odds, man? See the size of that fucking hole? How the fuck? 
I bet if I, if I was challenged to do that for a million dollars, I, I will die poor. It'll never happen again. If I was trying to do that on purpose, to fall in that tiny hole that just just barely fit his, his, his rotund body, it would have never happened again. No fucking way. One all of my How the fuck? Okay. Okay. No, no, eh, fuck your couch, sir. Fuck your couch. And now this music say, eh, they're kind of fu- Ah! Motherfucker, I forget the green ones that go all the way. All the way. Get out of here. What the fuck am I holding you for? <laughs> yeah, it fucks up the music. That's too bad. The save states. Oh, well. Say, what are the chances? Yeah, it's very tiny. Bleach. Yeah, I enemy, mean, I know nothing of it. And I know some, uh, what do you call, metal hero? Ah, you motherfucker! Dude, there's no warning here. Because, like, in, in the original game, you have the pipes. I got a life here. I think you get to keep your lives, which might be a good thing. Oh, those fucks. Oh, fucker. I have a cat statue, get it. Go. I don't think this part here is uh, no longer challenging, it's just boring and taking my time, so I'll probably save after this then. Come on, bitch. Like, ah, you f Okay, it is a bit challenging, I suppose. If you're a dumbass like I am. No, it's not really, I just fucked up there. Ah. Pupusa says, I'm tempted to talk about anime here, but out of Rex respect, I, I shouldn't. Uh, no, go for it. You have total freedom of speech here. No, no, uh, Shiro and uh, Pupusa, keep the chat alive and you can talk here. I mean, you can add yourself some Discord and come all over the anime and stuff, but you, uh, you can talk about anime here 100%. I'm not, you don't have to talk only about things that I'm interested in. I'm not that kind of person. Uh, talk about anime as much as you want here. I don't hate it or despise it. I just, it's not for me, that's all. But I don't have a hatred for it or anything like that. If that's the impression I, I get. I, I understand that I come across as a hateful old man sometimes. But uh, that's not the case. I'm very respectful respectful of other people's uh, tastes. You know, we all, we all have different opinions here. So you can... Uh... Yeah, there you go. You can't... You can't... You can talk about it here, no problem, if you don't, if the Discord thing don't work, uh, it's fine. I don't mind it. And if y'all talk in there, I guess I'll play, I'm more focus, focused on the game anyways, it's fine. Talk, talk about any subject you want except for fucking politics. That's the one rule. Okay. <clears throat> Just no politics. Everything else, I don't give a shit. No politics, no... Fucking fuck! No politics and no racial slurs. It's pretty simple. And the three words that Twitch banned because then you'll be automatically not banned, but you get a timeout. Just avoid it. Is there is their platform? You know. How the fuck? You know, I, I'm trying to run across. You can't do it then on this game. Come on, you sack of shit! You're not here. Time is ticking here, bitch. I'm trying to run here. There's just one block gap. So how the fuck I can run across that? Even the, the statue is shocked. No, like I said, uh, y'all talk about... You don't have to just talk about movies. You can, you can talk about anime if you want. Like 100%. I don't, I don't say things should be polite about it. I'm not polite. 
I try to be, but I, I fail at it. I'm direct, so I guess some people might think, you know, I'm not polite. I try to be, though. I'm, I'm very blunt. So if I didn't like you saying, like, enemy out here, if I didn't like enemy talk, I would put on the terms or something like that. But why, you know? People like enemies, uh, you know? It's, it's fine. I'm very familiar with the movie Let Me In, but I never watched it. It's a Swedish movie. I'm very aware of it. I need to. Uh, Dracula 2000. It's a vampire movie. I like Interview with the Vampire is awesome. Blade is fucking dynamite. I want to watch Let Me In. I really do. How about that one too with the classic one with the with the kids? Corey? Is that the, the Corey? Or is that the guy from, the kid from, uh, move you fuck. Oh my god, you're gonna cause me trouble. Kill him. Motherfucker. Caused me a lot of trouble, young man. I'm trying to remember the one, the dad is a vampire as well. Ah! Can I reset? No. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, shit. Motherfucking block. Kiefer Sutherland. This one with the mirrors that I... It's funny how it is. There's one with the mirrors that I watched it. I oh, know I play... As, uh, chat says, I play Blade for Game, Game Boy Color. Shiro, want to watch Blade? Watch it. It's awesome. Blade is awesome. It's fucking awesome. God damn it. Such a good movie. I like a meme I watched one time. is with the Twilight guy and his running. And then it says, finally. And then... In the background, you can see Blade. <laughs> uh, that meme made me laugh so hard. Ah! Man, fucking around here, dude. Okay, here you can't... Okay, go, go, go. Go, go, Inspector Gadget. So you can't hesitate here. Don't fall in a fucking tiny asshole, you motherfucker! There we go. That is so weird. <laughs> Give me the... Shut the fuck up, man. Get out of here. Oh, nah, you're trying to... Or do I just drop here? I, I guess I just drop here. And then what? I wonder. Yes, go back the same way you did. Nothing. You know the way here, so. There we go. Yes, yes. Better now. Uh. No! Ooh. Oh. And I think I got all of them, or no, there'll be more. <laughs> Motherfucker. Come off it, there's something up there. No fucking way. Master, there's someone else in the city. Moving towards here. I'm already aware of it. I'm mean, here for the tribute. I, I, I don't mean that fast. Swallow him. I better swallow. There we go. I can save here. Uh, save here. Right? No? Can't do it. There you go. See, this is the music, but if when you load here, you'll be fucked. So that's a, that's sad. Who's this ASB? Right back. I'm going to buy some beer. At the gas station. Awesome. Oh, cool. We got some beats here. Cool, cool. When you skate, when skate fails, you look up for exit. Okay. 
I sh sincerely hope that I'm getting all the cat statues, because if you don't, you're fucked. You don't even get to see the last boss or whatever. I've seen this motherfucker here before. No, that's not it's not a platform. Shagath inside city you go go not near it pulls you inside it. Kind of thing here. I'm afraid of mission of cat statues is f fucked if you do. I guess I have to. Oh! Oh, look at the mechanics are gonna start now. Isn't that cool? There'll be a lot of crazy shit here. It's pretty cool. It's very creative, this hack. Write down the name. Play. Oh, Twomp. Is it? <laughs> very cool. How the fuck would I get down there, you piece of shit? Oh, yeah, it's all... Okay, let me see. Yes, I got it. Ha! And then... There we go. Okay, and then probably... Oh, shit, I gotta go back. Okay, fucked up here a little bit. Now, motherfuckers! So it doesn't work on them. Look at this shit. Oh, they're just going and it's like fucking Ermac in here. Oh, you can't break those blocks here. Get out of here, you fucking weirdo! You can't break them here. I see the the doors. I haven't. Can you? What happens? Okay. I just, oh, in case it's to reset. In, oh, fuck. In case you fuck up. Is it? Oh! What are you doing? Come on, bitch. <laughs> Damn it. Can us. <laughs> Don't panic. Ah! Okay, and then go back. Right? Hope. This. Fuck! This is shit! Yeah, but. Okay. What the fuck? Oh. Oh. Come on, bitch! What are you doing? Ah! The fuck I'm trying to get up there is the only fucking thing that makes sense. Well, am I fucked now? Oh, get on. I oh, see this what get out of here <sighs> Okay I get it. Well, I don't get it at the up there part. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. calm down Okay, where's the guy? I need the guy here man a cranium Okay, there we go. Ah! Fuck off. And that's a problem. They got the music is gone when you have to reload. It's such a shame. Don't know if there's anything you can do about it. Uh, what if you do it again? No, I'm stuck with that fucking manual music the whole game. No, well, good going, stupid. Fuck! I want a fucking music. Who's this idiot here? Is he like a tiny car? I don't. What the fuck am I looking at? I see this asshole before, and he just must be just like a random thing. Oh, right, time is ticking. Quit fucking around here. Hey! Oh shit! I missed some of the chat here.
you're fucked, cunt. <laughs> and I'll say, like, hi there, Persian Air. Sorry, I was so into the game, I missed you. Yeah, fuck. Motherfucker. Fucking fuck. God damn it. What is this? Oh, I was just to tell you. A something. Shagath. Fuck off. Okay. Yeah, this is some cool mechanics. How's life, Persian Air? You okay? And Jerome, you had a good day? Oh, yeah, Jerome is the one that paid at Costco. I was like, fuck Nintendo. Fuck Microsoft. <laughs> Send him an email when I'm trying to get my PS5. So don't take it personally, uh, Jerome. No. Yeah, I, I wasn't happy that night. Trying to find a go. Yeah, finally going to play PS5 here for once. No. Oh, no, you're not. <laughs> Come on, dude. Get up there. There we go. And then over. Up and over. Fuck off. There we go. Yeah, I thought the old trick with a thwomp of uh, doing the spin jump would work, but it doesn't. <laughs> Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Wake up, bitch. You motherfucker. Okay, come on. Come on, man. Where's the guy? Fuck. Shut the fuck up. Where's the other asshole? Come on. Get in here. Hey. Look, where's it? Where are you going, dude? The fucking guy was what? Come here, dude. Fucking both idiots here now. I, this guy needs to go. Motherfucker, damn it. Oh, you can destroy. Okay. Stop. Ah! Fucking hell, I forgot about that shit. Fuck off. Damn it. And then what? Yeah, but I... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, go back. I remember. I, rem I remember. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Give me the... Okay, what happened here? Oh, yes. This is crazy, bitch. Yeah, like, fuck, you're gonna... Oh, my God, is... Okay, yeah, I thought they were gonna start falling here. It's the red one. It doesn't go. <laughs> there we go. Can I use this asshole here for something? Oh. <laughs> oh, go, go. Oh, where is that thing? I gotta be aware where the shit is. Where's the other one? <laughs> Come on! Get up there. Now there's a, no music at all. <laughs> Very cool level design here. Get out. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, sh oh, fuck, you done goofed. I need the thing, dude. Come back, you fuckers. There we go, this guy. Oh, no, I... Stay. Don't just fall here, dude. There we go. Fuck off, I don't need your shit. Oh, my God, is that... Gotta be careful here. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. How the fuck? <laughs> okay, this is gonna be a mind fuck. Okay. <laughs> fuck. Okay. I need to drop down. I kinda kinda drop down here now. So I need to do ah! What the fuck? Uh, fuck your couch, asshole. Fuck out of here. Oh! 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 Get out! What the fuck? Fuck away, man! This fuckery here. Oh no. Get out of fucking memory, dude. Hey, asshole. Oh! Oh! 
Komm, schür. Oh. Fucking. Ah! Motherfucker! God! That shit is gonna kill me. Okay. Okay. And then just drop down. Okay, gotcha. Ah! The time! Come on, man. It's got enough fucking problems here. Go, 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 man. Fucking hell, but... It's bad enough. The, the time, bitch. Ah! Ah! Okay, I need to go uh, take a leak. Fuck me. Fuck me. Awesome level, though. Awesome level design. <laughs> Sheer with a big brain. It's good to see the new emotes we can use. Oh, that's a very cool one. <laughs> awesome shit. All right. Uh, I'm not going to bother with a commercial. I'm just going to pee outside. It's dark here. Oh, it's fine. I'm in, I'm in the middle of nowhere, by the way. I'm not peeing on somebody's building. Just bushes and fields here. There's nothing. All right. I'll be back. I'll put a break here just in case anybody walks in and they go like, what the fuck is this and what's going on? There we go. But I'll be back very few minutes, if that. Come on, goddammit, move. Okay, be right back. All right, I'm here. Fractal Mind Mike. You made that? That's awesome pixel art. Very cool. Very cool emote. Too bad about the music getting fucked here when we start the level when you go back to it. But it is what it is, and you bet your ass on any fucking nicotine. Because, you know, can't get my fucking snooze here. Fucking had to go and ban snooze. Fuck off. Hate it. You should be able to get, you should be able to get a lot of cans of, well, first they banned the dip, so I couldn't get dip here no more, or chew. You should get Red Man and uh, Stokers. Big, big tub of Stokers. Winter green long cut, man. It was fucking awesome. Dipping all day. No, can't have that. Cut that. It's evil. Thanks, Dad. And then, fine, I swapped his news. I get news. So I got Thunder from Northerner. 
Go back to uh, buy more. Stop shipping here. Ban evil. Thanks again, Pa. Now they want me to buy fucking nicotine pouches. I make my fucking own. Grind up toilet paper, motherfucker. It's cellulose. As long as you get the non sanded one. But it ain't the same. It ain't the same as tobacco, you know. <laughs> so what? What's happening here? If you ever do mod work you don't like, a CRT or actress, you'll stay with me. If I ever do mod Oh, oh okay, now I got now you're fine, man. Come on. Come off it. Doing good here. Doing good, doing good. Thanks, man. I th I appreciate it. Oh yeah, if you ever fuck up, I'll tell you I'll fucking I'll destroy you. I created you. I can destroy you. No, I'm kidding, of course. You know my hero by now. She a new computer. Jerome. Jerome sending that cool stuff. Oh, Jerome, before I forget. No, no. The computer arrived here fine. I haven't had a chance to uh, test it. Uh, now he said this. They were saying, my, my wife is already. I love the size of it. My God, I wasn't, I, I wasn't expecting that size. It's very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Uh, I will be plugging on my days off because then I'll plug everything and take care and show show it to my wife, show it to my kid and tell them how to operate everything if they need. And uh, it's going to be awesome. We know everything got here. Fantastic. Jerome sent me, I mentioned on the other stream, you wouldn't hear. He sent me uh, Xbox One X, uh, next box uh, 360, awesome, Red Gears of War. Uh, Wii U console with a gamepad, a lot of Xbox One and Xbox 360 games, and a computer, which will be very useful for my wife and kids. Uh, and I can't keep this one that I bought for just the streaming. I just want for the streaming and editing videos. I'm not filling up with crap, none of that shit. And then my old computer that I had PC on is going to come here in the channel. It's going to sit right here next to the VGA monitor. I'm going to set it up so I can play some modern stuff and do PC, modern PC stuff, you know. Within a limit, there's going to be no fucking 4K ray tracing on that shit. 720p probably at, at best. It would be on a CRT, obviously. Shiro, do you know Spanish? Or Mike has to translate it to you in real time. I forgot about the Spanish. I know one, but it's in Spanish. Need permission of... No, no, tú no, tú no, no necesita permisión si habla español para uh, el link. No, no eres un problema. Pupusas. Uh, is the website is a gray area? What is the website about? I got... Fuck, the fucking chat! Watching older anime. No, I can't put the website there. I don't care. No, put it there. It's okay. I don't give a shit about what y'all talking about in anime. I don't care. I just don't ask me about anime because I don't know anything about it. But it's not like I'm going to be triggered or some shit like that. I don't have, you know, PTSD from watching anime or some shit. You can talk about whatever you want to talk. You watch whatever you want to watch. You can do whatever. Don't mind me. I'm just a guy here playing. That's all. Don't mind me on my streams, man. It's not, you know, I'm a nobody. What the fuck am I? Just no politics, that's all. No, obviously, like, don't put fucking porn links here. That kind of shit, you know? Because I might check them. And I might hear things. Yeah. The uh, dark side feel stuff. Drink some Coke here. Hey, let's get back in there. Persian air is like, what are you fucking talking about? Who is talking about what? There you go. It's my answer to that statement. Dark side feel. <laughs> the sounds, man, the sounds. <laughs> you don't see it, but you can hear it and you cannot unhear it. 
What the fuck was he thinking, huh? <laughs> Fucking crazy. <laughs> yeah, he's insane. It is fun. Him and uh, Low Tier God is another one. Uh, he gets into some crazy shenanigans. He does speak his mind, though. I do like that part about him. Dark side feel, just shilling out there, shilling for stuff. Shilling without getting paid and then he's begging for money. It's funny. <laughs> it's fucking funny. He's a, he's a fucking gold mine, isn't that guy? Just keeps on giving. So unfortunately, see, that's what I'm talking about. We come back to the game here and you're stuck with that fucking music. The music of the stage is fucking gone. It's a bit bugged. It's not, uh, nothing to do with the, uh, shit burping here. Nothing to do with the uh, the ROM hack. It's about the flash card, right? So, it, it, like, it has a safe state, which again, again, because you might have heard of me here before, it's not scum saving. The game tells you you need safe states. It's, it, you need, and you need to, otherwise, it'll be no fucking stream. It'll be me on the first level for, for a gazillion years. Come on, you fuckers. All right. Uh, but this thing, it is, is not, it doesn't even natively support it. This is a third party, uh, firmware that allowed it to, to have, uh, safe states. Usually it doesn't. It's not a usual, nothing worse than send a port link on the first person to say it's not hot. <laughs> I say you sick fuck. He got angry when low tier guy refused to play with him. That's a hard one because, uh, in Street Fighter 6. I wonder who would win, because... Yeah, I wonder. Is... I don't... I, I never watched Low Tier God playing Street Fighter 2. Sorry, Street Fighter in general. I have seen Low Tier God <laughs> playing, and that man is... He's good at rage quitting. He's very quick. Like, he made a... He's a master of how quick it is. He, he perfected it. <laughs> you know. Ah! Fuck off! Come on, look at me, man. Look at me! This motherfucker over here. Come on, dude. Where the fuck are you going? Not tell to shut up. I'm Can't you see I'm trying to relax here? Ah! Fucking that guy's gonna poke me. Ugh! <laughs> fucking di diabol- Oh! Look, 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 look at this shit! Doing the hard way! Look at that! And I'm here waiting for the... <laughs> waiting for that jackass. Well, good news then. Remember that shit, eh? Gee wee. This guy. Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Fuck off. Okay, so it's here and then... Oh, shit. Come on! Motherfucker. <laughs> and then... Come on, guy. I don't know. The, the fucking jingle is fucking gone, man. Oh, there we go. No. Ah! There we go. Ah, 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 give me the cat. Ah, 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 yeah, yeah. Shit, 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 shit. <laughs> All right. Well, diminish the danger a tiny bit. The fuck is that shit? A green spooge here. Fuck. Get out, get out. Get out. I don't think I... I needed it, because just, just fall here. Come on. <laughs> ah! Ah! <sighs> Panic like an idiot. This gets longer and longer. What are y'all talking about in here, Missy? Yeah, and on the porn, uh, one guy one, t one time worked in, uh, where is it? Where's Persian Air? Because there's nothing worse than send a porn link on the Persian says not hot. There was a guy at work, and it's like, you should check fuck my stump. And I was like, he was a sick fuck, that guy. He always had been. And I said, uh, I will not be doing that, my good sir. I will not be checking fuck my stump. All right? Fucking necro babes and, uh terrible. Don't fucking ever speak to me again. Yeah. 
Um, I guess see the hunter. Uh, y'all talking about uh, the anime stuff? So you got sloppy at the end there. I fucked up. I got. I panicked. That's how it happened. I panicked. I panicked. I forgot how to. I thought I kind of had to drop down in the middle. Hesitation. You know, hesitated. Oh yeah, I did fuck up. Uh oh, <laughs> oh Jerome, are you a detective? <laughs> yeah, no shit, I fucked up, man. I I admitted I done goofed. <laughs> All right, I'll do better. I will probably at some point. I will do better. But thank you for the stuff, Jerome. I really appreciate it, man. Ah! Really. Oh, no, I did, I did get that. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Detective, Detective Jerome. Who, who the fuck is this asshole? I don't remember him being here. Okay. Detective Jerome. One of my favorite lines of, uh, I say all the time at home, we can't ask my wife, is uh, from Family Guy, Winston Church, Winston Churchill's uh, legendary wit, Family Guy. Oh, Winston, drunk again, I see. Oh, yeah? Well, you're a cunt. <laughs> and they fucking redacted that on TV. They censored it. They, they, they censored some other lame insult. It's not the same. <laughs> Legendary wit, because it's like, oh, tomorrow I'll be sober, but you'll be ugly, you'll still be ugly, that kind of shit that Winston Churchill would would say, right? Very funny. But on Family Guy, it's like, oh yeah, well, you're a cunt. <laughs> ah! Fuck! All right, get in there. And now the fucking thing fucked up the music is is the is the flashcard, okay? Oh my god! No! Okay. Ah! Ah! Vaffanculo! Porca vacca. Get in there. Okay. Get. Mm. Okay. Ah! Okay, come on. That's all you had to do here, you fuck. I get. get. <laughs> Don't push me, motherfucker. Okay. Fuck off, don't... What? Ow! What? Suck my cock! Bullshit. Well, fuck you, you fuck. What the fuck? Get the shit out of here. You crazy bitch. Okay. And here. Okay, so what... What happened last time? What... Right? I died past this here doing something. Oh god, okay. I'll kill all of you fucks. Ah, uh, yeah, I remember. <laughs> as soon as I see that shit. Okay, this is... So I think you have to go like... Uh, fuck! Okay. Uh, I can't... Okay, wait. No! Damn it! <laughs> fuck! Fucking music is gone. It's fucking annoying. God damn it. That was a close one. I think I have to go like right away. Just jump straight through. Puzo says. Ma says a mind fuck. It says it is. It really is. Can you scroll this chat? Fuck. Get up there. I can't scroll the chat anymore. Oh my god. Fuck, go up, man. The thing is fucked. I can't read the messages. If you had knowledge, you make a rum hack. I did make a tiny one. It's very tiny. It was a color swap. That's it. But it made a difference. It was a Splatterhouse 3. And I uh, got rid of the slime, the green shit, and swapped for red blood. So it's bloody. I call it bloody edition. It was just... But it, for me, it was something I had never done anything like it. It was actually a lot of a lot more work than I thought it would be. I expect to actually not even be able to do it. 
Okay, I'm gonna. Uh, I would do. Uh, where's the fucking mass? Okay, if you had another, it'll be a platform. De definitely, I would do something Castlevania. Definitely. Fuck. The chat is all fucked here again. I have an old tablet laying around. Could use it for chat. I don't know how I could do it, but then I'm dealing with the fucking gloves and the scrolling. I need a fucking second monitor, but I don't have the HDMI. And if you're new with this here stream, basically I'm in a shed. My mobile home is that way. I have three kids, young kids, from one to seven. Extremely loud. It's impossible. It's not possible to stream in there. You know, and I'm not going to fucking tell them to shut up all day and have them not be kids. So the solution that's coming to the shed is a wooden shed I built specific, specifically for me. I had the intention of building arcade cabinets. Instead, it became full of junk and I did nothing. But then when it I finally changed the provider to get internet. Internet to no, it wasn't for that. I decided to make videos more often. I'll come here. When I decided to make videos, I came to the shed. It was the only way I couldn't make videos there either. So I ran a tube full of all the cables that I need. I prepared beforehand. HDMI, USB 3.0, USB 2.0. Uh, an Ethernet cable, all sorts of cables. It runs in a corrugated tube from a hole I drill under the mobile home that goes from my living room into the computer that's there right now. I don't have a computer here. That's why you don't hear fans and shit. And the tube runs all the way here, and the end of the cables are right here. And I use the cables as I want. The monitor is duplicated. So if my wife was to turn on the main TV, the flat screen, flat panel at home, you would see, she would see the same screen that I have, which is fucking ass because it's just one fucking monitor right there. So this is what I'm looking at. So I'm, when I, I'm talking about the chat here, pardon the light, is I have to come here with the mouse and do this and, and look at the nonsense. And that sometimes it doesn't want to go. There you go. I'm, I'm, I'm moving the fucking wheel up. Is that, or, or you got to grab this fucking tiny shit here. And I can't, I can't fucking, so I have a VGA, I have a VGA uh, cable that runs from there. I prepare for that, but I didn't prepare, yeah, I didn't prepare for the, uh, I didn't prepare for uh, having to upgrade a computer, but as soon as I began editing, it was fucked. So I needed a, the computer was fucked, like a, I don't know, man, a, Two hour video would take like fucking three hours and then a, a, a stream or a long video like eight hours will take literally at 16 fucking hours, you know, and if you fail, I have to repeat it. So I was falling behind. Uh, it was fucked. So, but I had a VGA cable. So the, with the OPC, I had VGA from a DVI, DVI to VGA adapter, but it's DVI I, I think. So it's all analog. Jerome explained it to me. And I have here, it's right here. Sorry. Uh, you can't see it, but this is a second monitor right here. And I had, I was happy, right? But then when I upgraded the computer, the computer is awesome and it made my life a lot easier. The added in is a dream. A one hour video takes like five fucking minutes. It's nothing. And, you know, <laughs> how you <t> <laughs> Famous now, I was on the screen for a few seconds. <laughs> yeah, that's basically what I'm looking at right there. So you see every fucking box available is, is crammed in here on my monitor. So basically, the monitor, the new PC, it has a lot of fucking HDMI cables out. I didn't even know until I talked to Jerome. I was like, it's just this DVI here. It's fucked. I was expecting two. Oh, no, it has five. Or two, two or display ports and what, whatever. But the problem is... I didn't foresee that when I put the, the tube down. And it's full. It's full to the limit. There's zero. It's not, it's not as easy as like the side. I had to get a, like a line fisher to pull it out. And it was very tight. It was very fucked. Right? 
And uh, so, yeah, and I, then I have to buy like the, it's 15 meters. They use meters on eBay. I don't know, you know. Um, and so I need to buy like a few HTML. I need to redo the tube. I need to buy a bigger tube. I need, I need, I need to redo everything. I need to go back to the trailer. I need to then do a bigger hole and I have to do a, and then I can't have HDMI. But for now, I was open because I already have a VGA cable in there. I was hoping to adapt the, uh, it has a DVI-D dual link. And after I bought it from like three cunts, I sent it around fucking goddamn adapter. It keeps sending me DV, DVD, D, DVI-I dual link. It's a completely different thing. And that's the analog one. Uh, I bought, I finally got one guy that sent me the wrong one. I said, listen, this is not it. It seems like every fucking seller on eBay don't know. The, I need the, this is the diagram. You have the fucking diagram in there. Send me this one. He sent me. Uh, but then it doesn't work because uh, I was at, at first I was puzzled why it didn't work. Then I, I contacted Jerome right here, Jerome here, and he told me it's because it's digital and now the VGA is analog. So I, which begs the question: Why does the adapter exist? I don't understand. So now I don't know. So I can't have a second monitor for a while, and it's fucked. Uh, so yeah. <laughs> I thought you were trying. No, I'm, I'm in a shed with spiders. There's some. There's somehow looks wrong. A fucking scroll. The mod runs a circle. I wanna. I wanna play the 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 my house wad thing. Been playing Super Mario. Who's been playing Super Mario 64? Windows 96. Freaking awesome. I haven't heard of it. No, I have to look that at. Reminds my house what I will play to my house what that one I avoided watching because I want to be a uh, surprise through whatever it is so I avoid knowing what it is because I want to experience it and I will do it here I hope there's nothing that will get me banned on Twitch at yeah? my house wad dot wad CRT does nothing like other people who plays on CRT in 2023. I also don't have, apparently it's a big thing. I don't have, I know it's a big thing because fucking PlayStation 5 asking me for a QR code. I have a Nokia 3310, which stopped working. I have fucking nothing. I hate phones. So I don't want a smartphone. I don't know the, the fucking QR code. But Puzza says, I didn't know that Regina was your wife. That's awesome. Yeah, she's here. She's my wife. Uh... Again, I make that clear if people are here. Uh, my wife is thick skinned. She's just like me. Uh, as long as you don't want to dress profanity to her, you can talk about whatever you want. Yeah, whatever the fuck you want to talk about is freedom uh, of speech here 100%. A cussing, all that good shit. You know, if you want to, if you, if you want to be a clean, like, uh, I don't know, Mr. Fucking uh, Clean here, you, you can be that too. I'm not telling you you should be a degenerate like I am, but you just. You have freedom to be so if you want. See, yeah. I'll leave the Nokia phone. Damn, you're all this. The batteries. I bought new batteries. It doesn't work. Uh, I I bought two of them, and they don't they don't fucking work. Yeah. Marshall, <laughs> someone thank thank me for the raid, Cat Crasher. Yeah, CRT, Regina's my wife. See, the, the whole thing is Rex was the feminine in Rex. When I was given her name, she was like, I don't know. I, I, I was like, I don't know either. I guess your CRT, Regina, is Regina if you're referring to the old queen of England or that city in Canada, in Alberta, I think, right? Or Saskatchewan. I don't know. I'm not Canadian. I, I, I don't know. I, it's in there. It's in out west. And um, it's the feminine version of Rex. So that's it. So I'm not I'm not getting into the smartphones. Maybe look, there's one I'm interested in. The Sony Xperia. First is a Sony and I like Sony. Uh second, you can have sixty four or one hundred and twenty eight gigabytes of if I'm going in, I'm going in big. You know what I hate about fucking smartphones? You ha never have space for nothing. Oh, look at the zap you could have gotten. Oh, wait, there's no fuck. Oh, oh, your bank app needs your fucking update again. Oh, don't have space. I guess I'm deleting more shit. Fuck off. It's like half of the fucking time I'm having to think what, what, what do I have to fucking delete from the shit to have this other shit. And, you know, and then in the end of the, I, I, 
I went on a crazy, I was very angry. It, it would, you wouldn't. So the phone would make me miss phone calls, which is purpose. Like the screen was damaged. I couldn't slide, which I hate sliding. I give me a fucking button. Fucking. It wouldn't let me answer calls, so my work is calling me. I'm a security guard here, so I need to know what's going on. And the fucking thing would made me lose many phone calls, appointments. It was fucked. Okay. Ah, you fuck. God damn it! Give me this motherfucking idiot. So one day, one day the uh, work called me. It was work, and I missed yet another call. It was getting embarrassing. I have to explain to them. You know. So I lost my mind completely. I actually jumped from the couch. I threw the phone. Then I jumped from the couch. And the phone was old. I had it for a long time. And I hated it. When I say I don't I don't hurt hardware, that'll be my CRTs and and things. Computer I don't know about other shit, you know. Ah oh, you fucks, they're gonna <sighs> fuck you know. I literally beat the phone. There was glass in my mouth. That's how angry I was. Or you think I... You think my... Ah, you... F oh, fuck it. I think my tampers are put on here. <laughs> I'm not proud of it. And then I grabbed a mallet and I, I broke it a thousand pieces. And I don't regret it. It was the best thing I ever did. To this day. It was... It was revenge for the years of suffering. Best thing I ever did in my life. And that... Uh, and I just swapped to a non-smartphone. They still have 2G here. So, but then the fucking thing with the batteries, you know. Battery keep dying. Bought a new battery. So, even the retro phones now. So, my wife has a tiny non-smartphone with dual SIM. I just gave her my SIM and just told her if they somebody calls for me, just give it to me. Done. And now I, and now I don't have a phone to worry about. Life is sweet. Ah. I don't like phones. Fuck you! Oh, that guy took a hike now. Get... Hey! Motherfucker. Ah! Idiot. Where the fucking music here, man? This is... Okay. I wonder if one of them can... Help me. Ah! Oh my god, you fuck. Okay, let's try to do it quick. Ah! Uh, yeah, bitch. Get the fuck out of here. Oh yeah, I, I, that's what I was thinking. Fuck off. At least I know how to... <laughs> no, I need that. Ha! <laughs> Calm. Calmly. It easy does it. Get out of here, you fuck. Parasite. Are you not gonna be a nanny or some shit, are you? That is not dead. That is not dead which can eternal lie and with stranger aeons. Wait, carry a thesaurus with you? I don't know what the fuck that is. Even death may die. Like eons? Like ages? Okay, is this... Look at this shit, huh? <laughs> Isn't that fucking awesome? Yeah, I kind of remember this, yes. First time I came here, I was like, what the fuck? But I thought for... Fuck off, come on. Please let me pass this fucking level so I can fucking save. <laughs> ah! Don't tell me that... Yes. <laughs> Look at mama, she likes me. There we go. Oh! <laughs>
that's a good game. Uh, next time, there's no music up at the background. I have background music here. Some fucking synth pop or something. Put it on, you know. Fucking no music is a bit weird. I have a disdain for games with no music sometimes. There's a password. My wife asked, no, there's no password here. Oh, that's a whole fuckery. Uh... That is a, you, there's no way of not dying there. It's the whole thing is a, it's make-believe. You're not, you go to the game over screen. You don't know what the fuck happened. Like I kind of was there momentarily. And then this stays at the game over until you, you jump. So if you press reset, you're fucked. You're done. But if you jump, like press a button, usually I press B first and then start before I do a reset. So thank God. And then you find out you're not really dead. You're just in the game over screen, actually. Walking around. Booty cheese pop. Nah, yeah, and I got some music here. Some booty cheese pop, yes. <laughs> yeah, this game is pretty unique. That's why I'm playing it. It's the first hack, full-blown hack that I play. It's, it's a very cool game. A lot of creativity here. But one guy, you know, one guy made it. Too bad about the music, Quit. Now look at the the atmosphere, the looks of it. I just fucking love this game. It's very cool. And it keeps coming up with more ideas here. It kind of, like, again, it reminds me of, uh... Yeah, this here, there's something up. I can't fucking remember what it is. Fuck you, you fuck. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. I kind of sort of remember, so I think this here, and look, the, the grass is moving with the wind, it's very cool. Something about the reflections here, and this might be fake. In fact, I'm, ah! what the fuck is this shit? So basically, you got to look at the bottom is what matters. I don't know if you can see, I know it's kind of dark. So you ignore the top. And the bottom is what matters. If he has shoot the... You understand what I'm talking about? This thing isn't moving. Ah! What the fuck happened here? No. Nope. Oh, fucking hell. Okay. But then now the music will be gone. So this is bullshit with this uh, fucking hack. Is if you go here... I'll, I'll load the music of this the first one. You go back all the way to the beginning, but thank God. It, it says here, the game encourages safe states. You have to. There's no fucking way. It's made with a... Uh, with a... Uh, <laughs> you want to make sure you don't fucking save instead of loading, huh? So there you go. So at least we'll have the music from the first stage. It's too dark. Yeah, no, the... Uh, the... Okay, I can go up here, but the, the stage is very dark in person. It's just meant to be dark. There you go. That better? The reflection. Hey, imagine here. This is a perfect safe state. Wait, you wear the gloves here. You wear the gloves. Look. I'm gonna look at my fucking hands here. Reflecting like shit. Look at that. When you play so when you play you know, you play a, a dark game, that's it. The reflections galore and some some are even worse. Uh just read your message about payphone. Use a red payphone in the UK. It's working well. So made an international call. All right. Don't. Oh, and uh, good night, Jerome. Have a good night, my good sir. Thank you very much for this stuff. Have a have a good night of sleep. Persian Air says, "I hate when you save it instead of load and fuck yourself." Now fuck yourself. That's what you get for fucking scum saving, motherfucker. Good. Suffer. This game is forcing me to do safe states. I have no other way, but I hate it. I fuck, I hate it. I don't want to do it. <laughs> Persian air. All right, talking about cards here. All right. Come on, get off me. Fucking clingy motherfucker here. <laughs> fuck you, cunt. <laughs> good man, good man. Can you see it now? The reflection. Can I do? I can't do nothing about the fucking reflection. Is there? It's, 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 a, it's glass. It reflects. What do you want me to change the laws of physics here? All right. The. Can you see better now, though? <laughs> Persian air second platformers. 
You do? What what do you play that you uh, consider yourself? A lot of people say they suck, but they don't. You know, they're under the impression that they do. You probably do, though. So, like most people, do. ah! Like me, like, like <laughs> this shit. <laughs> Pupuza says, I see Rex's face. Really? I don't see another monitor here. What do I look like then, if you do? I, I'm not seeing it. What are you seeing here? Really? I don't mind. And I, 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 my face showed up a couple of times on a Mortal Kombat Sega CD sideways. You know, I just don't want to make it like a, like a, it will happen though. There, uh, my last video on the hardware showcase, you could kind of see it. Sometimes you can see it. I'm a white guy with a dark, big mustache and the trucker hat. You look like a cunt, definitely. Then you definitely, now that confirms it. You can see me. Hi. Uh, a big mustache, headphones, yeah. Wearing a cap, headphones, a big mustache. Yeah, it's a big, big one. <laughs> <laughs> I can see this on full screen. Curious. Because it has a dark game. Hmm. I'm not saying, but... Whatever. It'll, ha it'll happen. It has happened, like I said. Perfect description. As a description. Britain still have a lot of those. I'll look at a lot of them are rather called red. Oh, that's a fun one. Yeah, pretty much that's me. Uh, mustache wearing a, I don't see your face. Yeah, like I said, that ship has sailed. When I play Mortal Kombat on the, um, the oh, the Sega CD, because, because it was a bigger money, it's the Dell, right? So the camera, to pick it all up in the fucking massive arcade stick, the camera has to be way, all the way up the tripod and very far away. So I have to come here and do cable, so... When I was watching the footage back, some of it, making sure the sound and everything is okay, you could see my face sideways. You could see the mustache moving in my face. So I just don't want to come here and go, me, eh, that's my face, that's what I look like. Shut the fuck up, who cares? I don't want to do that shit. So, but if it shows here, I'm not like, I admit it, in the, in the beginning, I was not 100%, like, I'm like, yeah, I don't know. I, I would, I usually, because of the reflection of the CRT, when you do, when you put a lot of lights in here and I'm doing, because at the end of my playthroughs, I always talk about the the hardware and I show the the back of the TV, the monitor, whatever it is I'm using, talk a little bit about it. And uh, the reflection is very hard. So I usually use a Jason Voorhees mask, but I'm, I, I don't want to fucking be wearing a mask. You know, it's fucking stupid. Who, who fucking cares? So, but I just don't want to go do yes, my face review, guys. One thousand subscribers. E. I don't want. I don't want to do that shit. Yeah, there you go. I want to see the game, not a mustache. I want to. You know, I want. That's exactly. I want to see the focus should be. I don't want to. Fit, I get. I have the voice here. Obviously, I have the commentary. But besides that, I try to make myself scarce here. It's about most of the CRTs. It, it is about me talking here obviously if i just sit here stone face it'd be different but still there'll be people that'll be into it that might be into the crt i figure a lot of people are into the crt and the console and they they say we'll put up with this idiot fuck it you know <laughs> but uh you know i can not see your face yeah all right but but i, I do have a face i do uh, that much just certain don't fucking oh, no no sorry i want the the level that was stuck with this with the soundtrack here come on bitch start your shit come. oh my god no. oh select i keep fucking up Pause. Pupuzo says, "Never show your face, Rex. It makes you more mysterious." Like when, yeah, when, like I will never do it deliberately, but some deliberately. But sometimes it's hard because I gotta go and fiddle with the uh, cables and shit. I, I just don't want to be freaking out about it because of the side of my face. There's a friend of mine, Marco Retro on YouTube, and he doesn't show his face per se, but he has show himself on camera. But always from the back side of his face, you can kind of see. He doesn't go out of his way. 
So to this day, I talked to him. To this day, I don't know what he looks like. I know he looks sort of Italian, and I was right, he is. But uh, his face, like he'd never look at the camera and say, this is me, this is my face, this is what I look like. Uh, so I don't want to do that, but sometimes it's hard, like the side of my face it will be, but I'm never going to be looking at the camera on purpose and going like, hi. But it's, it's hard to avoid the face not being shown sometimes, depending on the arrangement here. If I have to go on the back of the CRT, that's what I mean. So, but I'll never be on purpose. I'm never gonna be like, hmm, and look at me. Look how cool I look. I don't look cool. I look like, like an asshole. So I don't, I don't care about it. And I'm fucking stubborn. So, if I was ever to get big, nothing will change. Why? I never understood that. You got big, right? Let's say you get big here. You, you become a fucking hit. Yeah, everybody's fucking creaming their pants to watch your shit. Oh, I know what I do, derp derp. I'll change the content in the format. I'm gonna show my face, I'm gonna do this. Cunt. You fucking sack of shit. People got there because they like your stuff. You change it, you're alienating them. You're trying to look for a new fucking audience that might not even fucking exist. So for me, you'll be the same shit. Papuza says, you wear a mask, and I did use you, but it's annoying. It, it muffles my voice. I don't like it. I feel like, I feel stupid. I don't want to do that. So I think side of the face is fine if it shows. I mean, I, I do avoid it. I go back here, go like, whoop, whoop. But I notice a, a couple of times it, it shows up, but it's never frontal, so I don't think it matters that much. But I'll never show my face here deliberately. No, not, not into it, not interested. I'm not that interesting. I, I I don't I, I'm not I'm not a, I'm not ashamed of my face I'm okay looking guy uh, you know back when I was younger I was fuck you fuck back when I was younger I, I was doing okay you know uh, just uh, don't want to be the focus of it that's all I'm not I'm not into it I, why you know there's no purpose I miss a lot of those 80s 90s things arcades yeah I miss the arcades dude. Fuck, I keep pressing so like, okay, let's quit fucking around here. Let's go. Keep forgetting this. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you saying, mister? The fuck? The fuck is this fuckery? What is this, dude? So this guy has his whole area, just it doesn't go further here. Uh, Japan still has arcades, it's just the West yeah, and some other places do have it, arcades. Japan has arcades, they haven't moved. In fact, consoles are fucking dying there. Uh, look at this game, it's so bizarre. This part here exists for no reason. There's nothing here. And it can't fall here because you die. Okay, but now, now I wasted a lot of time here. I thought it'd be a cat in there, which would be kind of a dick move, in my opinion. Fuck! It's <laughs> shit dark in here. On the time I ever seen an arcade was, I was in Thailand. I think my girlfriend at the time was bored of being there the whole day, but I loved it. Well, that's pretty cool. I forget sometimes you, you're young, so you don't. That's right. Well, we only saw, let me tell you why we saw arcade, arcades in the 90s. Fucking Street Fighter 2, man. That shit revived the fucking arcade pretty much. Because it was before that we had the uh, the golden era, as they called the uh, Pac-Man, Donkey Kong, all that. Uh, so yeah. I called it the second part, yeah, that one with the... Okay, I keep forget. I keep forgetting here, because... See, you look at this here, you think it's a one solid place, but you gotta look under. D that was cr crash. That was... Cr ah! I forget. See, you forget. Fuck. <laughs> Shit. You gotta forget the top. You gotta fucking forget the top. Must we see this shit all the time. Put the, put the Doom music. There we go. Keep that one. More appropriate. Get out, scumbag. Okay, so this, that there's fake. Oh, there's the cat. Mm. Oh, you can use this feller here as one of those boos. Get out. Don't never touch my CRT. So here, 
You gotta look at the bottom. That's that's what this is, and it's very easy to forget, trust me. So you gotta so right here, so I died last time I didn't understand, but now I do look. There's spikes. So you gotta you gotta look at the at the bottom here. That's what I died. I didn't understand what the fuck was going on. You know? What the fuck? Oh! Oh, look. So I'm on top of it. Disappear, scumbag, please. This is very interesting. What do I... Get out of here. Oh, this is fake. None of this exists. Oh my god. Son- Nah! Fuck. And pinball is pretty cool. I like pinball too. You know the king of pinball, Steve Ritchie. He made the voice of uh he was a voice actor for Shao Kahn, Mortal Kombat 2 and 3. Is that awesome? Yeah. Yeah, they're expensive. Everything retro is expensive now. Alright, we'll keep this magic here then. <laughs> Disappear, scumbag. Ah! Fucking, how can I forget like three fucking times? You see now, hello, fuck. Dinero. Holy fucking shit. Ping. Ping Joe is raiding with a party of 21. Damn. Thanks, dude. How goes it? Move. I'm playing a hack here. It's kind of tricky sometimes. There we go. And if you see that there, the game doesn't have any sort of... What's it called? Checkpoints. It tells you straight up you have to use save states. Which is not something I'm really used to. Get up. And this stage here, basically... It's a fucked up ROM hack sometimes. It's pretty cool. So you gotta... You look at the bottom, you ignore the top. I'm a bit drunk from playing... Uh, Capcom Arcade games for six hours. Oh, you finally did the six hour stream you're talking about. How... How'd it go? Capcom, huh? Or Do I hold on to this shit, or... I don't fucking know, man. I, I think I'll hold on to it. This... This guy here. Ah! Fuck! See, this is all fake, so you gotta just look at the bottom. I keep fucking forgetting my own advice. Ah! My god, fuck! My own. Okay. This is real. Just talk, yeah, they're just talking about arcade here. Arcade, uh, if you're looking for arcade, and Dell dude. Oh shit! Wait, oh, oh, oh hold him over here, Kimasabi. Uh, Photon SCX followed me just now. Thank you very much. And Dell dude, we do we do have Dell a Dell monitor here at times. I have two of them. It's mostly twin trons, but sometimes I have Dells because I love them too. Uh, thank, thank you for following. Thank y'all. I hope you enjoy this, the content that, you know, sincerely hope so. That, okay, gotta jump over the dick. Oh, oh, I'm gonna, okay, wait, it's gotta be here, right? Nothing here. Hurt! Fuck! Oh! Oh, I see. God damn it, Mario! Christ! He hit a side of his head. I never understood that. A little side of his head. Alright, let us share. Keep the Doom music here. So basically, this stage is full of. Is, this is a Super Mario World rum hack. Right? 
in, uh, let's see, a tw somebody did 24 hours. <laughs> 24 hours, that would be, that'd be something. You can't see, it's, it's, it's not that different than what I'm seeing on TV here, on the monitor, really. It is a dark place, that's the point of it. So, Raider for Pinjo still going to the USA, late here across the pond. Pinjo said good words about you, so thank you. That's a nice feller. And by the way, for my viewers, if uh, I don't know if Shira's still here, if you could do a shout out, whatever it's called, for, for Mr. Pinjo here, because he's a good feller and he's a feller uh, CRT lover. And it's, it's fucking awesome. Ah, uh, fuck you know. What the fuck was that? That that that's like wiping before you poop. It makes no sounds. What the fuck was? Well, it hit me. I, I don't understand. Oh, it was the fucking ghost guy. God damn it! Bullshit is in you. Oh, sorry, Shiro. You had done one. Is the fucking chat is fucked? I need I need a fucking second monitor here as hell. I right, put the Dooms music here, and don't fucking dare saving. Yeah. Now, if you're watching me here, doing, obviously, the save stays, not scum saving, is the game, again, I reiterate, it has no checkpoints, and see it, it says it encourages you to use save stays because there's zero checkpoints, so it's made with emulation of mine. Uh, and I'm playing it. Oh my goodness, I'm playing on, on real hardware, so I didn't even know this fucking flash card could do emulation. I know the regular one scan is a bit more complex. Ah, fuck! This motherfucker! I knew it! He's hiding here in the... You fucking fuck. Hiding in the darkness here. Give me the B thing. I, get the fuck out of here. Oh! Oh, great. That's what I... That's what I needed. More fucking problems. Watch me die immediately. <laughs> Fuck. All right. This is fake. Most usernames here got start user. Most most chatters here got a username to start with a P. Is the big PP fellers. <laughs> okay, man. Can you give me something? Something juicy. Motherfucking coins, man. Come on, dude. Fuck. Okay, got it. Uh. Okay. Ah! You fucked this guy, man. Motherfucker. Okay, here. The middle. Don't hit the... Ah! Fuck. Jesus Christ. Pee pee party. <laughs> uh, power of pee pee. Recycle. Maybe a psycho pee. <laughs> uh, clearly hugging the pee. That thing does look like a wiener. The one of the spikes. That's it can be accidental. Alright, get in there. Let's move. Now look at it. This game is, is very bizarre. So you go here. So I get a mushroom. The purple mushroom. <laughs> and then you you go here, this area, and there's nothing. There's nothing here. This this area here, this guy, this fella made his area for nothing. I love it. Okay, gotta watch out for the ghost asshole, the brick ghost thing. And I, I can't, I can't count how many times I fell here because it looks solid here, but it's the bottom. So every stage here is a. This here's fake. Look at him. I'll step on you, you motherfucker. Okay. Gotta pay attention here. Come out, come out of the. There you go. I knew it. <laughs> out. Don't get out of here. No. Oh my God. Now I done it. Come on. Fucking. Ah. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Fucking hell. Okay. Ghost. Come in, ghost. Hmm. God, I wish it was a power. I fucked. I done goofed. Oh, fuck. This is nothing. It's... It's just nonsense. I don't know this piece shit. Where are you? I was like the piranha plant that doesn't come out when you're here. Okay, that's good to hear, I suppose. There's a wiener. 
<clears throat> fuck you, you fuck. Okay. Use him. Don't hit the side of the spikes. I'm tired of it. <laughs> Another cat. Give me that. Come out, you motherfucker. I know. The, the ghost. Oh, there you go. Oh! Oh my god. I... Fuck! Just... Give me... Okay, calm the fuck down. This is too fucked up here. I need a, I need a fucking smoke. Yeah, it's a plant. It's a hand from a graveyard, but uh, it's the uh, what's it called? The piranha plant. So he just did like a you know, it's all sprite added in. So it looks pretty cool. Like yeah, here's a hand. It is a hand, but uh, what I meant is the piranha plant pretty much uh, behaves the same. And pupusas, it says, uh, I'm I'm hungry now. I'm gonna eat some pollo regio Re regio. Ah, Reggio. So pollo is chicken, right? Spanish. Me gusta pollo. But re Reggio? That sounds Italian. Italiano. Tafanculo, porca vacca. <laughs> okay, let me see. Am I blocked here? Is this... Okay, just making sure I can get past. Are you drinking whiskey today, my good sir? I drank earlier, to be honest, before the stream, a tiny bit before uh, before eating. But I'm not drinking on stream today. No, I, I, it's half a bottle is gone already. Like three days. Fuck that. That's half a fucking liter. I need this lot of need a fucking la So you're on the listerine again? What? <laughs> I was uh, vafanculo. As with a V, I think V A C C A. V no, v a f v a f a n c u l o. I'm pretty sure it's a double O. Uh, and then porca vaca is pig cow, but it's an insult. Hey, hey, paisanos. Been drinking a bottle of Johnny Walker. I got a bottle of Grants. That's what I, I want a Grants. It was my first whiskey. The first whiskey I ever bought with my own money as a teen. Uh, it was... Grants, the triangular, bought about a one liter from Amazon, arrived here, but it's, by God, I don't know where it goes, and it just goes quick. Culo, like asso, I think it's the same in Spanish, isn't it? That's whiskey, not whiskey. Photo, well, it depends, yeah, if, if, here's the compromises made, so if I'm talking about Irish whiskey and American whiskey, and by the way, the Irish invented whiskey, it don't matter. You know, I'm Scottish blooded, but you go look at the history of the monks in Ireland. Uh, but if you're talking about Scotch whiskey, Canadian whiskey, then just a Y. So it is whiskey. In this case, it is whiskey with a, just a Y because it's, a, it's Johnny Walker. Paisanos, it's a Super Mario for the Super Show. Every time I hear that, I always think of that intro. Yes, fucking awesome. Whiskey is Irish. That's correct. So tech, yeah, the, oh, there you go. Oh, yeah, I forgot you're living in Ireland. Yeah, I had an argument, argument with Scots before because some of the distillers said, well, it was invented in Ireland and Scotland. No, it wasn't. Scotland has the most selection and certainly po popularized. And, you know, let's not get into politics here, but someone went to Ireland and kind of fucked a lot of things up with the distiller. The distiller is closed everything down. Now there's only like, what, five? Good whiskey, though. I like my James, and I like some Irish whiskey. I love Ireland. But, uh, but yeah, and they spell, because I had some Scots that go like, nye, 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 American spelling with a E Y is with a Y. I said, well, the fucking Irish invented it and they spell it with an E Y, so fuck you. No offense. <laughs> yeah. It's smoother, yes, yeah, so it's saying that, uh, it's smoother than most whiskeys. I, uh, I like the smoky stuff. I like Isla whiskeys. My favorite whiskey of all time, hands down, but I can afford it all the fucking time, especially if I'm drinking like a lunatic. It's uh, Laphroaig. It's an Isla whiskey. It comes in a green bottle. I drank it here, and God damn it, just thinking about it, I wish I had some. I could drink that all day, literally. That I probably drank it to death. If you gave me Laphroaig every day, you would kill me. You'd just 
you'll be fucked. It's, uh, yeah, I drank on my Silent Hill. When I play Silent Hill, I stream. I was streaming already. I had a bottle because a special game for me, very special, very special occasion. And Lafroig was a bit cheaper than the usual, so I just bought Lafroig. And it's smoke as fuck. I'm a man of strong motherfucking taste. My tongue sucks, and I like spicy food. I like Carolina Reaper. I like salt. I got to have a lot of salt. I know it's not good for your sugar. Everything. I can't taste shit. It has to be strong for me to taste anything. I do like the smoother whiskeys, though. I say that, but then I taste things. I'm good at tasting, so I don't understand. I, I'm not a, I'm not a super taster stuff. It seems like it's a curse, if anything, because, yeah, you can taste wine, but then they like bland food because it overpowers their, their senses. It's all about you can do a test with the amount of uh, the taste buds on your tongue. Some people have more. Some people have less. Super tasters will have a higher concentration. Uh, but then, on the other hand, you can handle a lot of, you know, spice and stuff because it tastes too strong for you. And if you have less of those uh, little bud things, little circles, uh, you know, on your tongue, then you usually require, you like spicier food, stronger tastes on, on things. So I like, I like, uh, smoky shit. I like Lagavulin and all the islas. They're my favorite. But every now and then, I like a Highland Park. I like other stuff. And to be quite frank with you, if I'm, you know, if I put it down, because I do have a very, very high tolerance, I'm usually limited by, you know, just my kidneys and my fucking liver. I don't want to, you know, die early of cirrhosis or something. So, uh, but I buy grants, a lot of the blended stuff, which is fine. I usually live right next to the distillery when I live in Scotland. Old Putney Distillery. They make the Old Putney whiskey all the way up there in Wick. And it's an excellent whiskey. Excellent. I won a prize one time. And Bedham Wells here on the, on the alcoholic root beer, which I never had. I like smoke, but it can be too much and perfuming sometimes. Yeah, you won't like Lafroig. Lafroig is like what the Brits here, they call it Marmite. You either love it or hate it, but you'll fucking remember it. That's for sure. I don't like, basically when I say it can be too much, you won't like Lafroy. I can tell immediately you won't like that whiskey. What the fuck am I supposed to do here, brother? This is a mind fuck if I ever seen one. Am I fucked? Did this turn solid with the P thing and I fucked up? Am I dead already? Oh! <laughs> Okay, this is some fuckery here. I like big butts and I can't not lie. You got a better skin than I. <laughs> love that tune. I love that tune. I like that tune a lot. Every now and then I listen to it. The Valley Girl. Okay, I guess Leap of Faith. Fuck. Ah! Give it. What were you thinking? The fuck is it? Get out! Get me! Get me out of here! Oh my god! <laughs> it's stop passing me, motherfuckers! Get out! Get out! Just fucking go, dude! God, I didn't pay attention! God damn it! Ah! Fucking hell! And this is what the safe says: Just go back here. We we'll keep this. We we'll keep this music. Oh God, I should have saved after that. I don't want to scum save, but... No, I'm doing one per stage, so it's fine. One per stage. No, no, that's gonna... You start... It goes out of control, doesn't it? This is, is doable. Master the shit. Like that. <laughs> reverse ghost, yeah. You see that? It's crazy. I wasn't expecting that. One was reverse and the other one wasn't. So you're like, you're fucked. You gotta... So my idea was to get out. So when I when I went up there, I should have paid mine to what was on the other side. And I didn't. And I paid the ultimate cost. Got fucked. I should have paid attention there. Hmm. I drink anything but tequila. I'm not a fan of Gene Bean. Oh, I like Gene Bean. Uh, I think my first stream, I drank a lot of Jim Beam here, big as one liter bottle. But, it, you know, you don't like it, you don't like it, it's fine. Uh, usually for me, the uh, allure is the price. It's been, it's, been, it's been coming out here quite cheap. Uh, it was quite cheap, so good stuff. 
I like Jack, but the price is uh, higher, and I, I just can every now and then, maybe special occasion. Uh, I do like tequila, but I like mezcal better. So the one when they say oh, there's the worm and tequila, no, there ain't. No, uh, is mezcal, uh, which is like tequila sort of, but smokier. I love that shit. I haven't drunk in a long time. It comes with the grub, the agave warm. So yeah. I like that tone. Yeah, that tone is great. Watching at home. Gosh, it's fucking cold here. It's fucking miserable. This is the shed of hate. It's just me here with a with a fucking big ass spider that shows up sometimes. It it, it has gotten cold here. I gotta wise up before winter comes. I have to weatherproof it. Oh, not again. You're not gonna. Oof. Where's the fucking ghost, motherfucker? Now she watches on her computer. Uh, I gave her the old internet, which is okay for browsing. Ah, you fuck. I see ya. It's okay for browsing, but for streaming, no, way, no fucking way. So I gotta bring this to the end here. Let's. It was the. Come on, the ghost. Come in, ghost. She watched it. Uh, fuck. Don't. Ooh. Okay, this is... <laughs> Don't touch the sides, man. <laughs> Fuck, you know. Okay, see, you don't need safe states, man. You just do your thing, you know? Go quick, now. It's the mind fucker, is it? <laughs> what the f... What? How did... Well, I did the fucking spin last time. You, I didn't make it. Are you kidding me? What is this shit? What time is it? It's twelve fifty. Mescal just not made in the tequila district. At least I remember correctly about like cognac and brandy and, and champagne. Nah, no pains, Joe. Uh, that's correct what he said, but is not the only distinction like cognac and brandy. I watch a lot of documentaries about mezcal and how it's made and all that. It is actually uh, a different process and there's smoke involved. So it does taste, it is distinct from tequila on that regard. Uh, I can't remember about the, uh, what part of the agave uh, plant that is made. It is also, I think one, tequila is made, made of blue agave and I think the uh, mezcal, it is a different species, I believe. I'm certain about this smoke. There's a documentary on YouTube Mezcal, uh, pero tu necesitas hablar español, because it's all in Spanish, for you to understand. But you can see how they do it in there. But it's, uh, it's, it's very good. It's, if you have a chance to drink mezcal, you'll be like, you'll be like, you'll be similar to drinking a Space Side or an Irish whiskey, and then you drink an Isla whiskey. You know, it is that distinct, that distinction is in there between tequila and tequila of course you have different qualities i like both i like tequila as well but i prefer mezcal uh, more than tequila it is smoky it has smoked in it i can't remember what i've seen it like how they do it i can't remember other differences but champagne now is not the same as that uh you should do a two-player game with reg the problem is we have three kids I'm drinking the whiskey, haha. Ha. I was about to ask you, I think I'm, I need some, a whiskey will be... I think a whiskey will be good here. I don't know what's the situation there with the kids, but if you, can, if you could come to the shed, and I, I promise I will, I will take it easy. If you come to the shed with a bottle of Grants and my Glencairn glass, uh, I'll be very appreciative of that. Uh, the warming is a mezcal, but a lot of people think is the tequila because of all the memes. So the warm and the tequila, but it's, it's mezcal. And there's there's that too, con gusano or sin gusano, with the warm, which is a grub really. And uh, of course, I got a con gusano, and I ate the damn thing. It was creepy at first. I'm not. It it tasted like a, 
It tasted like a dried up rubber, piece of rubber. It tasted like nothing. I actually questioned if it was even real, because it just tasted like rubber. Maybe it got hardened. I was expecting something goo gooey and fucking horrible that I would spit out of my mouth immediately. But instead, I built up the courage. Obviously, you have the courage by the end of the end of the fucking bottle. And I put it in my mouth and I fucking chewed the fuck out of it. And uh, it tasted like dried up rubber. But it was, it looked like a real worm, like grub. Uh, and yeah, I drank, I like I liked the hard shit, the hardcore shit. I'm open-minded. I fucking, I wanted the gusano. Uh, look real to me. <laughs> In this realm, I think it's real. I think it just dries up, dries up. In the in the alcohol, so because the grub right uh, is not fake, I don't think so. It looked pretty fucking real. I had a little. It's it's just dried up. I think that's what it is. I'll be very disappointed if it's a fake Uzano, and then what the fuck is that in there? Then you know. Anyone here was into Castaneda Castaneda books? It's like drinking the cosmos. Oh, what is like drinking the cosmos? Damn it. Fucking chat, man. Can't, I can't go up. Not y'all. I mean the chat here, the box. Where is the fucking... Can it... I want to know what Persian Air said. God damn it. The fucking thing climbing up here. I'm trying to climb up the fucking chat. Oh, where, where is it? I can't fucking find it. Damn it. Is is it a specific kind of worm or anyone or would anyone do? Uh, it's the it's a, like a caterpillar. It's a grub from the agave uh, plant. So they have a worm in the in the middle and that goes into the bottle. Pretty much it's a big ass fucking grub. It's, it's kind of big. So and then when you if you drink out of the bottle, it touches your mouth. And at first, I was freaked out by it, like, "Well, it gives me flashbacks." So the one time I was drinking a beer, and a disgusting, massive cockroach was inside my beer. By the time I got in the bathroom, I was drinking that shit. And if there's one thing I'm fucking disgusted with, is cockroaches. So I never forget that shit. So anything I'm drinking, touching my lips, I'm freaked out about it. That's fucking disgusting. Yeah. Oh, she's here, and I'm gonna get my grants. Hold on, hold them up. I didn't know she was gonna come. I think she's here. I hope so. Otherwise, the fucking grab your scent. Oh, there you go. It is you. Never know. This shit here is creepy and it makes all kinds of sounds. Open that. Thank it. Yes, I was all like that. I, it, I feel the glass makes a funny sound. If I had the bottle, there's no way I can see it. Hold on, let me try. I thank you, my dear. Okay, that's okay. Thank you very much. Do I have food in the microwave? Okay, what is it? Tortellini? Noodle? Ah, oh, yeah, noodle. Noodle's fine. All right, kids are going to bed. All right, I'll see them tomorrow. I'll try to start early tomorrow or something. Hey, hey, hey. Ah, da, 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 da. There we go. Now we're talking turkey. Move the shit. Uh, just a little bit. Just warm up the, you know, lift up the spirits here a tiny kind of bit. <laughs> Excellent. And I love this glass. It's just, uh, you can't really, you know, you're, everybody knows that. Your nose, your sense of smell and, and taste and smell are related. Slancheva. Mm. <laughs> ah, man, it could be the shittiest fucking day ever if I have a whiskey at the end of it. That's what I look forward to. But see, I'm like this. I guess through the half of the bottle, I'm already kind of worried, you know. <laughs> it's lunch of a... Cheers. Salute. Saúji. Prost. We say skull, skull. I don't know because of the dip. Scoff, there you go. I know because of the dip in America we have it because it was Scandinavian. Uh, the, the origin of dip is Scandinavian immigrants came over and they brought this news and then it turned into a fire cured dip 
difference between dip and snooze is, and hence the difference with a cancer and the risk of cancer, because uh, the dip is uh, smoke cured, while uh, snooze is, is air cured. So, and it, it goes bad. It's just like food. The street of this food is sweet in Sweden, as, as far as I'm concerned. So, like with the, with the expiration dates and everything. The bottle was full when Mike grabbed it. I hope so. I hope I don't go to a fucking store buying on Amazon and send me a half drunk bottle. <laughs> the fucking driver arrives here all fucked up. Fucking kid hanging on the grill. Van all fucked up and they go, there's your whiskey, motherfucker. Do you really want it? <laughs> uh, I like pure drinks. Irish and Scotch, pour one for me. Sadly, I do not own a single whiskey mode on Twitch. That's all right. Spirit is in there. And then this fucker here. I don't. It looks like I'm trapped here now. I did a spin last time. Wouldn't I pass this? I think I'm. I think I'm fucked here. I think that's what's going on. <laughs> Pick tap at a garage. Say. <laughs> Photon says, I like pure drinks. Here's the thing with me. I drank rum here before. I don't think, I think just rum on time. Rum, vodka, uh, whiskey, I drink in neat and room temperature. I don't like anything else. Just 100%. <laughs> I know what you mean. I was being sarcastic. Sure, it's like, I <laughs> mean, when you picked it up from wherever you store it, until you show it up on screen. <laughs> it did go quick. I bought it three days ago, so I do need to... Yes. I'm not addicted to it. I can't, I can't stop it any time. I just really like it. Sometimes I go for a very long time without it. I don't... Sometimes I stop caring, because, like, I got to buy other shit, and I'm, I'm not in a mood to order this, and that's it. You know, I'm not, I'm not tied up to it, but... While it's here, I do tend to go for it, you know? Persian air random says a dick to it. Oh, a dick <laughs> addicted to it. <laughs> you addicted to it. Fuck you, whiskey. You piece of shit. I hate you. No, I don't. I love you, mama. <laughs> Okay, slow down. So there's a there's a part I love on Sling Blade, that movie we were talking about earlier. I, well, I'll just mention in passing, nobody gave a shit, but I'll tell you about it. The Sling Blade, there's a lot of memorable scenes, and it reminds me of an uncle I used to have. And there's a part that he's freaking out. It's right after he's drunk and stupor. He freaks the fuck out. He tells people to get the fuck out of his house. The best part of the movie. And then the kid start start like throwing shit at him because he kind of pushes his mom, right? He wants him out. Uh, and then he goes, uh, what, what does it say? You, you bunch of freaks. I hope you have fun. No, he goes like, uh, I hate you. And I, well, I, and I hate you, you little prick. Now oh, the little boy goes, I hate you. And he goes, I hate you, you little prick. And I, he goes, no, I don't. I love you, mama. <laughs> no, it's very, it's very, some nights is moonshine. Yeah, tell me about moonshine. You should make that shit. I, you know, funny you mention that. The other day, I have a copper steel that has been on my watch list on eBay for a gazillion fucking years. And the other day, you know how sometimes on eBay, if you have eBay in your country or something similar, you come up with the offers. And one of the offers was the fucking copper steel because I really wanted to have that going here as well, you know, under the cover of darkness. And... You know, this shit, it, it ain't no chicken feed, you know? So, uh, but it's still very fucking expensive. It was a hell of an investment. And then there's the import charges. A copper, proper copper steel made back home in Georgia. I don't have the ex expertise. I have the expertise to operate it. I know head and tails cutting. Trust me. Uh, you know, uh, the wart and, uh, you know, got to make a, it was a cornmeal. It's been a while since I thought of it. You got to seal it. A lot of times, oh, it's going to blow up now. It gets clogged up. You get, you fill it up too much, you know. It could cause an explosion. But basically, I don't have the expertise to make one. I just operate one. So, something I would like to have. Imagine never having to buy whiskey again. 
Mr. Cola. Well, that's my kind of fiddler. Likes cola. Because that's, that's one thing I can't live without. I told you, I can be without beer. I can be without whiskey. But don't touch my motherfucking Coke. Jamie Oliver is sack of shit with a sugar tax. Slanchava. And thank you, Mr. Cola. We ain't drinking cola here right now. But we, well, I have a bottle here. Thank you for following. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Oh, and Mitsuyama. Thank you very much. Arigato. Thank you for following. I appreciate it. And CRT Rex, the chat came in for the raid from Pin Joe. There you go, and Pin Joe, thank you for that. There you go. Some of the folks are end up signing up here. Well, thank you. I thank you kindly. Set up. Thank you. Love to set up. Thank you very much. A lot of a lot of effort goes into getting this shit to work. I was hurting here. I was hurting yesterday with the Atari Jaguar. Fucking thing was giving me a lot of trouble. It was stuff. It was dropping the red collar. And I had everything set up right for the console and the damn thing right at the last fucking minute. Never had that problem before. Right before I go live, decides it. You know what? I'm dropping the fucking red collar and ain't a damn thing you can do about it. I was like, what the hell? What the hell's going on here? So I spent about, I was right late, I spent about two fucking hours here fiddling with the goddamn, the RGB uh, port. We call it port, but it's just a fucking bare PCB on that damn console. And uh, to get it just right, it'll be to play some motherfucking Cybermorph. Where did you learn to fly? Where did you learn to fly? That's, that's what you hear all the time. <laughs> and thank you, Mr. Cola. You're very polite, and I appreciate it. All good lads from the other side of the pond, except the old dude. He's on your side. Oh, he is. I'm terribly sorry to hear that. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Stuck in here too, huh? <laughs> Exiled, banished. <laughs> uh, no, it's all cool, man. I appreciate y'all here. Thank you. Let's uh, let's do some playing. Uh, and by playing, I mean get stuck here and jump and forget about it and drink some fucking whiskey. Cause fuck, am I gonna do here? It looks like I'm dead. I'm uh, walking a mile, walking a green mile. I'm already dead here. CRT is shaking even. I think maybe I didn't open. I, didn't I use the... Mm. I used the spin here last time and it did something, but now it's doing nothing. Let me in, you fucking cunt. Let me in. Let me the fuck in. Let me the fuck in. I did something here last time. I think I think I done goofed. I what? I'm in limbo here. Uh, I guess we're returning then. I suppose. Don't fucking dare to save. Awesome. So I reckon I have to be a tiny bit quicker out there. Because it's not... It ain't working out. Fuck your fake platform. Ah! The, the ghost. I keep forgetting it. Damn. But by now, we kind of sort of... Ah, you fuck. We, we kind of sort of got how the whole operation here works, I suppose. So if you... If you go out there without this here P thing... You fucked. There's nothing... Oh, it's the fake one. So basically, if you're looking at this and not understanding what the fuck is going on, well, let me tell you, Stud, what matters is the bottom. Fuck your couch, you fuck. Uh, ah, man, that was close. Cat, the bottom is what matters. The top is an illusion. Devised by Satan. If you ever finish Ghosts and Goblins, you get the reference. Okay, motherfucker. Fucking fucks. Look at this! What's going on here? How did I get past this shit? I did it one time. What's going on? The OC timer is very damn generous. 
You come a little less safe state. Yeah, you have to in this game. I don't, I trust me, I'm not a safe state guy at all. But this game, it literally tells you this game encourages safe states. And there's a reason. Motherfucker made this shit without any checkpoints of any kind. So anytime you die here, you're you're out. And I don't mean die like as in game over. Die. You die one time and you you're back to the very fucking beginning of the game, no matter where you are. So, obviously, but I don't understand it though. He could have done check. Why? I get. Okay, I get it. When he made this 2012, there was no flashcards, none of that. But even then, you know, I don't know. He could have made checkpoints. It's just an idea, you know, like any other fucking game. I don't see the uh, the appeal. So, I don't know. Why would you encourage people to use safe states? I don't know. It's kind of. Because then, you know, people be. Uh, scum saving. So uh, what I'm doing here is the beginning of every stage, not a section of a stage, not the section two. And then begin of the stage, I do one save and that's it. As I, I can't. I mean, you would have to wait a timer, run to die, and try again. It would be a bummer. I'll just jump off the cliff. Maybe. Can you return? I don't understand what this is. We made it here before. What's happening? What, what is? And I came here with plenty of fucking time. I came here with plenty of fucking time, so I don't know what the fuck is going on. How come this here has spikes, but... I'm not getting it. Whatever you're driving at here, my good sir, I'm not getting it. I guess you can try again this way. Oh, they, oh, okay, I forgot. They have this door here, and you can restart the lab. I forgot to mention that. Sorry, my apologies, binge. I'll drink it for to pay for my insolence. Scum saving, great word. I, I fucking despise it. I hate it. But I have to correct myself. Like I say, I hate safe states, but you, I think people know what I mean. I, they, I mean sa uh, scum saving. You know, like I'll never do that here. Never. Even the safe states here, I do under protest. I think you should have just done checkpoints. It's that simple. How hard is it? Forcing people to use safe state. I don't want to, but I have to here on this very specific occasion. So, oh, I can get get the fire here but then i oh shit then you lose the you gotta go back for the pea shit damn you fuckers <laughs> oh crap you gotta go back dude this is some fucked up shit right here brother ah it's fake i forgot i forgot i'm human here god damn it oh man it's a long way fuck you no, get out. Okay, so... Maybe I have to... I don't understand. I'm not I'm not getting it right now. I, I, I made through there one time. I spin. Did a spin jump. Honey, would you take it for a spin? Uh, don't touch the side. Of the f I hate side fucking damage from fucking spikes. So, okay, so you use this here. Okay, let's go as fast as possible. I don't get it! What is this shit now? I don't fucking get it, dude. We span here one time. I don't fucking get this shit now. I'm stuck with no pause and no save in the arcade game. There you go. Who's asking here? Mr. Cola has sent the man. <laughs> Oh, he's from. I see. The chat is very tiny here. It's fucked up. So yeah, I'm only. Uh, I'm fucking locked up to one monitor. It's ludicrous. Give an action. I assume is in the U.S. Well, I'm from the U.S., but I'm not in the U.S. I'm in the U.K. I've been here for 13 years. I'm from Mississippi originally. Mississippi slash Louisiana. But I moved here in 2010 to Scotland, and then eventually to English England for. Uh, for a job. I say here, maybe you have to go on top. On top of wood. Oh, oh shit. Oh, da, 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 da. let's try that then. 
Gotta go all the way back. Fuck! 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 Is it fake or not? The dick spike here. Come off it. Ah, you fuck. Gosh darn it. Horseradish. All right. Motherfuckers. Leave the doom music, that, that map music here. Try one more time. Or two more times. Okay. All right. Pain Joe taking off. Uh, yeah, it'll be 2 a.m. in there. Daddy duty tomorrow. Uh, have a have a good. Are you gonna bid it tonight? This tonight or not? I'm gonna see where it goes. The night is young. I usually by now I'll be wrapping up. I started late. Kind of annoying. I didn't want to start late to be honest. Getting on my fucking nerves here. Uh, probably I don't know about beating this game. Uh, I wasn't sure. I don't. I don't even know if I ever beat this game. I can't remember. There's always tomorrow. I mean, the game is interesting. How about you play good, huh? How about you really try? You serious? Why well, I'm trying. When I try, I do try. <laughs> <laughs> it's trying to piss me off and stop being polite. All right, I, I didn't know you. And some people come here and they, they're like that. I'm used to YouTube, so YouTube is like that. They'll tell you, hey, you suck, you fucking jerk. <laughs> and I go like, okay, well, that's your opinion. <laughs> so I, you know what else I'm gonna like the late. Hey, uh, the cursing is annoying and the comments are annoying. Thank you. I reply a long comment, but I try to be as polite as I could. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Good one, though. You had me going for a while. I thought, like, maybe it's being serious. But if you were, I'll be like, well, you know, I, I'm i doing my best when I when I try here. I know I fuck up a lot. I, I'm aware. But uh, I don't know. I, I forgot how many stages are here. I I would like to beat it, yes. I Like when I played the Cybermorph, you know, I didn't know much about the game, the Atari Jaguar one. But this one here, I don't know. I will try it. Oh, yeah, that is just... All right, so it says, uh, yeah, people are assholes. That, that's for sure. Me included. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm, my wife is heading out. Good night, everyone. We don't want to stay. I explained again. Good, good game to you. Good luck to you and good night. Uh, you uh, you catch on YouTube later, my dear woman of mine. Cat Crasher said, "No, I'm not like that at all. You're doing great as far as I'm concerned." I'm talking <laughs> shit. A game's very surprised I managed the first loop. Is super. Yeah, you should be proud of yourself. It's a good. Uh, it's a hard challenge game. I heard. It ain't no ghosts and goblins, but it still has a challenge. Uh. And uh, I appreciate it, polite. I mean, if you're serious, I'll be just, I wouldn't be an answer to you. I'll be just like, I'll just explain to you. I, I guess I would just say, you know, like there was the two trolls that came here and, <laughs> and one of them said, can you go back to the game? And I say, well, I don't want, I don't want to right now. But it says that, uh, and say, so can't, and then somebody told him, you can't come here and demand stuff. Is his stream. It's I demand whatever I want. I. I demand it now. <laughs> and I told him, well, you can't, you can't demand what, oh shit. You can't demand whatever you want, but don't mean it's gonna happen. I mean, I demand a million fucking dollars right now. I doubt I'm gonna fucking get that shit. You know what? Uh, fuck your couch. Let's be smart here. Ah, you fuck. Oh, let's be dumb then. I want to get, but then look at me losing my, Ugh! I want to get a reserved mushroom just in case, which is kind of stupid. Uh, most of the damage here is fall damage, I reckon. So, but now I, I'm, I'm in too deep, so I might as well leave with my own stupidity here and go for it and pretend it was a good idea. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, I'm even more stupid than I thought. 
Uh, oh no, I needed a pee. I was gonna say I, I could have just gotten the mushroom right there in the end, but then uh, yeah, I do need to come back to get this shit, I suppose. Ah, uh, the sides, man. I hate this shit. It's a spike. I gotta watch the sides. Why? Ooh. Okay, uh, so I reckon top then. Let's do it top. Come in top. Maybe that's what it was then that happened. Get up there, you fuck. Get up there. What the fuck? He didn't go up. Oh. But now I'm stuck in here now. That, that don't make... That makes no sense. I'm, I'm, I don't like this. I don't like... Uh, look, I like challenges, but I don't like the... I, I can't see a thing here. I don't know what's happening. We... Oh! We made it one time. Why not again? I'm not understanding what this entails here, my good sir. Whatever you're driving at here, I'm not sure I'm... I'm fucking... You know, and I, I, I reckon I gotta repeat it, I guess. Fuck it. What is this cockadoodle? What is... <laughs> is it... Is it... Okay. It ain't that. I, I'm... <clears throat> Cat Crasher says, thank you, I'm proud of myself. You should be. Yeah, you should be. Uh, beating that game. Any game, man. It's like, you, you know... As long as it's not fucking scum saving. You're good on my book, you know? If you scum save, just say I scum save the fuck out of it. And I'll be like, yeah, well. Can I, need a, I need to think here what you do. I'm not, so from the top, is there a topper? A, a, a higher place? I wonder. Callate, pendejo. Oh, I guess I gotta get the piece shit again. Oh, man. Fuck you. I think I don't see you here, asshole. Ah, he's below me. No, oh, it's the hand thing. The hand, the hand of time, it comes for us all, doesn't it? <laughs> Get it? Oh, no. I fucking forgot that. Senile little fuck. Forgot to enter the door. You need it to reset. You need to enter the fucking door, don't you? Hmm, Schmandrick. Get a second fire. Not that it matters anyways, because the damage here is, is more to do with the uh, falling. Fall well, right now it's not falling or anything. It's a worse situation. Fuck you. Ah! You son of a bitch. I'm sick of your fucking face. No. Damn it, I lost everything. Ah, you fuck. Fucking fuck. God damn it. What the fuck are you doing out there? Pick the pee and get the fuck out. Crap the pee, you sick fuck. I can't believe it. I lost everything. I'm gonna die here again. I'm not that it fucking matters. It's, it didn't make a lot of progress. Come here, you fuck. There we go. This guy, man. Forget about him. They'll get you. Alright, what the fuck is going on here? I went up top and it didn't fucking work, so... I don't... Fuck! What is this guy doing? I'm not understanding. I do... I'm not... I'm not fucking getting it, dude. <laughs> I'm not getting it. Pupaza says, Gano music. Uh, there's a guy that did all the research and he lists all the music like Final Fantasy. I never play Final Fantasy, I never will, because I'm not into RPGs really. And he lists all the music. So when I put this on YouTube, I'll make sure to copy that so that people can see the music that's been playing here and what it is. Damn it. Shit. Okay, I need to get the P shit again. Oh my. I know you're here, asshole. Ah! How can you forget it twice? Oh my god. Fuck you. Return. Return the device to me. There we go. And just in case you need it, because you're here anyway. I wonder if the timer, I haven't... The, does the timer reset? Oh, don't fuck it. You know. Here's something I hate in video games. That I, oh. And just like that, I almost did it again. 
I feel very disappointed in myself if I keep falling for the same trap because in my opinion it shows lack of intelligence really, you know, learning, adapting. If I die somewhere new, I feel okay, but I, there's something that burns me about dying on the same spot because it's like, what the hell's wrong with you, you know? I can see the same spot, oh shit, same spot that's difficult, but I'm pretty sure I made it before just staying on, in the bottom here. Okay, there there are a few ways up all the way. Oh, so keep going up then. What's fucking Twitch freaking out here with the radness? Shut the fuck up. Let's go motherfucking around here. The internet is good, my good sir. I've beaten Dark Souls 1. Might be a longer game. Sure, it was really hard at times, but this is way harder. This is just, right now, it's like, it's confusing. I'm not sure what they're getting at here. I hate that situation. I, I, I like hard. But when it gets you confusing, two things, confusing or being lost, I start to lose my, my not my cool, my, my patience with it, because I like, I start, I start not having fun. If you, you know, if I'm stuck on something boring for a long time, I need to, I need to have some other fucking action here. Let me see what Shiro says here. Mm, got the whiskey in my mouth, sir. The big fat vape, they, vape here. You've beaten Dark Souls. Well, I never played the Dark Souls. Keep Mr. Leifer has, has disappeared now from here. He kept saying, he kept saying I played Dark Souls. I played Demon Souls first. Once I get the FW nine hundred, I'll be playing that one. Definitely. Oh, Action Fifty Two. You can't beat it, man. Uh, what's fuck off? I turned the fucking thing off. How can I make it? A... I had a commercial once that played here, the Cheetah Man. And look, it was the Cheetah Man. And now, the Cheetah Man. The Game Master got sucked in. <laughs> Watch the going ads. Uh, the music. How can they have such a horrible shit? That I know all about the lore. The guy in Florida, all that shit. I'm obsessed with Action 52. Alfred in the Fatic. <laughs> Supposed to be Fettuccine, right? <laughs> there was a guy, uh, uh, Mike Mateus. Sorry, stream one time. And he was named Alfred in a Fettic. <laughs> From that game. Uh, but listen, even that horrible pile of dung heap has a fucking redeeming quality. The song of the Cheetah Man, the tune of the actual, the, the last one, the last game, which is ass, is not a. You know, they wanted to make fucking action figures. It's crazy. And th there's an actual Cheetah Man commercial. I played it here before on my intro. So. The cat, the, the tune for for the uh, the Cheetah Man is awesome. <laughs> What's up with that name? Action Fifty Two, Alfred and the Fat. Yeah, what happened is that it's supposed to be Alfred and the Fettuccini, but they didn't have the. Sp How come I can go up now? Hmm. Oh, come on, man! I don't understand it. I'm, I'm actually, somehow I'm playing the game more and I'm making less progress, if that's even possible. I broke a fucking, okay. I guess it, this is annoying. Give me platform ship jump or something. Micro mic. <laughs> Come on, dude, get me, get me up there. Okay, this is, I can't, you know, this is boring to play and it's boring to watch. I I guarantee you that. So I gotta get the P, oh man. No, this is, I don't like this. I don't, I don't care for this, my good sir. Sir, I don't care for this, okay? I like it, it was imagined, there was a lot of creativity uh, on the, the last levels. This is a, uh, Fuck your couch, yeah? This is shit. I don't, I don't like this. I'm uh, I'm getting very annoyed right now. I'm not happy. I want to make progress here, please. You absolute moronic jizz rag. Let me fucking go now. I, I am done with this. 
I, I want to get out of this hellhole. This is hell, and I want out. I want to get the fuck out of here. I don't understand what you're driving at. I'm going to just keep trying to go forward here. It's okay, so I'm up. I don't understand that bit. I don't, don't understand it! I don't know what you want. Oh. Okay, I gotta kind of remember. Give me this, you fuck. I gotta kind of, okay. Shiro told me I should come here, even though he knows I want to sleep. Wake up, you fucking cunt, and come in here. Come in here and watch me fail at this game. No, I'm just kidding. Go back to sleep, Mr. Leifer. It's fine. Just wonder where you've been. It's not a conversation I'm familiar with. <laughs> uh, Cat Crasher here making making uh, recent recent references. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> I wasn't sleeping yet. Well, you want to sleep, or... You close your eyes and go to sleep. Uh, let's save it here and never do that again. How about that? Uh, Mr. Leffer, your dream has come... Oh, he come at the right time. Mr. Leffer, look at this. You know this is? Watch. And I want to... Which one was it again? I'm not familiar with the concept. You see that blank in there, Mr. Leffer? What do you... What do you think that is? It's a safe state, Mr. Leifer! <laughs> you're, you're, I'm part of the team now. Scum save. For, no, I'm not scum saving. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll cut the, the fun short. It's a, uh, it's a hack that has no checkpoints of any kind. And it says literally on the hack, it encourages safe states. So if you, and obviously, because I'm a cunt, I try to play without save states. Fucking impossible. Uh, basically, if you die at any time... I don't know why the guy, des the guy designed the hack like this. If you die at any time, you gotta... You, you get sent back to the beginning. And I, I, what, was he high? I don't understand. He could have done checkpoints. I mean, he did all this shit. The shit this guy did with his hack, this ROM hack, is amazing, right? And as I pour another one here, my life is a slave. She don't care anymore. So, listen. The shit that the guy, the, the physics here this game, the ha amazing. And no checkpoint. I don't... <laughs> Again, we reiterate here, it was done before a time. The flashcards were available. What are you, a fucking loser like me? <laughs> Definitely. Cat Crasher says, put that on a, put that on a fucking shirt. <laughs> I like it more and more, dude. Thanks, Hiles. I appreciate it. Really do. We had a deep talk in my stream last week. I hung out with him until, you know, I had to go to bed earlier. I wanted to go to bed earlier. I ended up staying on this stream for until six o'clock in the morning, my time. But it was awesome. He played some Kit Motor fucking head, man. How can he walk away from that? Play motherfucking motor head. <laughs> and we having talks, you know. And it was uh, cool. Yeah, his streams are cool. He plays music, hangs out, real talk. Good shit, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Mamma mia. Va <laughs> fanculo, maricani. <laughs> yeah, 100% intended to save, probably. It is, yeah, it's, it's not possible to play without saving. I, I I just don't understand why he just didn't put checkpoints, you know? We're here now. We don't have to deal with that shit because, you know what? There's something I don't mind. I don't mind hard. Yeah? But confusing, boring, and annoying, I don't like it. I really... That last fucking state, that the section of the stage, it's fucking ass. It's diarrhea juice. Okay, is, is, I don't know, man, rubbing your fingers and your fucking ass all of after sitting in bowl soup all day and smelling the musk. That's what that was. It was shit. It was horrible. I never want to do that again, ever. All right. Cat Crasher says, I'm going to put some fries in the oven. Ain't talking my language, man. 
Fucking, uh, I love fries, God. I love potatoes. It's just... I always tell my wife, potatoes and bacon. If I could marry them illegally, I probably would. And she'll be out in the streets. You know, I love... I love that shit. Is this a platform here? What is... What is purpose? Ah! My God, I thought I was dead. Oh, my God. I was going to talk about... Uh, I don't know if you can see it here, but there's one thing. Some people don't like Trinitrons. I'll tell, show you one thing here. I don't know. I don't want to change the focus because it's very hard to just. But here you can see the Trinitron wire. You know? And once you see it, it's hard to see it. I don't pay attention to it, to be honest. Uh, can you go back? There we go. And I touched... Did I touch the fucking tripod at some point? Looks like I did. What the fuck? The fucking thing is walking backwards here. You know, God damn it! Get in there. Yeah, and I understand some people they don't like it. They don't like the they don't like the modern. You know, more Twin Thrones for me. I don't care. I don't like the. I hate Twin Thrones. Good. Le one less competitor on eBay. I love it. They're crap. Twin Thrones are shit. Don't buy them. Don't look at them. Don't pay high prices. Don't pay any price. They're garbage. Twin Thrones are garbage. Don't go looking for them on eBay. They're trash. You slot mats for the win, man. I hate him. Fucking goddamn Trinitrons. Fucking avoid. Avoid. Avoid at all costs. <laughs> What's the purpose? Of <laughs> What's the purpose? <laughs> uh, Mr. Davis, I don't like potatoes. Oh. That are just cooked. Okay, there's more. But that's it. But everything else you can do with them is great. I was talking yesterday. I used to eat a motherfucking raw. Raw taters. I can't even know. Give me a raw tater now. I'll probably munch on it. As long as it's not the starch type. I know there's a lot of types. Yukon gold. And then here they have Maris Piper. Also, oh, potatoes are so good. There's so many types of them. Don't like a type of potato? Try the other gazillion one. Other ones. You know? Cat Crasher saying, don't spread the word either. We don't want people parting with their money. Fucking line of stack tips. The motherfuckers everywhere. What, what's going on? Is PC uh, having a slow day? He's out there talking about fucking everything I love dearly. He talked about the FW900. They're gone. They were gone. They were fucking gone. I swear. They were here. There was one guy said they were gone. The minute that motherfucker made a video about it, they were fucking gone. Gone, dude. I was following it. Uh, then the N64, then he's doing now fucking laser disc. I, I did. Oh, uh, cat crasher probably remember. I was talking about, I want to get into laser discs. Forget about it. Linus just made a video about it. It's over. Oh, it is now. If I fucking want to stop buying everything else and just save all the money. Sadly, most, <laughs> most times I hit him is just cooked. Uh, no, I, I, uh. I do the same. I do prefer him cooked. I have eaten them raw on occasion, uh, but it's not. I wouldn't prefer a raw potato over because that would be just a flat-out lie, a bald-faced lie to say I prefer raw potatoes. No, but I have eaten. I can't eat them raw, and I can't enjoy it. it. Was if I have salt, that makes it better. I enjoy the smell and taste of potatoes. I, I'm in love with potatoes. I've been in love with potatoes my whole life. They're the love of my life. Uh, YouTubers made them expensive because they just praise them in the sky and everyone. Yeah, and it is. Uh, you notice you retro uh, channels on YouTube, they tend to stop at the NES. Thank fucking Christ, because I, I, my first console was the Atari 2600. I love that console. I was able to buy it, no problem. They usually stop at the, at the NES, and that's why you can still find Atari games. If you think, no, oh, it's not. The, the YouTubers, they, they don't raise the price. It's just supply and demand. Yeah, but supply and demand, exactly. But when you inflate it and you hype it up, now guess what? You create a demand and there's no supply. The supply hasn't changed. You don't create supply. You're not, you're not making fucking any asses. You're not making fucking Ataris. So you just increase the fucking demand by exposure. I understand you're making your, you know, your bread and butter. Yay, I get it, you know? But facts are facts. They do increase the price. Videos that hype up things, they increase the price. That's the way, that's the way it always been. You know, what are you on about? It, it doesn't. You have a movie. 
I don't know. Uh, go look for the. Uh, I guarantee. I don't know. Something random. Let me think here. Let me put my thing in. Okay. Okay. Go. Go find the. Uh, okay. The alarm clock from Groundhog uh, Day. Groundhog Day. I bet that's going to be expensive. And I bet. I bet there'll be if you can even find it. I bet there'll be listeners that say this is the Groundhog Day. Uh, you know. Fuck the same brand. Th yeah, people see on TV and they go. I must have it. It's the way it is. Getting the GameCube is easy enough. Not for long. Trust me. Not for long. And then the Switch my soft mod. But where, if you want a GameCube... Now this... Fuck. Physical games are fucked. I do have a very good fucking news that I... I... Oh. Yeah. When I saw it, a bit of pre-com just happened. Let me tell you. Uh... Bloodstain, Curse of the Moon. I felt heartbroken. I couldn't get the first one physically. I don't. I'm not. I don't care about the digital. Fuck your digital. I, I'm not into it. I want to buy physically. So for the Switch, and any range worse than the no, it doesn't. It's pixel art. Come off it. So I wanted to buy that game so bad. Right? It was everything I ever wanted. It's a modern Castlevania three. What what is there not to fucking be hyped about? Limited run games. Prices fucking through the roof. Horrific. I gave up. He burns me, but I gave up. W what the fuck? I can't spend two. You know, I got miles to feed here. I can't. I can't spend that kind of money on a fucking game, dude. I just, you know, I could, but I don't want to. You know. So he burned me for a long time, and I didn't buy the second. I'm not buying this. The second is cheap, by the way. Is abundant. I didn't want to buy the second. Without buying the first, so I was like, "Burn! I'm never. I fucking gave up on the series. Hey, I guess I'll never experience it then. That's how strong I feel about the digitals. Yes, I won't play it. I guess what? I have other games. You know, this is a flashcard. I could put this flashcard on here and play for the rest of my life. I probably wouldn't be able to finish the games because that's what I'm forty, and time is against me right now. Okay, stop with the fucking forties and the thirties. Not. I'm middle age. That's the way it is. Uh, you know, and uh, I don't know, man." how long I'll go for, you know, so I probably wouldn't even be able to do that, so I have plenty of games here, thank you very much, but I really wanted that one, it's not I want to play, I want to play on the channel, it was before the channel thing, and, uh, you know, today, I fucking go on eBay, and I look for it, because every now and then I go in there to torture myself, say, look at the thing I won't get, in the hopes of getting something cheap, you know, cheaper, at least, yeah. And wouldn't you know, it didn't it pay off for me not buying the exorbitant amount of money. Castlevania, uh, sorry, Castlevania, it is Castlevania though, we all know it is. Uh, Bloodstain, uh, Curse of the Moon Chronicles. I'm like, what the fuck is that? Reasonable price, by the way. You know, 40 something, 50. Uh, contains one and two. Bingo. Physical. <laughs> yeah, I got it. I bought it immediately. Immediately. Imme I never bought something that quick in my life. So I'll be playing that here in due time. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Save me the middle age. is slowly getting away from the stone age. <laughs> yes. Last year, I paid seven. It was that they're getting more expensive in Germany. Germany, everything's fucking expensive. You guys are crazy. I come across listen on eBay, uh, on eBay here, in uh, from Germany, and I go like, "Are you high? What's wrong with you? Like, <laughs> what's going on here? Uh, no, I'm not interested in that. Thank you. It's insane." <laughs> saying here, purposely, I love when you do in, the, in that voice. What voice? I make a lot of weird voices sometimes. Cre uh, um, yeah, creepy, weird, wacky. I make voices a lot. Sweden here, things are rough too. Got to pay a lot for my 21 inch screen. Yeah, he told me the price. I was like, well, well it's kind of right, but it's kind of right for the modern age. It wouldn't like that. There was a Trinitron for sale here, VGA monitor, 1024. Resolution, right? Uh, I can't remember. Yeah, 1024, yes. Vertical. It went for 30 pounds minimum bid. I forgot. 
I forgot. Okay, I fucking forgot. It was eleven o'clock. The the bidding ended. I was gonna get minimum price, definitely. I I bid I bid to win. I rarely lose bids. I don't like bids. I I prefer buy now. But every now and then I have to. There's no option, right? I got my PVM thirteen hundred for like very cheap for that for that for bids. You know, I prefer buy now. But listen, I forgot. It sold for minimum price. The guy bid thirty and he got it for thirty. I got my Samsung HD CRT for twenty British pounds. I've seen a later for sale is rare. It's a is an HD CRT with terrible geometry, but acceptable ten eighty i. It it looks okay. It has HDMI, so it's kind of unique. I pay twenty. I seen it on sale for sale later on on eBay for three hundred fucking fifty. Some of the controllers, because I used to collect controllers, I have a shit ton of them. Some of them are insane. The price is that the chainsaw controller, after Resident Evil 4 remake came out, you went through the roof. I already have mine, thank God. You went through the roof. Insane. Like people are making fucking shorts on YouTube and TikTok shit about how much they paid on it, which why would you advertise that? You're a sucker. You paid you you overpaid, sir. It's nothing to be proud of. It's not you're not flexing. The controller you're flexing that you paid five hundred fucking dollars. Guess what? I paid like thirty dollars. Thank you. Came in earlier, you know. Papuza's gone. I gotta go now. I'm a little sleepy here for the drink or a few cans of beer. Take care. Thank you, buddy. Have a good night. Buenas noches. Have a good one. I'll continue here. I have to play. Yeah? Is, is this what I'm doing here? I'm playing this. Mm hmm. I reckon I am. Let me check the uh, views here in a while. What's, uh, what's cooking here? Motherfuckers. You son. All right, it's fucking, uh, we saved here, we saved. It was a rat. Oh, you fuck. So I got reverse fucking ghost. Ah! Piece of shit. Okay, the, the trick here is to go fuck yourself. And I looked again, and I forgot again, didn't I? That's how I had to do, you piece of shit. Okay, let's... Yeah, 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 now I see you here. Do I have to use him? Fuck. Get out of here! <sighs> ah, the reverse go. God damn it. No, this is. Well done. Mr. Lefer, have a good night. It's 3 a.m. in there. Yeah, it's just 1, 4 to 5 a.m. here. So it's not too much for me yet. I'll hang out here for a while. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. That's what we do. If everybody left here, guess what? I, I still here. No sleep. I've been fucking around with my sleep. I've been, I've been going to bed at 4 fucking a.m. and shit and waking up. I don't know. Fucking 11. Is that enough? 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 11, that, six hours is not enough for me. It might be for some people. I need my eight hours, but I'm not getting them. Uh, fuck yourself. Not happening. Okay, there we go. No, this is beautiful. Should bet the music. We'll lose the music, yeah? Mm-hmm. Fucking ghost. Yeah. Okay. All right, we're getting somewhere. Don't hesitate. Just ah, fucking reverse ghost. It just fucks with. Mm! Give me the mushroom, you piece of shit. I'll give you the fucking purple mushroom. Oh god, this shit. Okay. Ah. What the fuck? Yeah, but. What now? But it's inverted. How the fuck? Give me the coins, you piece of shit. I'm just gonna go for it. Fuck it. I, I, I don't know, dude. There we go. There's eyes on a the fucking thing. 
is all inverted now. You're insane, gold member. Ah! Small jumps. Fuck. I hate small. Oh no. Don't kill me, you fuck. Oh my god. Oh! Give me this. Is there something here? No, there's nothing. Come on. Oh. Give me. Oh my god. What's happening? Ah! Why? Why would you do. What the fuck? This is so fucked up. So, okay. So you have a reverse. Ah! I thought it was a platform. And sorry for raping your fucking ears. God damn it. The frag is, is fun. This is a fun game. It's a fun hack, you know? Yeah, okay. Let's go. <laughs> Fuck off. Go, 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 Inspector Gadget. There's a new Spectre Gadget game. What the fuck is that about? Ah! La 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 la! Fucking fuck off. What is this magical place here? Is this something? Well. Oh! What the fuck? What? What? This is crazy. No, but I can't jump on him. I don't understand the logic here. Did I? Am I dead already? Can I uh, do the old... Oh, you can. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yeah, but then good luck here, asshole. The fuck am I supposed to do? I think I fucked myself hard here already. Bitch ass. Is there a way? Can I find it? A... Oh, the thing is up there. I guess uh, I'm, I'm gonna die. I might as well die in style, right? Right? So... Urgh. Now. It's the way it goes, bitch. Fuck. No music, dude? Are you serious? Oh, I guess so, yeah. Well. No, you're not rushing me. Wait a second. I can fix this shit. Right the fuck now. Uh, right here. Uh... So it's not too loud. It should be okay. There we go. We'll make our own fucking music. It's a synth pop or whatever it is. I can't hear nothing from me. It's still silent, by the way. It's just for you. Let me know if it's still loud or blah, blah, blah. You know. Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. They're going there. All right. There we go. Oh, this is permanent. Oh, I got... So it lights up, but it's not... I, I was under the impression this is going to be like temporary platforms or something. So that's why I'm freaking out here. But it's not. They are, are permanent. Ah! <laughs> oh, shit. Don't hear the music I'm speaking of. No. What the fuck is going on here? I'm supposed to have background music here. Alright. Let's try it again. No. Supposed to have music. Uh, not from the game. No. Supposed to have background music. Okay, maybe shoot low. Can I hear anything? They gotta put maximum fucking volume. Is there, is there music in there now? Nothing? Let me check. Let me check the advanced audio property. Ah, I get it. Boom! Boom! Okay, I'm gonna turn it down. There you go. Maybe that's too loud. You get the music now? Yeah. 
Get off my CRT, you're not stealing the thunder here. It's supposed to be very low now, kind of, it's just kind of like in the background. Too low, there we go. Boom. Nothing that's too loud. Let me know if it's too loud or too low, I don't know. Let me know. A little louder. Is that loud enough? As it is now, so I'm, I won't be touching it. Let me know. But now there's music for the game, so, from the game, so. If there's music from the game, stop. Uh, I'll leave the music, like right now, even though it's nothing that interesting right now. Because basically the save states fuck up with the music. Why save states, man? Come on. Put motherfucking checkpoints on your ha fucking hacks. I'll be playing a lot of Castlevania hacks here, by the way. Incidentally. That's gonna happen. Oh, shit. I love being lost in video games here. Just playing around. Move, you fuck. Motherfucker. Alright. I just love video games in general. Get out. Okay. Uh, just memorize where they are. It's right beneath the Trinitron wire here. <laughs> there we go. And then just don't fuck around, you know. See where they're shining here? Right here. It's not that hard, dude. It, it really isn't. If you're in a hurry, then you get fucked, you know. There we go. It's that simple. Oh, fucking... Okay. Oh, shit. Okay. Ah! I was just gonna say small jumps. Mother... <laughs> no, no, no. Get me out. Get me... Uh, still alive. But not for long. This is this is the end of... Lo this is a, a land of fuckery here. This is nothingness. You just died there. Think that's good? There you go. That's the spot. Put the music on. Boom. There we go. Be right back. Not no problem, Cat Crasher. There we go. Let me know if the music is too high. Come on, man. Move. So, for me, it's quiet here. I, I don't hear anything. I don't have a... Uh, I can put, like, on the speakers or, or something. Uh, fi the monitoring out because it, it's just... You know. Then the microphone will pick up, and it'll fuck everything up. It'll be a double sound within a sound. I don't know, it'll be like fucking Inception here. There we go. When I tracked him there, and that's it, and then that's it. And just pay attention where it is. Don't rush yourself, and it'll be fine. You gotta remember the tiny jumps out there. Okay. There we go. Oh, too bad. A Luigi time. Uh, tiny jumps, tiny, 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 fucking tiny. Yeah. Damn it, I can't do tiny jumps for a while. Go, keep going, asshole. You fucking Gavon. God damn it, man. What the fuck? I lost everything here. Can I? Oh, oh, there's a, a mushroom here. Fuck up. Fucking fruit fly here again. Oh my god, I can't. Ah! Ah! The fuck off. Just keep. The fuck? What? What? What am I so. How? That don't make no sense. <laughs> ah! Jump! <laughs> Fuck! I don't know, dude. <laughs> what is this? All right, music of the game is back. And can mute this one. There we go. Sheer Vanity seems fine. Thank you for the feedback. I always appreciate technical feedback because, listen. If I don't get technical feedback here, and it's fine, it's not, it's not your fucking job. But then when I go on YouTube, things are fucked. And like, all oh, the fucking sound is fucked. I have to fucking download the VOD, I gotta go open on Adobe Premiere Pro. I have to fucking edit a level, I gotta wait for the download, it's horrible. I'd rather just export, it's so easy, like, done with the stream, click on download, I download my VOD for my own personal record, and sometimes I have to edit, and then I click on export. Off to YouTube it goes immediately, it's fucking awesome. It's the best shit ever. Right. 
a bit, some of the levels here are a bit confusing. And I, don't, and I don't know if you were here in the beginning, but there's always the chance that I got the bad ROM hack of this that has a cat statue missing, meaning you cannot finish the game. Uh, I played this game one time. I cannot, for the love of me, I'm not even joking. I cannot remember if I beat the game. I cannot. I just cannot. I remember playing it, but I can't remember if I fucking beat it, right? Oh, fucking goddamn. It's so fuckery. It's so much fuckery because it's ghosts you look at and you shoot the opposite, right? So here's uh, Topsy Turvy here. It's all fucked. Hmm. Oh. Can you please, for the love of God, do a tiny... I can't, I can't do it. I can't do it. That, that first jump. And that's a really fucking me up. I know there's a... There's one here. Oh my God. I... Oh my God, this guy's such a fuck. Get out! You're inconvenient. Oh my god, no. <laughs> mm. How? That's three lives. That doesn't lives matter? You know, here, fuck off. How the fuck would I get... Oh my god, I have to... Urgh! Jesus Christ, man. The pe... Okay, I guess we'll carry this until we get stuck somewhere. Fuck you, you asshole. I see you down there. God, this part is annoying as fuck. Uh, ah, you fuck! Fuck off. Okay, come on. It has to be here, dude. This shit here, right? And the fucking lava piece of shit. I'm watching for trickery. Oh my god, is that it? Oh shit. Oh no, he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, Lanchifa. Good shit. God, but I, I wouldn't give you a fat lip a dip right now. Motherfucking skull. Yeah, Shear says, oh man, that would be bad. I was watching out for, for that shit there. And back to not seeing stuff. See, I think I'm on the max here on the brightness, right? I mean, it's a little better. I can, something about, it hurts me to go all the way to the brightness. I can't do it with my CRTs. I feel very bad going all the way brightness. I just can't do it. I feel like I'm strangling my CRT. Ah, you motherfucker. I just can't do it. But, uh, it is bright enough. It's washed out here for me a tiny bit. I can see on the monitor here that it looks a tiny bit better. But it is dark. It is supposed to be dark. It's a dark place. I thought it was hard to record here. Spilling the beans here on the secrets. 3D games that don't have a lot of colors. God damn it, they're hard. Uh, I'll give an example. Resident Evil 4. That's tough to fucking record. God damn it, it's tough. It's tough. Pixel art. It's the best. Solid color, pixel art, vivid colors. Uh, and even dark, you can clearly see here, right? But with 3D games, mm, you know, like Resident Evil 4, that's hard to record here. It looks awesome in person, but recording, it is, it is tricky. It is very tricky. Same on flat panels. I never put... You are shortening the live. That's true. If you if you use a lot of uh you you got all the way in the max you're fucking up your your monitor it, it, you are. In fact, this is your, <clears throat> I'm I'm watching the monitor here. I think that's enough. You can see Mario still bright here, 
right? The time is bright, so I don't wanna I don't wanna get go too far. This is an 80s Trinitron, you know. I saved already, so that's it's fine. It's oh, there's a there's a P in there. Just thinking at Cat Crasher right now is enjoying some some French fries. Oh, oh, is there? Okay. Oh, look at it. This is interesting. So when you touch, let me tell you about this level here. So when you touch the switch here, you see this here outline, faint outline here. So we're talking brightness or contrast here, but this one only allows me to do contrast here. Sorry, brightness, nothing else. There's no menu. It's just a brightness knob. That's it. <laughs> It's very, it's an 80 set, you know, they're older. No menu, there's no menu here. None of that stuff. It's a very old set, you know. Uh, I've dialed mine down. I think I'm about 50, 40 to 50% strength. Awesome. If you have, if you're satisfied with your image quality and you have 40 or 50, that tube is going to outlive you. I guarantee you. It's going to outlive you. You're doing good. Uh, and Cat Crasher says it's looking amazing, though. Yeah, if it looks up, yeah, that, that's all you need. So at this stage here, don't make sounds. The stage here is when you click the switch, this part becomes solid. See, this game is very interesting. And when you the switch is off, then the, the, the dark part is solid. So that, you gotta you gotta be able to balance both here. So I got so look at that. So the cat is on the other side. So I got to There we go. See? And by the way, if you don't catch the what what's happening? Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. But then how Oh, there's a block in here. I I got you. I got you, bitch. Oh! What the fuck? I fell down. You motherfucker. There we go. Oh, the music is playing. It's not the music on the stage, but we'll, we'll take it. I mean, yours here looks amazing. But yeah, I mean, the one you've seen right behind me, supposedly from 2006, it should be good. Oh, yeah, no, you you got you got to. And thank you, by the way, for the compliments. I know it's on the on behalf, on behalf of my Trinitron. Thank you for the, comp the compliment. Give me a fucking mushroom. You piece of shit. Okay. Didn't I kill this motherfucker? Kill this cocksucker. Get the, get the fuck out of here. What are, you, what are you doing? Get out. No, I need a... How the f... Okay. Oh, 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 oh. But then I fell here like a bag of shit, didn't I? I didn't know there was going to be a fucking pit in there. I thought I was just going to fall down like it was all fun and games, right? So I, I reckon I have to come this way here. And nope. Okay. Nothing. And we lost the jingle, by the way. Oh, fuck off. I don't, I don't know where. Get out. Oh, I think I should have made it here. So what? And now what, motherfucker? What? Now what? I just... Oh, there's the door. At 2006, that's as late as it gets in with a CRT. My God, you have a, you have a CRT for a lifetime there, mister. Uh, if there's a hole there... If there's a hole, there's a way, Mike and Mark... <laughs> <laughs> uh, same with Castlevania. I find it amazing. Like, there's a hole here. You get hit here. It goes like, whoa! <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> it just finds a way. And Cat Crasher says, uh, yeah, I remember 2005, 2006. Definitely. Yeah. I remember 2005. I was loading up on, on VHS because uh, DVD was in, you know? You know, I told that one guy one time that it doesn't matter because uh, DVDs are actually way older than that. And uh, I told him that it doesn't matter when the technology... You know, the flat panels are actually quite old, LCDs. Uh, 60s, I believe. 
it was in there. Do you know that vaping uh, was invented in the in the fifties by uh, an American guy, but it got nowhere. So in the end, with credit, there's a Chinese guy that made it work and became popular. So a lot of things can come earlier, but the the consumer didn't adopt it. Shut the fuck up. We were setting this shit. What are you on about? You're high. So the consumer didn't adopt it, and that's that's a thing. So if the consumer didn't adopt it, it was nothing. In 2005, I was buying a lot of VHS. I hadn't adopted DVD. Many people hadn't. It was new, but it wasn't. It had come up a long time before that, but it just, the sales were down. It was too expensive. You know, like fucking OLEDs. A lot of people, I don't have an OLED. They're expensive. I haven't, I haven't been able to afford one yet. I mean, I probably have, but I'm busy buying CRTs. But, you know, when it becomes cheap and available, plainly available and cheap, then people start buying. So I told a guy that once, and he said, no, you're wrong. Uh, customer customer demand means nothing. I was like, what are you talking about? You know, it's insane. Anything past your thousand, Cat Crasher, is good. Listen, I give you some encouraging words. I have three sets from the 1970s, all working beautifully. Done. Done. People go, ah, CRTs are dying. Yeah, well, they're not being made anymore. So in the end, they will ultimately perish. But it won't, your ass will be nowhere here, nowhere around here to find out. Let me tell you, confidently. Nah. I, uh, I think everyone here in the chat right now, everyone lurking, uh, CRTs will outlive you. Maggots will eat your tits. And the CRTs will continue. Your kids will have them. Trust me. Mark my words. Hmm. Electric cars existed before. Yeah, that's right. That's another very old one. Very old, actually, very old. For example, uh, people, if you're into music, did you know that tablature is older than musical notations? Musical notation, you know, like the scores. Is that crazy? Look it up. Think I'm full of shit? Look it up. Google's there. It is. I was surprised. I was. I will be as surprised as you were. I know both uh, on certain instruments, but uh, I was very surprised. I was a hundred percent sure that tablature or tabs for short. It was a modern convenience. I never imagined they would be that old. Never. Not in a million fucking years. It really surprised the fuck out of me. Get my food out. Go get those fries. Man, I could use some fucking... I love fries. God damn it. Awesome. Same. I don't want to spread lies. <laughs> spread the rumors. St let's start a rumor here right now. Like that Family Guy episode. Do you know that... Uh, it's a horrible thing, but what's his name? Mente Capes. What is his fucking name? God damn it, I got from uh, American Gigolo. Oh, do you know that Rob Schneider's Rob, Rob Schneider, he goes on and pick up immigrants, you know, pick up illegal aliens to choke him in the shower while he pays them. Isn't that a horrible, disgusting thing? <laughs> and then later on, Rob Schneider is like, Mr. Schneider, come look. Get, I don't pay you to watch the fucking news, so get in the fucking shower. <laughs> I love that show. I should have, I, you know, I think it's because the quality has gone down to such an extent, which deja vu, you know, happens all the Simpsons, anyone? Quality goes down so much, I forgot about the show, but Family Guy is truly my f most favorite show of all time. No mistake. Now, if you talk, well, cartoon, somebody asked cartoon. It is a cartoon, right? So if you ask my favorite show of all time, Frasier, 100%. It's like not even a question. And then second will be us. And then third will be I don't give a shit. Those two are enough. No, no third. Off to CRT, fucker. There we go. Okay, so I done goofed here, basically. 
So I think you need to come in earlier. Oh, with the, with the, with the music again. Okay, fine. Have it your way. Illegal aliens. <laughs> yeah, speaking of illegal aliens, you choke him in the shower. Rob Schneider. That's sick fuck, you know? That's what... Ah, fuck off! Oh, you gotta kill that. You got the music here. I got nothing. But I'm hoping you have some music in there. Some synth. Chill synth or something. Is it? Yeah. Oh, you... So here, it become that becomes a pit. It's a bit confusing, trust me. It's it just, it gets a bit crazy here sometimes. So I have, so I do it, okay. Oh. <laughs> well, my wife is playing Castlevania 4, right? Because I figured it's the easiest one, so I give it to her. And it's like, ha, 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 ha. Oh shit, I fucked up. Ah, oh, damn it, motherfucker. I get off me if right good in ah <laughs> that was close man come on I thought I got confused I just carried a P thing back here yeah so I have to do you fucking bunch of fucks all right uh okay I done goofed I admit it I'll be the first one to tell you I fucking forgot everything. Can you please not take my fucking mushroom? Get out of here. That thing. Look at that. How weird it looks. I, I love the aesthetics of this here. Rum hack. Yashim, I think is his name. Wherever you are, you did well, man. This is this is the hack of the ages here. This is this is good shit, you know? This is like imagination here work. Look at that. Oh, fuck. Okay. Why can Nintendo come up with this? You know what Nintendo did with Mario Maker? Is they stole a bunch of ideas that were already there with ROM hacks. You know when I played Mario Maker? Before I played Mario Maker... Can I... Yeah. I had played a lot of ROM hacks and... Let me tell you here, immediately... What the fuck is this? You piece of shit, you. Let me tell you that Nintendo stole a, a lot of ROM hack ideas. Yeah, they sure as fuck did, man. A lot. Like, a lot. It's funny, right? They shut down everyone who, who makes a fan game and shit for no pro no profit. And when I played Mario Maker, holy shit, a lot. Because I had... Oh, I had played a lot of... Uh, how would I get up there, my good sir? No. Uh, a shell? Someone? Oh. Fuck you. Uh, I had played a lot of ROM hacks by then, and absolutely they stole a lot of shit from ROM hacks. Yeah, I understand that they are their IP, but you know, you kind of a. Uh... So where, where do I go with this now? Ah, well, <laughs> that's I don't think I was supposed to do that. Okay. Okay, the music is back. Fuck this music, man. I want some other fucking french fries. I wish I had some french fries here with ketchup. Some cat soup. It's okay. We, we're we getting the lay of the land here. Ah, fuck. I always forget about this asshole. I want to just kind of die, you fuck. You know what's heartbreaking about this hack here? If you forget... You see that... Uh, the cat statue. If you don't get that, you're 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 kind of fucked. There's nothing you can do. You you're gonna get you to the last boss, and uh, I don't I can't remember what happens. I think I've been to the last boss without the the stuff. Uh, you're basically fucked royally. They're gonna tell you you're a piece of shit, and not they're not gonna let you go forward with the game. Okay, uh, yeah yeah okay I got it. I'm fucking old, all right. I'm basically a young Joe Biden here. Get get out. Ah, you fuck. Get out. Okay, that's all you need to do. You need to go through here. You fucking fuck. Okay, I need to pay attention to things that go bump in the night. Who here is a fan of... Uh, uh what's it called? I, I, what is this... 
<sighs> no! Fuck. I thought I was being clever. Okay, fine. Hmm. Oh, shit. Uh, Dead Island. Things that go bump in the night. Get the... Oh, man. What are you doing? Oh! Oh, no. <laughs> oh, man, I love those hacks. Okay, so it's just a matter of going back, yeah? Is that it? Mm, I can't remember his own... No, his own black, yes. You know a, game, uh, a movie that's awesome? Beer Fest? Beer Fest is cool. Because it's man with black. Always bet on black. That movie rules. I love that movie. I need to watch that movie again at some point. Mm, yeah, I see you there, you piece of shit. Okay, uh, so forget that side. Oh! Oh! Are you crazy? I get... Well, at least I don't die here, I suppose. It... Well, sir. Cat Crash is back. You got your fries, man. I'm jealous of you, Cat Crash. I won't lie to you. If I had fresh fr French fries here. Fresh, fresh fries. Fresh Prince of Bel Air. If I had French fries here, man, would I be... I'd be a happy dude. You know, my wife left me some noodles. It's good. We ate uh, tortellini earlier. That was, that was pretty cool. Uh, but man, french fries, huh? By God. Good shit. I hope they... You got... And nuggets, you son of a bitch. Now you're just teasing me. Oh, man, nuggets. You know what I love? Let's talk about Jamie Oliver for a second as I pour more whiskey, because fuck you. Uh, Jamie Oliver is out there in Tennessee or some shit, right? West Virginia. I can't remember where he was. And he's showing all how disgusting chicken nuggets are, right? To the kids. <laughs> I hate Jamie Oliver. He's a, a cunt. So he's out there and he's showing like a pace thing. I, I don't know. I was supposed to impress him or something. And then after he does that, he asks, now who here still want to have chicken nuggets? Because, right, he, I think he wants to... He wanted to uh, introduce the healthy alternative or some shit. Nobody was listening. All the kids raised their hands, pretty much. And his reaction, cry like a bitch. It's, <laughs> yeah. I, I, and he cried later. I don't think it was on that video. Oh, he knows. Cat Crasher knows. I watched that shit, and I I frankly masturbate to that video on the day on a daily basis. It is the best. It is the best shit ever made in the history of everything, that video. It is my passion. I watch it daily. Just to watch his face and it's like, ah, oh, it's orgasmic to me. To watch Jamie Oliver, the man who went, who went to Congress or whatever the fuck is the equivalent here and introduced the fucking sugar tax. The, dumb, the dumbest shit ever, right? And he fucking... The kids all want the chicken nuggets. Jamie Oliver, you lose, dude. <laughs> they want the chicken nuggets. <laughs> uh, he cried later on about some bullshit. I think, I think he cried about. I don't know. I'm a, I'm more familiar. If I'm being honest, I'm more familiar with the South Park episode. I can see both sides of the video, but it's fucking hilarious. I can, I'll can i be honest with you, because I'm very honest. I can see only one side, and and that'll be whichever side Jamie Oliver is not on. That's the only side that I can see. If Jamie Oliver is on one side, is on one side I'll be on the other always. Yeah? If Jamie Oliver is safe on one side and the people are jumping off a cliff, I'll probably prefer to jump off a cliff. That That's how I feel about Jamie Oliver. Because he introduced the, 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 the sugar tax here. And let me tell you what it did. Uh, it fucked up my coke. My coke addiction. Not cocaine. Coca-Cola. You know? Fucked me up. And uh, I had to switch to diet. Which is something I used to mock. And not be into. But here I am. You know? Fucking uh, nanny state shit here, man.
I'm a grown ass 40 year old man. I want my fucking full fat coke. And then wouldn't you know, the fucking diet coke and the sh zero sugar all went up in price eventually anyways. As I told my wife, the minute that happened, I told her that's what's going to happen. They're going to raise the price on the sugar one because they have to, right? They're after profits. But give it time. They'll get people used to it. And they'll raise the price on the zero sugar as well. And they did. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what am I doing here? What's happening? Okay. Nah. Oh! What the f... He did a stop here. Okay, I don't think I need to be on the, on the white place zone here. Okay, so they have a door here. That means if you fuck up, it's right there, right? Oh, my God. I, I don't know. I'm I'm kind of going blindly here. You know what I hate? I hate this type of situation here. Listen to all this while I'm stuffing my fucking thing <laughs> with French fries. I love it. And nuggets, chicken nuggets. Ah, oh, chicken nuggets. Okay, I, I risked it. Chicken nuggets are fucking awesome, man. Oh, fuck you! Do I... Oh! Demolition Man, the fat guy. Well done. So I throw the thing in there and then I die. Oh, nice. Yeah, no, no, you're sober. So yeah, uh, I throw the thing up there and then I just fucking died. Isn't that awesome? Isn't that a big like fucking haha -ha moment? I'm, like ho hold it. I, I'm 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 not done I'm not done holding my sides here. Ha 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 What the fuck was that? What was that? <laughs> Honestly man, what the fuck was that? What was that shit? <laughs> I saw the coins, I saw oh they want me to throw the thing up. Clever. This is like you have to be observative, right? I'm like, oh, motherfucking genius over here. The voice of a fucking generation. So I throw the fucking thing up and what? what's my reward? I die. Isn't this emote great on the floor giving up? Yes. <laughs> it's good shit, man. It's good shit. I love the emos. At first I didn't get it. I won't lie to you. When I come, when I come, when I came here to Twitch the first time, or when I used to go on Twitch before I even started the shit, right? I would see all the a bunch of emotes and it's like, because I'm and I am older, right? I'm like a grumpy. I'm like, this is a bunch of loud trash. What is what is all this loud? Gr what is this? And now I, I'm here. I get it. You know, it is funny. I made emotes. You know, I'm into it now. You know, it's cool. You can uh, you can convey a lot of things with just an emote. It's it's pretty cool. You know, open your mind. Way it is. <sighs> Having some way scare. Cat Crasher said, I think I told you in my stream we have all we all have our strengths and weaknesses. So much shit to have knowledge that I don't. And the stuff I know better than you. Just how it goes. Yeah, that's true. There was one commercial that stuck with me that I play here on my intro today. Because uh, sometimes I don't vet the commercials. I don't, you know, sometimes I search for like music to afford the copyright so I don't have to download the VOD. But it was one, it was a guy that plays, it was a black guy playing, that play, he's a basketball player, right? Plays basketball. And some, some old white guy that plays, you know, the piano. And he's showing like how the guy, oh, he plays the piano and then I'm going to go against him and play the piano. It's very funny commercial and then the guy, you know, the old white European guy is playing the piano. And then he goes try to play the piano, the basketball player, and it's fucking his, his ass, right? But then he's on, 
<laughs> later on he goes i can destroy this motherfucker on a court <laughs> and then there's this old white stiff guy you know going against him on the fucking basketball court and getting fucked you know and he's just like <laughs> it's very funny man it's like it's true you know this guy can play the piano but when it comes to the it's like foul <laughs> <laughs> uh, and cat crash is sorry if i somehow come off as better and i never walk on eggshells here with me ever cat crasher you're fine whatever you say uh, is never gonna offend me okay you you be you you're cool dude you're, you're doing good don't worry about that shit here be yourself and it doesn't come out as pat patronizing as well I know when somebody, you know, I, I have the distinction, somebody's trying to be patronizing, but even then I was like, does it really affect me? You know, does it really, is that really, is it really that bothersome? Somebody's patronizing. I, mean, I came across many people that are patronizing. Like at the end of the day, I mean, does it really, is she shoving a cucumber up my ass? She's not. So, you know, I say she, because I, I come across a lot of women that were patronizing, but it's, it's fine. You know, it's like, whatever you do your thing, you know, but you're not. Uh, sorry, I feel like somehow came off as patron. I know you didn't. No, not at all. Zero. Like, I, my body feels nothing. No patronizing at all. I thought it was funny. I was thinking about that basketball commercial. You know, see, I'm, I'm... I don't know if you like movies, but if you ever have the chance, watch the movie Sling Blade. Because I explain to my wife how I am sometimes. Sometimes my wife, she makes a mistake of thinking I'm intelligent. <laughs> and I'm like, no. Let me tell you how I am. So, in the Sling Blade, bit of Bob Thornton, which is unrecognizable, he is. And I'm over. I actually did not even know it was him. So, there's a part this gay guy's coming out of the closet. There's a, they're in a small town in the south, right? The guy's coming out of the closet telling him, explaining, and he's low in the head. He's, he's, he's not right in the head, bit of Bob Thornton, the character, Carl. And he tells him, you know, after he tells him a bunch of stuff, he goes like, you know, you always seem to be lost in thought. You always seem to be deep in thought. What are you thinking about right now? Yeah, and the guy is very hopeful that is like his outward appearance is like his, you know, he's slow in the head, but somehow he might be like a secret genius, like, like Hollywood tries to portray autism, right? So... He asked the guy, what are you thinking about right now? And he's like, hmm, right this minute. Hmm, yeah. I was thinking about, uh, I could get, uh, could use another three cans of that potted meat. <laughs> and the gay dude feels very disappointed. He's like, ah. He's like, he thought that something was special there, but he wouldn't. And that's me. You know, I tell my wife. What are you thinking about? I'm thinking I get three more cans of potted meat. She knows the reference. <laughs> I'm not deep at all. <laughs> I said, there's another good quote. My body feels nothing. Uh, and got no gas in it. Oh, you know that part, though. <laughs> they all, it's funny how it is. I love that movie so fucking much, man. He goes like everybody's trying to figure. He's a he's a he's a whiz with a lawnmowers, and <laughs> it's like ain't got no gas in it. It's like you know we overcomplicate things. There's so many masters in that movie. I just love that movie. I used to say it's my favorite, but I have to say it's Alien. But that movie is very close. I really, really, really love that movie. And I love that part that uh, Dwight Yoakam, who's a country singer, I really fucking enjoy. I love Dwight Yoakam. I love his music. Guitars, guitars and Cadillacs. Uh, so many goddamn good songs that fella has. And he has a, has a biscuit uh, venture in Bakersfield, right? And I love Dwight Yoakam. And, and to see him playing that, the villain in the movie he plays it so well it's so good it's just so good. he's a country singer he's not an actor and he played it so well it's so good that when he he freaks out if y'all don't go out <laughs> if y'all don't shut up i'm gonna go out of my mind here <laughs> and then when he goes crazy i know the whole speech we ain't got no goddamn band 
We don't need no fucking shitty ass manager neither, you motherfuckers. I'm the only sand sound bitch here. Just get the fuck out of my house now. <laughs> Come on, Randy. Go fucking practice, Randy. You motherfuckers. Y'all just a bunch of losers. It's just so good when he fucking goes out. I had a cu- uh, cousin, oh, sorry, an uncle who was just, he's dead now. He was just like that. He was, he would drink a couple of beers and he would pick on something that somebody said and he would go nuts and tell everybody, make a big scandal and tell everyone to get the fuck out of his house. You know, me included as a kid. So I had a, I don't know, it was fucked. <laughs> it was nuts. And still, I look back on it. I was like, am I traumatized? I just, it's funny, man. It was kind of funny. Don't spoil the movie for me. I won't, I won't spoil it for you. Watch it, though. Watch it when you have the chance. Sling Blade is one of the greatest movies I have ever seen in my entire life. It's just so... It pulls you into that universe. It's nice and cozy. It's just so good. And Antique Mode is here. Howdy. It says, cheers, cheers, hey, ho, ho. I score Stella 6 PK for $8.99. Oh, shit, a st- uh, six pack of Stella? The beer? Is that we talking about the Belgian beer? Cat Crasher, watch. F- Cat Crasher, I know a lot of people say they watch a movie and they don't. Please do. Please watch that movie and come back to me, absorb its message, and come back to me to talk about it. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Really do, man. I know you're busy working with a fucking galvanizing shit, but I hope you have some time. Download a torrent or whatever you have to do. Watch the fucking movie. Come back. I want to I wanna hear. I want to, for once in my life, I want to talk to somebody who watched Sling Blade past the memes, who actually watched it. I want to talk to somebody who watched Sling Blade to talk about it. Antique mode goes, yep, oh, is this eight nine and nine? That's pretty that's goddamn good. Galvanize Cat Crasher, honestly, do yourself a favor, he says on my list. Put it on top of the list. Make it priority. Honestly, you won't regret it. You will not regret it. I show I told that movie to a Scot Scotsman I, I met when I was in, up in Scotland. Gail Feller spoke Gaelic. Catch a vegetable footer. He spoke Gaelic and he was from up there from Inverness and he watched that movie and he fell in love with it. I swear to God, he, I never, I have never uh, introduced that movie or mentioned to someone and they were disappointed. Ever. Never happened. Never happened. I mentioned that movie quite a bit. I really love that movie. I think it's a masterpiece. Yeah. I know I'm biased a bit, but it is, it is damn good. It's a, it's a simple, no CG, no bullshit, awesome movie. Just awesome. Just just very good. I'm going to dip my cock in a galvanizer. You can go, oh, I had a little smelting accident. <laughs> I like, well, you can't say gold because it's not gold. It would be silver, right? I like silver. <laughs> Antique Mode says, I'll put it on tonight. Do it. Don't you fucking feed me lies, you motherfucker. Tell me you're fucking putting it on and do watch it. A lot of people say a lot of shit. If you're watching the movie tonight, I'll be here tomorrow with whatever fucking stream I got going on. Uh, and I want to hear somebody. Somebody please watch fucking Sling Blade and tell me about it. I want to hear it. Antique Mode is a man of his word. Awesome. I can't wait then. I want to, I, I love telling people about that movie. It's what I do. It's my main purpose in life. I was put here by God to tell people about Sling Blade. I, it's my calling. Like people with a fucking wire, you know? <laughs> you watch the wire. Cat Crasher says, please stream them. Oh, I am. I am very, and I hate saying that word, but I'm very anal about the schedule. I, Time to start is it's very fucking tough. But days, I need to be here. If I'm not here, if I miss a day of streaming, on the days that I say I would be streaming, even though I did put a notice saying, hey, sometimes it might not happen because shit happens, right? But I really, 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 if I'm, listen, if I miss a stream, if, I, if you see my schedule there on my fucking panels, and it's a missed day, you can be certain 100% that, I'm, that I tried and then I'm pissed off. 
That much I can tell you. If I'm not here and I'm supposed to be streaming today, you bet your fucking ass I'm at, I'm at home cussing at some hardware to fail or some bullshit. Honestly, I need to be here. I want to do Sunday. Listen, I do pedal, uh, do a bit of back pedaling on the uh, hyperscan because I think the hyperscan is a whole day stream. That's for sure. I'll be here tomorrow. I'm not sure about the hyperscan, if I'll be able to do it. The hyperscan has to be something that I wake up early in the morning, drink my coffee, jerk off, and then come down here to the shed, and then I can play the whole day. I cannot start late. It's, not, it's, I, it's a mystery, the console, to me. So I need to be here early in the morning. But I'll be here tomorrow, that much sure, unless I know somebody shoots me in the head or something. Okay. Cat Crasher said, that's why I don't have a schedule. It just stresses me the fuck out because I'm an anxious person, I told you. I've been keeping up Thursday, Saturday for a good bit now. That's it. Listen, you got the right attitude. You don't promise nothing, you'll never disappoint no one. Nope. Here's how I feel about promises. That's why I don't like if I'm making a promise and I can't come from is the end of the fucking world. Nobody, nobody on earth right makes you make promises you do them yourself so if you give your word to somebody you're goddamn right you gotta fucking do it and if you can do it you better have a goddamn good excuse don't fucking promise shit you can't keep it from just don't promise just don't i promise i i kind of mention I'm, I'm very clear my time monday tuesday i'm off every everything else i am in here however I did put a paragraph, a tiny paragraph. I did reduce my word. It was too wordy. I put in there, sometimes shit happens. I'm married with kids. It happens. Shit comes up. Hardware fucks up. I want to put about the hardware, but it was not enough space without getting too long. So, but yeah, nobody makes you promise. So people sometimes ask me to have a, like a, a schedule. And I understand. I, you listen, I hear it. It's important, right? Some people just like one. But I can't. I, I just can't because... I came out here with the, the Atari Jack. Sometimes I'm here. I'm here on the dot. The hardware ain't. ain't. It just it ain't working. Jaguar the other day dropping the red collar. It was two fucking hours before I could get a, a fu okay an hour and a half at least before I could get a stable red collar out of it. And if I I can't start the stream, it's hard. It's old. 30, 40 fucking year old hardware here. How the fuck am I going to show? I show up here. I, I could 100% show up here on time, but my hardware is not always up to par to do the job. So I have to fucking fiddle with shit. I have to fucking uh, reflow solder and I have to do shit, you know? And uh, so I don't want to promise. So I'm not going to promise the hours. It's like I'm here on those days. And if I'm not, I'll put on the update section. Done. Don't, don't ever promise shit you can do. It's ugly. It's sinful is is shit there's, there's no need just don't promise shit then you're done you're off the hook antique mo said i got jerked around so bad with my old job schedule so frustrating when people can say the accurate truth it's just the truth will set you free is always the 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 hard the hard thing hard wearing working is that what you tell crt regina i gotta i gotta say i'm not a feller that talks about sexual private things but let's say there ain't a damn thing wrong with that. If there's one thing I'm good at it, that'll be it. I'll just leave it at that. Damn good. <laughs> if that's one thing, she... Okay, I don't want to talk personal stuff. But let's say people have trouble to keep up with me. <laughs> if there's one thing I have is a libido. But I'll, 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 <laughs> I'll leave it at that. But it's a good joke, though. It's a good joke. If my hardware would not be working, goddamn, that'll be a very fucking sad day. Very, very sad day indeed. I can I can't even fucking imagine. Thank God it's not my problem now. Uh, I have a lot of problems, but that ain't one of them. Thank God. But hey, people have that. You know, not not. Let's say you're hearing that and your junk ain't working. Uh, dude, it happens. Go go seek help. They have treatments and shit, you know? Like, uh, maybe there's uh, some problem with the hormones or something, you know? You, uh, you seek for help, and there's nothing to be embarrassed about. If I had a problem with my junk getting up, I would go somewhere. Oh, well, fucking hell, I would talk to somebody, a doctor somewhere, you know? Uh, shit, you know? Gotta, gotta, <laughs> gotta fucking... 
You gotta have that shit, you know? Mm. Tiny bit more. Tiny, come on now. Come on. We're among friends here. Uh, how come you ain't playing the game? Because uh, you touch yourself at night. There you go. <laughs> you know, sometimes it happens, but it's called a stream. We, uh, we, we just hang out. If it ain't working in a way, use your tongue. You know, oral and oral is damn good. I, I can I can be, I can be with somebody who doesn't like oral. But here's the thing: once when I was a when I was a, a kid, uh, there was this magazine. Uh, you ever seen those? I don't know. Maybe they don't have it in Sweden. Maybe they do. But uh, they have those magazines where they're like a uh, tabloid, right? And they have like the, the boy made a glass. I remember this one in particular. So it was a magazine. It's like the boy made a glass. You couldn't... Like he has a disease that he, he, he touched. But they used in a sense sensational. It was a different time, right? So so this had this guy cut in half. He was he was cut in half. He, half of it. It's not just like... He was literally cut in half. And he, he had a little skateboard under him. And he was married. And this, this tabloid magazine thing is talking about him. And they touched the sexual part, right? <laughs> it was like how you don't have you know the equipment how can you do it and he mentioned a tongue but you know it's funny when i was a kid obviously i don't know what the fuck that means i did i didn't know what any of that means but it was a curious thing that i still remember to this day because kids are very impressionable let's not open this can a jar jar worms because i'm a fucking pervert i'm not joking i believe you i tend here's my deal i tend i cuss a lot and I talk a lot of things i don't tend to talk about my personal like sexual thing it's always like platonic it's always like far away you know i'll say i don't know i'll fuck out jesus any fucking bald hat or some shit like when i'm angry or something but i never really talk about me per se it's just something i'm from <laughs> i'm not i'm not down with it if other people do it it's like hey, i don't fucking give a shit like you're telling me oh he's spilling the beans on everything you know i don't care like nothing shocks me that's what i'm saying but me personally i tend to be a bit i don't know uh private about my personal affairs uh on a certain way but that doesn't mean i'm imposing on other people like i said here i'm all about freedom I really am. I, I really mean that. People should be allowed to be themselves. So you, let's say you're very close-minded sexually or you're open-minded sexually, but only behind closed doors. That's usually how I am. Uh, but I don't feel comfortable talking too much about it at all, to be honest. Uh, but then another person is. That doesn't mean that my me being uncomfortable just applies to me. You know what I mean? So I've been around people that are op openly talking about stuff, and I, uh, I, I really don't care. I'm not bothered by it. I'm not bothered by what people say, usually. I just really like freedom of speech. I, I think it's so fucking important, and I, I like when people can be themselves. And I feel very bad if people are uncomfortable around me because they think I'll be a certain way, and I'll be like... Maybe I'll judge him, or me. I don't know. I feel uncom. I want. I want everyone to be comfortable. That's how I feel. So if somebody's a, a pervert and talk about things, I'll be. As long as you don't know, like, like, not like, don't say sexual things in front of my kids. That's what I would say. Cussing is fine. I cussing in front of my kids, no problem. I tell people you can cuss. They don't cuss. Adults can be adults, but just not like sexual, like explicit sexual talk. That's talking about you, like describing an act. Uh, but my kids are not here. They don't watch my stream, so, you know, that's different. I don't go into details. I, I like, uh, I, uh, how do they say I, uh, kiss and don't tell, right? <laughs> I'll never tell. <laughs> uh, but if somebody does tell, uh, Cat Crash is saying Uber's here? Are you not home? I thought you were home. I met. I figure you. Uh, I imagine you cooking them French fries in your oven. But you saying Ubers here? Cool Runner says this freedom of speech is great, but it should ban Cool Runner before he start talking shit. Uber School Runner. Okay, I thought you were catching an Uber, which took me a while to figure out what the hell that was. By the way, because I've been, I've been out here in the fields. Where I fight for my meals. 
<laughs> I just couldn't resist that fun. But yeah, I, uh, your, your Uber, Uber Disco. Like, if I had to pick the most, I don't know where you're from, Cool Runner. I appreciate you being here, by the way. If I had to pick the most European thing that has ever sounded, it would be Uber Disco. That probably would be the word that I'll go with. Like the most European word ever conceived. Anything with disco, right? But Uber Disco. <laughs> it's just, like to me, it's, it just sounds beyond European. But like CRT Rask, Cool Runner just made fun from my channel. It's say you're from Kentucky, look at him, right? Oh man, that's a good place. You know, I had dreams on time to leave them Harlan County. I just obsessed with that place. I had my bitch ex that we wanted to, I wanted to go to Harlan. I was tired of Mississippi and I wanted to go to somewhere new. And I, I wanted to go to Kentucky so bad. Best place in the lower 48. I'll say because I say low 48 because if you give me a chance to go to Alaska, I would. I turned it down one time. I got where I regret it. It's a place for me, rough and ready, you know. Oh, we're very German here in Cincinnati. Lots of Germans up up north. It's not common in the south, Florida now because a lot of Yankees moved down there. And I hope you don't take offense to me saying Yankee because people got the fucking you know. Fucking corn up their ass nowadays with being offensive with this and that. I never mean no harm, I tell her that much. But, uh, yeah, I know a bit about that. The nation in America and Germans, a lot of Germans elsewhere, not in, not in the South, though. There's a dumb thing in the South with the American ethnicity, which there's no such thing, but people still identify it. I, I guess you've been there so long and you forgot lost stuff you don't know. Most of them are Scottish, though. Scots Irish. That's the bulk of the South, you know. The bulk of the South is Scots Irish, but people ident became to identify as just American ethnicity, which is nonsense if you think of it, you know. Yeah. I am Dutch, Scottish, and then I have some French and Portuguese. As far as I know. And maybe there might be Italian. Now, I grew up with a lot of Italians, but I don't know if I'm Italian blooded. I'll have to do the DNA shit to find out for sure. Nah, I'm probably at least Southern Southerner. Can't fight the accent though, right? Mine has gone neutral quite a bit, but people here still say strong. I, I it's become it's been 13 fucking years, you know. And before even more, because before that I moved to Nevada, which is like a like a different fucking country. It might as well be, you know. People talk so different. I remember meeting a guy from North Carolina out there, and he's like, "Oh, I gotta get away from you." I was like, how come? What are you on about? And it says, because I'm, I'm getting my action back, and I, I fought real hard to lose it. I was like, well, then get the fuck out of here then. <laughs> you know? Shit. Everyone says I don't have one, but I can hear. You know, I met a guy one time I never forget on YouTube. And he's like, you from Mississippi? You didn't sound like you from Mississippi. I was in Biloxi. <laughs> I was like, what are you on about? I don't know what you're on about. But I like Biloxi and Gulfport is like a strip fucking casino, like casino strips out there. You know, a lot of outsiders, they don't have no action. I talk to people from Biloxi sometimes. I hear they might as well be from, from Cincinnati. I don't I don't hear a fucking southern thing on them. And then when you get away from that part, then you, you hear them. But the further north you go with Mississippi, the more you hear, the more southern it gets. Like a kind of fucking opposite day. See, I, I like to use double negatives. I, I don't know how to say anything besides double negatives. <laughs> now, I, I'm curious about this. In Kentucky, do you call Coke as like in soda for everything? Because I think that's just a deep south thing. Because Kentucky ain't no deep south. I mean, it's upper south. So if you say, how do you, what do you call a carbonated beverage? As in Coca Cola and Pepsi and stuff. What do you call? What is the generic word that you use out there? I wonder because people here sometimes they're confused about me saying Coke and by that I mean soda, whatever you want to call it. There's so many names for the damn thing. We call everything soda. There you go. Look at how different it is. 
Antique Mo said, I thought a Southern scholar pop. Let, let me tell you, they don't. Not in, If you say pop, pop in Mississippi, you're going to ba get bashed in the head. And they probably exile you. Uh, it's Coke. However, it's, I said Mississippi, right? If you go, I know for a fact they call pop in other places in the South. The South is a very big region. By good, it, it's very big. So I heard... And I, I live in West Virginia for a while. And they say, I believe, I re, if I recall it correctly, they say soda pop. Like but soda pop. Like I, I might be wrong or misremembering, but I heard folks saying soda pop. You know, I call it pop. Whatever is label. Cool runner calls it pop. People have different words here. They call it fizzy drinks. You know where I'm at now. You catch me dead before I say that. I still say Coke. So Coke for me, like for example, because this is a mind fucker with people. So it's because of the, I read about it. I like, I'm interested in like whiskey. So I read about it because of the predominance of Coca-Cola down there. So this here for me is, uh, I would call a pineapple Coke, you know? And then, well, when I, I live near California uh, in Nevada and they call it soda out there. That's what I remember them saying it. Yeah, soda pop. There you go. That's what I heard. Soda pop. And goddamn, do I need to take a leak, if you excuse me, my good sir. I need to go out there and bleed the old lizard. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. I'll put the brake thing just in case somebody, just for lightness, you know. Somebody comes in here and they're staring at the screen here. And they're, they wonder what the hell is going on. I got to go out there and take a leak. I'll be right back, Hoss. Just a minute. Hold on tight. Hold on to your seats. God damn, I'm flattered about it. I'm too slow here. Holy fucking shit for this crap. Okay, fuck away. Motherfucking, uh... I'm back. Did I mute the mic, the mic thing? Ah! <laughs> Where's the damn glove? There you are. <laughs> Cheers. See here, what's the chat has been up to? What in the hell? This fucking thing is sticking out, eh? Oh, cool. I'm in Phoenix. I thought you're in the UK for some reason. Well, me? I am in the UK. I've been here for 13 fucking years. I uh, want to say PHX. Is that Phoenix, Arizona? There's so many factors as to why people show up or don't show up at Cool Runner. You'll make yourself go absolutely crazy trying to tweak things here and there, and it's just not worth your time. Try to have fun with your games to make the environment. go, oh, y'all talking to each other, I see. See it and then. Phoenix. No, I am in the UK. I, mo I moved here in 2010. Oh, got the break thing out. There we go. 
I've been here. I never left the island. I came here and stay here like a goddamn plant in the pot. It's been working for me, so, you know, it happened. All my kids were born here, and they're raised American, though. They're homeschooled. They don't have no British accents. No offense to Brits. It's just I, I want to homeschool my kids. And my wife and I were doing a good job. The oldest one, and she's very smart. So it's working out. Is there a Nevada in the UK? No, that Nevada that I lived in was in America. I'm not from the UK. I just moved here. Uh, Nevada as in America, as in the West. The state of Nevada. Home means Nevada. Somebody's from Nevada, they don't know it was the state motto. Now, I lived in Reno uh, for a long time, northern Nevada, because there's a, a big distinction between northern Nevada and southern Nevada. I moved here in 2010. Before, when I left the south, I moved to Nevada. Some shit happened down in North Carolina. I moved, you know, from Mississippi, I moved to Florida, then I moved to North Carolina, and then some shit happened, some bad shit happened out there. A friend of mine had an apartment in Nevada, on Ralston, in Reno, Nevada, on Ralston Street, right next to the Greyhound bus station. So I went on a four goddamn day trip all the way out of Reno, and I lived there for many times. Went back to Florida, went back to Reno, went back to Mississippi back in 20, 20, 2008. Last time I was in Mississippi, and that was the last time I seen Mississippi, because I went out west again, and that was it. And then I went overseas. I went to meet my grandparents in South Africa. I've been fucking everywhere. You know. I had a, even Phoenix, I'm related to it somewhat. I had a chick who was from Phoenix. And we was going to move out there. I was in Reno, Nevada at the time. Had a friend of mine from there, from South Carolina. Lived out there. And I was going to, I checked up with this chick, this fat chick, right? And, and. I liked her, but then things didn't work out, you know, and I didn't move to Phoenix. So, but I was very close to moving to Phoenix at one point. That's what I'm trying to say here. Yeah. Bad and Wild said, fat chick, fat girls need loving to. I used to prefer fat chicks. I have changed my taste. Shoot, I don't mind. I don't care. I, I guess. So I'm trying to say. I don't think it's good to say the fat is healthy. I don't agree with that. I disagree with that tremendously. But uh, yeah, fat chicks didn't love you, and I sure as hell gave it to them. You know. <laughs> but uh, it says uh, you dodge a bullet. It's sexier. I realized that later. Yeah, I don't. I don't think I would have liked there. I don't like big cities in general. I don't think I would have like there uh very much bad and well says my first girlfriend was fat i'll say my first all of them were fat <laughs> most of them no i did have some skinny ones i like i see beauty on things you know i seen some fat chicks there uh i don't know i like them uh and i had skinny chicks that were cool too <laughs> there he's in a maneuver you know i uh Cool Runner says, I don't believe not, I do believe not everyone has control over their weight. I, I don't think so. I, I, I'm very direct on that. You eat less. I have a lot of family members who are very fat. Uh, you eating too much. Uh, I think people overcomplicate everything. Uh, yeah, the thyroid. And you know, most people don't have that. You, you eating too much. Uh, put down the fork a little bit. Uh, eat less. You eating more than your body's using. Is that simple? You eating more. Yeah, cool runner. Yeah, you said you can't have you you can't have issues that don't like that's very rare. It, they do exist. Yeah, the thyroid problems. A lot of people have a tendency of getting fat, just like people have tendency of being alcoholic. If you have a tendency of getting fat and you are fat and you're trying to lose weight, like if you're not trying to lose weight, nobody's gonna bother you. And they shouldn't. If they're bothering you, they're wrong. But I'd say you're trying to lose weight and you're saying, oh, I have a tendency if you know you have a tendency to to, to get fat, then you should no, you have a tendency to get fat and eat less. 
uh, you're eating too much. I agree. You're eating too Most fat people I met, they're eating too much. Even people, I said, I have a cousin said said she had a thyroid problem. One time we made a three bean dip, dip for chips. It was a fucking bowl about this fucking size. And I was neighbors uh, to her back in Mississippi. And then we came back the next day. The fucking thing was was gone. It was fucking gone. She just ate it all. So ah, it's not fucking thyroid. She she eats too much. It's just you know, I know the truth hurts sometimes for people, but is you eating too much? Most likely, yeah. There's a chance I might have a thyroid problem or some other underlying cause, but most of the time you eating too much. You eating more than your body needs. And say I have the thinner, I have the thinner. So there has to be the opposite, right? Plus, I know a couple of people that don't share my. Yep, you don't share your metabolism, but it should get used to your metabolism. That's what I'm saying here. If your metabolism is low, then it should be. You should keep in mind that your metabolism is low. My metabolism is fast. One time I gained weight. One time in my life, and I actually liked to be it because I always felt I was too damn scrawny. So I got some weight. Turns out to be some medicine I was taking. So sometimes it could be something, but most of the times you're eating too much. And if your metabolism is lower, then it should be aware of that. And then eat less. Or eat accordingly to your metabolism. You should adapt because being fat is not going to help you. It's that simple. I don't agree. Anyone, anyone ever, I would fight it to the death. Somebody said that being fat is, is health. It's not. Now, if you tell them, mix, don't mix me up with people that go walk up to somebody and say you're fat, you're a piece of shit, and that kind of stuff. That's fucking horrible. And nobody should ever do that. You shouldn't put somebody down because they're fat ever. That's not what I'm saying here. Please don't tell me the sky is, uh, is not blue, but it's green. You know, it's not healthy. The fat advocates, I don't like that shit. It's not good. You're, you're promoting death. It's, it's not good. It's not healthy. Most people that lose uh, uh, weight when they're fat, they're happy about it. You know. And I don't like, you know. Genetics play part in two things. People not be able to bulk up. Yeah, genetics. That's it. Genetics, but then you should be aware. Yeah, I have the genetics. Maybe I should slow down, or maybe I should eat more, depending on which way you know it swings. So, uh, I think mine was a tapeworm. I'm not sure. You should be six feet, 130. That's very low, dude. Yeah, that is. I'm six one. Uh, I think I'm at 165 now. But you know what? When I was uh, I was still six one, I was at a hundred and thirty five at one point. Mm, for most part, I bulked up at some point. I think my metabolism slowed down as you get you age. You know, uh, a galvanized <laughs> antique. I just love that word. I don't know why. I know it's, it's used a lot, but it's just galvanized. You just sound funny. Better well says I'm. I'm six feet, 130. Yeah, that's. I was that for most most of my life. I'm six one, and I think now I'm I'm high, I'm 165 pounds. So I'm I'm not skinny as I used to be anymore. But I welcome that. I always thought I was too skinny because there's such a thing too. Yeah, you can be too fat and you can be too skinny, unhealthy. You know, it's not good for you. I felt tired when I was fat. I gained 40 pounds over the pandemic. My loss ever since been I like being skinny. I felt tired when I was fat. I don't think anybody in their sane mind will say you feel better when you're fat. Come off it. I don't care what the narrative is now. It's not fucking politics. Fuck off with the politics. It's just a fact, man. You're not. You're fat. You're overweight. Uh, it's not good, man. You know. I'm happy about myself. Well, okay. Most people are earned, though. When they lose weight, they get happier. Proof is in the pudding right here. You know. Antique Mo said, I've recently hit. 145 at 33 years old. Feeling skinny sucks. Too skinny sucks. It does. It does suck. You feel, I feel like when I was very skinny and scrawny, I couldn't gain weight. I tried fucking uh, things that open up your appetite and stuff. I was very skinny most of my life. Uh, people will say, oh, it's called a sandwich. And then I'm tall and that don't help. But I'm not like that anymore. I got, you know, I did work out when I was 18 years old and it bulked up a tiny bit. But he went right back to it later later on. But I'm finding where I want to be with size. Yeah, I think there's a balance. Everything's a balance, isn't it? Cat crashes. <laughs> My body feels nothing. Did you eat the chicken nuggets? Did you did you, uh, cat crasher is very important. Did you do you use condiments with your fries or 
chicken nuggets separately. Please describe to me if you use any condiments or if you don't use. I'm interested in what people from other countries use as condiments. I'm obsessed with condiments and I would like to know what what do you use for condiments on your things, on your nuggets, in your uh, your fries. Bean skin is good because it makes your dingo <laughs> dingling look bigger. <laughs> <laughs> Antique mold is here winning my heart when it says it dunks everything in a ranch. God damn it, is there anything better than a ranch? You know what? I love ranch my, on my pizza. A ranch in Tabasco. God damn it, God bless it. Awesome. My wife bought a bottle of ranch. She knew me. She knew I was craving for it. And thank fucking goodness you can at least find it here. It's kind of pricey. She found some, and god damn, I wasn't having it with my pizzas, with my with everything. Uh, I don't care you for my balls. <laughs> okay. I don't go that far, but I can see the appeal. Definitely. I use salt and pepper on my fry. You know what I love? Lemon pepper. is a powder. is lemon pepper. I love that shit on everything. I like the feeling when it gets on my mustache and I'm tasting lemon all the time. Nah, it's fucking awesome. It's like average in reality, but set against the skinny backdrop. It looks like King Kong. <laughs> it's best cold though does room temperature range oh fucking is there's room temperature I always eat me cold I never I bought the, the the bottle of Newman's I like Newman's I, I'm I, I'm I'm suspicious of anything but Newman's I got brand loyalty sometimes I like Newman's Newman's work for me I don't want to hear about your strange name sauce Get the fuck out of... Get away from my fucking fridge. I like my Newman's. You gotta have the old man there with the cowboy hat. So, it's fucking awesome. I put on my pizza. Sometimes I like to have both. The, the ranch and the Tabasco. So you get the cooling and the heating at the same time. And Cat Crasher, let me read his, his things. I did ask. Say, I use salt and pepper on my fries. Pepper on the nuggets. And I eat them with a Baronet sauce. Google if you have to. I can't. I don't have the fucking keyboard here because I'm an idiot. I I can't. I, I can't type here. It's fucked. The shed is fucked. <laughs> uh, and they say, do you have McDonald's in your country? It ain't my country. They have room temper. They don't have ranch here. No, they have McDonald's here. Are you talking about the UK? I think that was the first place the McDonald's ran to past Canada. Uh, but it ain't my country. I'll always feel as a guest here. I'm a guest here. I'm not. I don't feel like I belong here, to be quite frank. Oh, is that negative? No, not really. It's just uh, I, I'm, not, I'm not British. You know? I'm, not, I'm not from here. So that McDonald's here. There's a McDonald's here. There's a McDonald's there. Oh. New developments. Uh, there's now uh, a Wendy's and a Taco Bell. That's when the pre -can come came out a tiny bit. Taco Bell. I love Taco Bell. My favorite. Uh, favorite fast food, McDonald's and Taco Bell. It's hard. Don't ask me to choose. It's just both. It's just it's both. Both of them work. So let me hear Bernie's sauce, and I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, but if I'm not, you know, what can I tell you? I'm not very high culture. It's a sauce made of butter, egg yolk, white vinegar, and herbs. It is regarded as a child of the hollandaise sauce. I know hollandaise sauce. The difference is only the flavor, and Bernays use shallot, black pepper, oh, and tarragon. I have no clue what tarragon is. It sounds like something out of the Lord of the Rings. I know shallot. And black pepper, obviously. Antique most I totally don't get that phrase. Is. Man, when is in Taco Bell, you're all set, I'm all set. Try the grilled cheese burrito and add potatoes. Trust me. I will. I love going there. I went there when they open immediately. And I don't go into town. I'm living in the middle of nowhere. Going to town is actually quite uh, a lot of work. Uh, my truck, I have a Dodge Ram 12 valve Cummins, motherfucker. It's fucking awesome. Right here. I drive American. So I keep it, but I keep it off the road because I haven't been using it. And when the pandemic happened, I, then I really didn't use it, you know. So going to town is hard. We have to get a cab or something. And McDonald's don't deliver here, the motherfuckers. 
because with the pandemic, a lot of the those places started delivering. If McDonald's delivered here, forget about the fucking away discussion we have earlier. I would have been fucking 300, 400 pounds for sure. I'm cracking open here. Not your father's root beer. Your grandfather's, maybe. The father... It, <laughs> <laughs> Alcoholic root beer. I never heard of it. Well, no, I heard of it. I never tasted it. That's how I should phrase it. Rich's burrito's fucking awesome. My little truck just hit you 100k miles. I think mine is three fucking hundred or something. It's a fucking million mile engine, though. You can go a million fucking miles. They send you a badge, don't you know? <clears throat> I wonder if they still do that. I'm at 350k, I think. It's nothing you know, pocket change for the Cummins. I love that engine. That engine, bacon and potato, those would be the things I would legally marry if I could. The Cummins 12 valve engine. Oh, like I got to like just thinking about it, I get excited. This is the best. I, I can't, I can't love any other engine. It has to be the 12 valve straight six Cummins engine. I can't top that because they had regulations and bullshit the next year and it stopped that. So it is the, for me, personally speaking, it would be the best engine that ever was. Maybe the Caterpillar could, you know, the Caterpillar. Yes. Massive stomach, stomach ache. Ben O'Neill says, it's tasty as a food flavor root beer. God damn, I love root beer. It's my favorite Coke of all time. By far, sometimes you can find it here, low quality, but I'll take it. And I love me some root beer float. By God, I do. My family loves it too. We got we got a can of root beer here. I've been hiding it and holding on to it because I want me some vanilla ice cream or something and vanilla root uh, uh, root beer float. Just huh? Yeah, man, just so good. Root beer float is just is the bee's knees. You know, it's just so fucking good. I can't, I can't have enough of it. You can't, you keep topping up, and it just keep getting better and better somehow. Yeah. God, I love, I love rip beer. <laughs> it's actually the name because it makes me Rex come. That's how good it is. Damn good. Yeah, I start like I, my, my dick is tingling whenever I hear about root beer. It's just goddamn it. And Rip Beer Flow, definitely some pre cum action going on. There's no, fu <laughs> no fucking. <laughs> no fucking way. You know? Oh, man. Rip Beer. I love Coke of all kinds. If Satsun ain't here, I wonder if Satsun, they have Sun Drop out in Tennessee. I know that much. When I was in, in the Carolinas, oh, I was in North Carolina, they have Cheer Wine, and that is so damn good. God damn it. You know? Antique Mode said, I love where those this conversation stay. <laughs> I'm glad y'all root beer. Let's do some gaming here. Why not? Yeah. I'll do some uh, some vaping here. You know what time is? I lost track. It's three in the morning. The hour of the devil. Yeah. I have my night terror at 3 a.m. I'm terrified of that. I'm a superstitious man. I'm terrified at 3 a.m. Something about it. It's just superstition, I know. We all drinking. <laughs> Cheers. Skull. <laughs> I always like to imagine, though, we're talking here, all the nonsense, but then people come in, oh, he's playing this game, and then we're, then I'm not playing the game. We're, we're sitting here talking about root beer, giving you fucking pre-cum and shit. <laughs> and I, want, I wonder how many people come in. I know it's little. I, 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 listen, I understand I'm a very tiny little man. But I wonder how many people, like one or two, you know, to come in and... Oh, I'm, I, I heard of this... I, I heard of this here hack. I, I want to check it out. Finally, somebody playing live. I'm having trouble with this part. I wonder if he's going to get to it. Nope, we're sitting here talking about motherfucking beer root beer and pre-cum for for a long time you're staring at this here screen that says begin but it never begins 
<laughs> I like it. And then on YouTube later on, you know, they go and... I don't know if people watch it in there, but, you know, they... I get the numbers, but that don't mean they're watching it. Somebody, like, you get views, like, people click on it, they go, see you, oh, that's cool, CRT, okay, I'm gonna go back to watch whatever. You know, and then, it's funny, though. Is this burger? <laughs> <laughs> Purgatory for retro games, yes. And Bettenwell knows that the 3 a.m., yeah. The Antichrist era, that, that is an evil time. Nothing ever good ever happened at 3 a.m. Ah. Yeah. Purgatory for... Okay, all right, l listen. We're talking, I'll do some playing here. Let's. We, we were on a roll here with the stage, right? No, no, fuck, fuck your couch. Hey, 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 hey. Please. No, the fucking state, eh? State of affairs. And the music wrapped out. Okay, fuck off. And we'll put the synth pop here, whatever it is. No, that's the break, you fucking Gavon. Where is the, uh... What? The music here. Background music, there you go. Is that, is that muted? How dare you mute it, sir. There we go. Start it again, play it over. You displease me greatly. Witches, witches get stitches, man. <laughs> I don't know, it's niches, right? But it kind of works. I uh, put the music there and there should be some music playing there. So it's not, a oh shit, this guy. This guy's bad news, man. You know what I did last night? I just watched uh, people getting killed on, on Sopranos. That's all I did. I watched whack after whack after whack after whack, and then by the time I realized, I realized it was uh, it was four in the morning, and I want to go to bed early that night. But instead, I just kept watching people get whacked on Sopranos. So that's you know, I think it'd be something exciting, but. Not really. Uh, no, no regrets, <laughs> though. Okay, what do, what do I do with this shit? Huh? You piece of fuck, you fucking assholes. All right, so you go, yeah, okay. There we go. The hands come out. Very fucking funny, asshole. Like, what the fuck is it? What is this? How am I supposed to know the shit in there? Oh! That gives me the goosebumps. I heard a loud bump uh, sound. Was that in a game? Like, pah. Fucking arrow the devil. I like watching videos of Bed and Whale says people getting electrocuted online. I've seen a lot of those. Those are fucked. I watch a lot of sick fucking shit. I can't I can't do it anymore. I just had my feel, you know what I mean? Anything horrible you can think of on the internet, I had seen it and it's fucked. You get desensitized, you know? It's fucked up. Fucking what is it? Uh, three guys are on hammer. Oh, the Mexican cartel shit. I can't, I can't handle it anymore. I mean, I've had enough. I don't want to watch that shit anymore. God damn it. Holy fucking shit. It's like you lose faith on everything, you know, when you watch that garbage. I can't. I just, I've had enough. Uh, I used to have a very morbid curiosity. You know? It was my German ex-girlfriend introduced me to Rotten.com back in the day, back in 2005. Oh man, I remember like out of morbid curiosity just watching all this shit and they get like stuff you never seen before, you know, before that it was new to me. Yeah. I can't watch. I can't watch this stuff anymore. We got the early two thousands. Yeah, the early two thousands. That, that's what I saw. He was like that. Yeah, it was like just fucking horrible shit everywhere. 
the chainsaw video with the Max and Cartel, that was fucked up. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah, I remember Rotten. I should spend my time. It's like shit I never seen before. You know, you got morbid curiosity. It's like. But nowadays, I, I don't want to do it. You know, I have kids. I don't know. You change your fucking mind. I, I don't want to watch it anymore. I don't I don't want to see none of that shit anymore. I've had enough. You know. The chainsaw video, yeah. I never. Uh, here is the silver line. I never heard with it. I, I muted it. I watched it, but I muted it. It was still fucked, though. Sounds are very potent. Let me tell you, the unhero thing, like the guy, the, there was a Mexican guy, right? Oh, how about that guy from, uh, he tried to kill Bjorn? And it's so fucking depressing. God damn, that, that one made me depressed. The, back in the day when I used to watch that kind of garbage. Uh, Ricardo Lopez, yeah, he, he wanted to kill Lo, uh, Bjorn. And you see that guy fucking, fuck, fucking kill himself, and it's so fucking empty and depressing. You feel so empty at the end. It's just fucked, you know. The sounds are horrific. Yeah, the so oh god, the sounds. I did hear what sounds that the three guys in a hammer. Why the fuck? Did, why would I watch that? What 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 the hell was wrong with me? You look back and you go like, why why would you? Why would you? Huh? I'm glad they, they they got caught though, thank God. They killed a lot of people, those motherfuckers. Unpronounceable name maniacs. You now Depronuski Versky, I don't know, I don't know the name. Sick fucks, you know? Sick motherfuckers. You know. There's some sick shit out there. Let's fucking watch the Mario movie, man. Like all that shit. It's like it's really fucked up, you know. I used to get lost and it really upset me in 9-11. I used to watch a lot of 9-11. 9-11 happened recently. I, I didn't even stream and I, I, I watch a couple of videos and then YouTube start recommending you the shit. And then you, I get more and more depressed. The waving lady, the the guy that made his last phone call. I just, I can't, uh, so bad, you know? You really, I like remembering, but man, it's just, really brings you down, you know. I gotta be honest with you, the electrocutions I've seen and the guy that lost his whole face, I just, it's fucking depressing to me too. A fucking tiger getting electro electrocuted one time. Climbed a fucking power line. How the, how does that, there's a bear in you? I think there's a bear. A bear and a tiger, like what the fuck, uh, how did they get up there? I saw one in uh, India, though. I tell you one that really stuck with me, and it's not gory. So this family of Indians, as is as from India, they're crossing. I think it's a family, but a group of people, and they're crossing this this river, and the fucking the current came in. It was fucked, and under right past that, there's like a massive, gigantic waterfall that just spells death, and they fucking one by one they went, and I've saw. It stuck with me, you know. I watched that. I was like, "This is fucked up." Cat crashes. I should watch photonic induction on YouTube instead. I watch so much electricity on a coconut that explodes. That guy knows that electricity breaks a fuck ton of electronics with too much power. Is great. Yeah, that's better than watching that fucking other garbage. You know? It's, uh, I like that. I seen that, uh, you know, the grapes on the fucking microwave causing a fucking plasma and shit. <laughs> what the fuck? That's crazy shit. There's a kid from Canada, too. He does a lot of experiments. I really enjoy watching him. I like the science stuff. It's pretty cool. I like this low mo guy, too. They did like the CRT even. That's pretty cool. You know, I have the fucking save states here because it's getting late. I think I'm going to just play some fucking Mortal Kombat and I'll come back to this game some other time. What do you think of that? Is a rhetorical question is happening either way, so make peace with it. I'm going to play some fucking Mortal Kombat to pass the time because we're just shitting here in a way. Let's come off it, right? No, now, now Red, that's him. That's him. Now Red is the guy. There was someone in that was abused by an elephant. Oh, God. <laughs> Stop.
Oh, God, no. Chase is raiding with a party one. Chase? Mortal Kombat time? Yeah, I'm gonna play some fucking Mortal Kombat. I'm tired of that shit. I don't know what's going on there. I'm gonna I'm gonna play Son of Familiar here. Fuck it. Let's get the third third Akratis. There we go. Reptile. Fuck yeah. Cat Crasher saying I don't have the guts to, to play Super Ghouls and Ghosts. I fucking beat Ghosts and Goblins, motherfucker. <laughs> play that shit. Play you you baby here graduating from Super Ghouls and <laughs> Super Ghouls and Ghosts. Play Ghosts and Goblins on the fucking NES or arcade. <laughs> you can't. There's no shooting up. There's none of that bullshit. Uh, I'll be playing. I, Listen, uh, Cat Crasher, is that... Uh, shut the fuck up. Stop making... <laughs> I'll be playing Super Ghosts and Ghosts, but I tell you one thing. Uh, motherfucking asshole. I'm gonna play the... Uh, fuck you, you fuck. You're the first guy. You're like the henchman on Austin Power movies. <laughs> Ghosts and ghouls. Ghouls and ghouls. I hate to be the actual guy, but I'm I'm pretty anal about those series. Unless there's a title I didn't know. Uh, play Ghosts and Goblins on the fucking NES. Just just do it. Get out of here, fuck. <laughs> I tried, I died. Anytime I'm in doubt, I just pop in Mortal Kombat 2. It's my natural reaction. You know, every time I get a new CRT, I do a full playthrough of Mortal Kombat 2. Just a tradition. Every every single CRT I have here, when I got it, I play a full round of Mortal Kombat 2. All of them, no exception. You fuck. Fucking spamming a high punch, get something else. Oh yeah, you try to sweep and they fucking uh, get get spat on. Get spat on like the whore that you are, Raiden. Emulate in the arcade version. I'll play the arcade version. If he had saves, I can't remember. Or passwords at least. On the PlayStation. I bought the physical fucking disc. It's here. It's ready to, I'm ready to pull the trigger very soon. And enjoy all the hell. I don't know why I like hell so much. Get up there, Raiden. I could do it my Wii homebrew. The, oh! Uh, Cat Crasher. Oh, God. Yeah, but let me pause this. I need to tell him. Fucking pause it! Okay, the NES. I hate how Mortal Kombat is taboo with pausing. You should be able to pause at any time. Motherfuckers, you motherfucker. Fucking put the pause in. Every fucking. You know, Mortal Kombat 3 on it. Uh, at least on the Super Nintendo, I remember I was a kid. You have to enter a cheat to have pause. What the fuck is going on here? A cheat to have pause is a fucking modern convenience. Why are you hiding it? Why is it taboo in Mortal Kombat? I never understood. The only time you can pause in this motherfucking game is right here. Not when it's here. By God, God forbid if your fucking little square of your character goes up here. You can't pause anymore. It's done. You're over. You lost your chance. You have to fight. Oh, can you just let it go? No, because then you get a game over. It's fucked up. Come on. What were they thinking with this shit? We had the technology to have pause. Why not have pause? People have shit going on. My house might be burning down. I don't know. I have to fucking go. Give me a fucking pause here. Satsum, what are you up this late at night? Holy fucking shit. <laughs> Satsum here. And you know, when I come in late, I'm considered, you know, I do look at other people. Satsun said one time, you know, I like I like hearing you when I'm working. And when I'm late here, fucking up with hardware and the commercials and all this shit, and I was late, I do think of Satsun. You know, like, I feel disappointed. I wanted to come in early. Trust me, Satsun, I do. I really do. And it's just, things keep happening. And it's, it's just like there's a demon here preventing me from starting earlier. I, w I would like to wake up, drink a coffee, eat breakfast quick, and go stream. That's my perfect day. For a while, it was that. When I did Land of the Dead, around that time. And then the heat came in and fucked everything up. I'm so pissed off. And Satsun says, I just got back from a funeral party. Didn't expect this should be going on. 
<laughs> I, yeah, no, no, the title is misleading by now, because I play Super Mario Hack, Call of Cthulhu. I just had enough of it for a while, and I just want to play some sun familiar, so if Mortal Kombat 2 is my go-to. <laughs> Cat crash is fine. Man, I was like five. First time I saw MK2 was Bowling Alley. Same year. Same year. Same fucking year. Bowling Alley. All the way. And when I saw Melina Kitana, I got tingled feel on my loins. That's how I still do. You you fell it then, I feel it every fucking day. When I wake up, I think, where's Melina? Oh, she's not real. I wish she was real. That's how I think. Oh, Kitana's fucked. Every time you jump on this bitch. Oh my god. Holy shit with this. <laughs> This game is nuts. Look at it. Every time, input written. I'm so used to it. I'm numb to it. F Corner, you're done. Give up. Drink whiskey. Forget it. <laughs> Holy shit with Kitana. She, she's fucking brutal. Get fucked. Oh. Oh, you fuck. No. Nope. Fuck away from me. Ah! Fuck you. Oh, bitch. She got me. <laughs> it's like a Grand Sanders station over here. <laughs> Junior. Is that Junior for the Sopranos? No, we're sticking with our tile here. Let's. And if you're watching this in YouTube, what happened is what happened. I don't know, man. What happened? You tell me, you know? Something happened. I'm playing Mortal Kombat 2, you know? Bitch. Oh, no! The, the man that... Fuck you. God damn it! Get out. <laughs> fucking look at my fucking health bar. You just She went nuts. Bitch went nuts over here. I got back from a funeral party. Didn't expect this to be going on. I don't know. It was a late night tonight, Setsu. Oh, you fuck. Oh! Fuck off. Get fucked. Hit her head. Hmm. We have the save for that uh, game, you know, if I ever go back to it. I know I've been slacking off not finishing the games. Not like me. I know. I think I've just been starting so fucking late with the stream, you know, lately. Teleport, bitch. Oh, motherfucker. God, they insist on it. If you keep jumping, the more ju it's like gambling. The more... Fuck! Come on, take the lord. There you go. That's the exploit. Jump back. Come on, you motherfucker. Fucking kick you the face then, asshole. Satan says, I figure more had hack probably gets brutal. It does. The game is weird. Like, you have to do... It forced me to use save states. Teleport, you fucking bitch ass. Ah, the kick, yeah. We oh my god, it's so fucking annoying. Get fucked, asshole. <sniffs> Fuck him up. Ah! Get fucked. Cat Crasher says you can't believe that SNS can handle this game. This fucking game is my fucking whole childhood. This is my childhood. If you want to know what I was doing in my childhood, that was it. This is it right here. This console, this game, shitty as Hitachi RF only. CRT. God damn it, I couldn't get enough of Mortal Kombat 2. I have a love-hate relationship with this game because of the fucking AI. It's horrific. The AI is beyond fucked. It's shit, but I can't, I, I love the game too much. I can't quit it, you know? I can't fucking quit it. Cat Crasher says, uh, there's so many games I'd like to beat right now, but goddamn that Super Nintendo is gotta be turned on another week probably, sitting on Goose and Ghosts, game over screen. 
Goose and Ghosts. I look forward to playing that. I only know Ghosts, Ghosts and Goblins. I love Ghosts and Goblins. I don't know why. I just love that game. Uh, I want to play the arcade version here, definitely. I know it's going to be hell. But I want to do it anyways, by God. Just let us smear here. Uh, I'll ask you, I beat it tomorrow. You could. Why not? Tomorrow could be the day. Tomorrow could be the day, Cat Crasher. I'm... God damn it, I'm happy seeing you playing those games, man. It's fucking awesome. What are you gonna emulate the, on the arcade version? I bought... It's, uh... So there's this compilation of uh, games by Capcom called Capcom Generation. I think it's the way, in the West it's called Capcom Generations with a NAS, right? Uh, the second one, they inverted it to for some reason, because why not? Just fuck it, right? So, but on the Japanese version, uh, Capcom Generation has uh, Ghosts and Goblins Arcade Perfect. The one that trick for me, I'm, I'm wondering, is it limited continues? Is Does it let me continue uh, as much as I want? Can I save? So I need to test it. I have the actual, I want to play the actual disc. I have the disc, I bought the disc. It was reasonably priced. So I want to play it on the PlayStation 1 with an arcade stick, le as legit as I can possibly get. As long as I have my fucking lim unlimited continues. It is, our, I played it plenty. I never beat it. I beat the, this is actually harder, way harder than the NES. But uh, I'm hoping to be able to play on a PS1 because I, I bought the disc, it's, it's in here. Uh, it would be nice if I could save, just in case I can beat the f whole fucking game on one stream. You know, that's what I'm, my concern is. I don't know how I feel about the, the disc spinning here on I just save it. I don't know if I can do it. Slanchiva. So yeah. So the plan is to play on the PS1 with a, there's an arcade stick by, uh, I think, Askyware. And it looks sort of like, uh, you fuck, you fuck. Mm, fuck you, Baraka, you fucking sack of shit. Bar Baraka Obama. <laughs> fuck you, man, come on. He spams a fucking, get away from me. Get away, you freak. You just reach your divisio with a cheap mask. Hey, ride or die, what's going on, old man? I got tired of the fucking hack. I just want to play Mortal Kombat 2. That's what, I got fucked in there. Yeah, I, mean, I made some progress. I'm kind of annoyed the game asked me for fucking save states. How dare you? Come on, do the jump, you fuck. Ah, mm, you never get the uppercut, man. Fuck you, Baraka. <laughs> Cat Crash is saying, fuck, I'm enjoying myself in here. Well, I'm glad to hear it, man. It's what's all about. <laughs> Cheers. Loving the whiskey here. Fucking that bottle is going on, huh? Motherfucker. Oh, the... I need to win. Oh, the straight towel is awesome. Fuck you. God, every time I get to the pit, they get fucking aggressive just because I like the fatality. You pieces of shit. Come on, do the exploit, you motherfucker. That's what you are. You're a dumb AI and I have dominion over you. Come on. Do the fucking exploit. That's what you all you have to do with some characters. There you go. Get fucked. Do it again, you bitch. I'm in command here. I'm the big mamu around here. Don't you fucking forget it. Oh god, it touched the tripod. Fucked it all up. Fuck off the fucking office chair. There we go. Fuck you, you motherfucker. I know what you're all about. Cocks and balls. Do the exploit. Do the exploit. There you go. That's all you have to do, by the way. Mortal Kombat 2. Oh, they run forward. That. Get out. Get out! Get out. Awesome. <laughs> oh, I love this fatality, man. It never gets old. Never, ever, never will. What am I sipping on here? I'm getting myself some uh, Grant's Distinction. First whiskey bottle I ever bought as a on my own, you know? Come on, Cage. He's up on it. Oh, 
shit. Mandatory throw, huh? Get out of here, dude. Mm. <laughs> Shadow kick, you piece of shit. Shadow kick. You fuck. Why are you spamming that shit? Nobody's falling for that, Johnny Cage. The fail that slide. When they go far, you want to... Oh, you fuck. He did the shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When they go close, you don't want to do the slide. Ah, oh, get off me. Get off me, motherfucker. Uh, let them throw you when you're in the corner. And when they're not... Mm. How about I get Sub-Zero and just fuck you up? How about that, Johnny Cage? Having some jam? I, I drank plenty, plenty of jam. I love jam. Let's get Sub-Zero here and shake the foundation. <laughs> I'm a cheap bastard. I love jam. It's cheap here, too, sometimes. Shadow kick! You fuck. Oh! You mother... He did... He did it, but it's too late. You fucking spamming input reading motherfucker. Oh. Get kicked in the face then, bitch. Oh. Mm. Ah. Oh, God. This cam a little. I wish I could have six, seven whiskey sours right now, but I gotta stay out of the alcohol. Yeah, if you need to take it easy, take it. I'll, I'll, I like the sourest thing. Boom, bitch. Fuck you, don't kick me. You get kicked. Motherfucking asshole. <gasps> He's gonna win. Get out. Watch this fatality. He's building up. Wait, just wait for it. It's coming. It's coming. Just, just wait for it. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> oh, God, I want to continue longer until somebody start complaining about it. Scorpion! It's been since six weeks since I had a drop. I wish you could. I'm doing well. Yeah, no, if you're doing good, you're doing good. Fuck off, Scorpion. You're spitting on the fucking screen, you idiot. Say it, don't spray it. Gee. <laughs> Come on, let's do the exploit, bit. <sighs> Look at this guy. Look at this. Oh my god. Fuck you, dude. Fuck you, motherfucker. Fuck you. Get out. Fucking piece of shit. Spamming the fuck out of the fucking spear, eh? Rider die says no reason to ever drink after six weeks unless it's a social thing. Oh, Melina's the easiest. Look at her. It's not stupid. <laughs> Mortal Kombat in a note, nutshell. God, I, love, I love the soundtrack of the Super Nintendo. I love Mortal Kombat on the Super Nintendo. It's just awesome. What a port. Come on, bitch, do the thing. Do the, it was the deal. There you go. Oh, when she does, throws a curveball for now and now.
Get up there. Oh, look, Kant is coming up. Mirror match. Can't be on a one. Oh, yeah, no, let me do the Demeter Vega thing. Uh, let me see. How, how does it go again? Let me think about it. Fuck you, bitch. Hey. Fuck your couch, man. Get fuck out of here. Oh, corner is over. I'm still going to win, you know. There you go. <clears throat> what does it go? It's like looking in the mirror. I want to see my correct reflection. Then I'll blind you to ease your pain. I think it, I blind you to end your pain, but you, you get it. Mr. Fucking Pedantic. Fuck you, my grand ass. Oh, no, 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 follow. Oh. The old blood and gut. Listen, I'll play this here. Just having a fucking quick break. I'll play a little bit more of the hack. You know, why not? We have the save. Why not? You know, and you, oh, I gotta leave. Well, leave. Fuck you. Yeah. Oh, God, Luke Kang is so annoying. Holy shit. Try this exploit with any of the other characters. Uh, some, no, some of the characters is not gonna work. Yeah, you can do this all the time. That's the thing that pisses me off the most about Mortal Kombat is just fucking exploits. Ah, uh, oh god, this guy. So, skip doing the shit. How fun is that? It's fucking annoying. I need to be off anything for six months. I have proper autism investigations to give me incentive. Sometimes I go without alcohol for, for a very long time. Six months and so. Sometimes I... Oh, shit. Oh. Throw me. Oh. Fuck you, asshole. Get fucked. Get in it. Low kick. Ah. Oh. No! You wouldn't dare. Oh. Okay. Good. Fuck you, Lokang, you fuck. Alright, exploits. Ah, he has a low fucking. Fuck off! <laughs> I never use that damn man. Get fucked. You fucking missed. Ah! Gotcha, bitch. You're done. Blow him up. I'm so bad at fighting games. I am too, to be honest. If I'm being honest here. Uh, I'm very familiar with this game because I grew up with it. Yeah, you could use low kick for Jade, but just slow the credit. There's no point. I, oh, I wish, I'm gonna show you the fucking exploit for Kintaro. It's fucking awesome. So, you wanna jump? Look, you jump. Fuck you! Oh! Oh, not. No, not this bitch. Ah, oh, it's over. <laughs> Damn it. Just this game I'm familiar with. Um. You can do the exploit. You know, the exploit is as, as it follows. So, the only way... Oh, Melina! You fuck! You fuck! You done goofed. Come on, you fucking whore. Get up there. Ah! Fuck. Get the... F motherfucker took my flawless. Are you gonna be this guy now? And out. I'll show the exploit with Kintaro is pretty fucking pathetic. It only works on the Super Nintendo. It doesn't work on the arcade version. God, it couldn't be Melina again. Could, mm. Okay, the exploit. Jump backwards. When you're here, let him throw you. It's over. Oh my God, we'll shut up for a minute. There we go. See the has... Ah! Oh, no! Ah, he's gonna throw me. Motherfucker. 
<laughs> you jump backwards? Ah! Fuck off. Fuck you. Fuck yeah. I'll show Kentaro. I'm just gonna cheese him immediately so I see what it's all about. Kentaro wins. Doesn't work in the arcade, but uh, basically, sh lure him to the corner here. This game's all about cheesing. It's fuck you, bitch. Yeah, whatever. You're gonna get cheesed on. Okay, he's gonna. Fuck you and shut up. Spam much? Oh, he won. You see it. You see it. You can spam this guy. It's quite easy to do. I prefer to beat him legit, but I, I want to show you the spam is kind of hilarious. Oh no, Kentaro is coming at me. Come on, dude. Do your jump. Oh no, what would I do? Let me have a smoke here. There you go. So I have to do with Kintaro. Done. So basically, let him. Uh, you know, I changed my mind. I want to fucking uh, spam you again because you're a fucking asshole. Yeah. You know what? Fuck you. Come on. Let's do the spam. You, you, yeah, yeah, very loud. Oh no, what would I do? <gasps> okay, all right, you wanna fight, motherfucker? We'll fight then. We'll fight, bitch. You f oh, I'm beating you legit now. Now it's fucking personal. Now it's fucking personal. Uh, who do I get? And it's, uh, same guy. Let's beat him legit. No cheese. Order the Brawler 64 controllers per recommendation. 50 bucks. Probably have to pay a vet fee too. But fuck the fuck the center controller. You'll love the the Brawler. I want to beat him legit. Fuck you, cunt. <gasps> Motherfucker. Let's be entirely legit. Let's be here all night. Oh, almost. <laughs> Fuck this under controller. I just need to get another SD card and it should be good to go for N64 game. There you go. N64 is very cozy to me. Fuck you, bitch. Come on. <sighs> you fucked. Yo, shut up. Where's my applause? Kano sitting there like a schmandrick. <laughs> Fuck you, you fucking horrible, horrible man. Now, you know what? Come eat the cheese. You uh, fucked me over the cheese last time. I want, I want the cheese. Get out. Oh, Motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Cheers, dude. What happened, Guitar? Oh, Shao Kant. He can be tough. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Oh. Huh? <gasps> 
No. <gasps> Damn it, you fuck. <gasps> no. <gasps> no! Fuck. <laughs> Is that your pass? Yeah, 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 whatever. Oh! Oh! Shit, I gotta do this slide here. <gasps> no. You fuck. Damn it, he's gonna win. Damn it. It's a very specific time. Come on, say something, you piece of shit. God, I love that music. Listen. God, I love Mortal Kombat too. Fuck yeah, man. This game is so fucking awesome. So badass. Fuck you, you asshole. Ugh. Damn it, I gotta do this slide. It's my childhood right here, man. Ah, oh, damn it, this slide, man. Fuck! You fuck. God damn it, I'm fucking up. Yeah, yeah, you keep saying that. There we go. That's what you need to do. You need to take advantage of that combo. Ooh. Oh! Motherfucker, you fucked. Oh! Hurts, doesn't... Ah! Fuck! <gasps> no! You're weak, pathetic fool, you piece of shit, you. I can defeat him immediately with some other characters, like Malena or Raiden. You can keep spamming the torpedo or the teleport kick, but I wanna, I wanna, I wanna play the, play Raiden's game here, and I'll have a little, yeah, yeah, yeah. I like Shao Kahn, though, he's my favorite character, and the ninjas. Ah, oh, you fuck. <laughs> Damn it, I'm fucking up too many times. He can be difficult. So the thing is, you gotta jump on top of him. And when he turns, oh shit. And you gotta do the slide there, but I keep, it's, it's hard to remember. Ah, and then sometimes you do. If you do too, uh, slightly too late, you fucked. You could win the whole match with chip damage if you're very careful. It takes forever. The timer might even run out. You can do this all the whole match. But I like to... There we go. I like to live dangerously. <gasps> Ooh. Fuck you, you fuck. If you're careful. Ah! There we go. <laughs> you fucker. Yeah, yeah, you keep saying that. Ah! If you... Damn it. Mm, if you miss the time... That's what happened. Oh, no, no. Don't do the slide when it takes you long. Let's do some cheap damage here. Fuck! Oh! Mother... F ah! What the fuck, Sub-Zero? What the fuck? That was in the bag, dude. Chip damage. If you kick too early, you're fucked. Okay, I need a risk. Ah, oh, I need a risk because there's no way. The timer would run out and I'll be done. Look at my fucking health. It was fucked. Okay, let's uh, get in there. Get in there. Get back on that horse.
Yeah, 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 whatever. Look at blocking. Ah! Oh! Motherfucker, don't give me any trouble. Damn it! There we go, we got him with a double. Damn it! It's a whole dance between him doing that stop and going a little bit forward. It's fucked. Yeah, whatever. Hurts, doesn't it? Mm. Damn it, I just lied. I should've... Mother... <gasps> oh my god. <gasps> no! God is annoying. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's, let's take it easy. Yeah. Oh, motherfucker. One of those that is a quarter we had. It's already gone. Let's do some chip damage here. Oh. Slide, dude. Slide. Ooh. Damn it, it didn't bite. Motherfucker. You talk a lot of shit, don't you? <gasps> Damn it! Fucking Shao Kahn gave me trouble today. Fuck you, dude. I hate that when I can't do this live. Damn it, it blocks everything. Fuck you, you fuck. I'm gonna have to risk it because of the timer. Oh, yeah. Feels good. Suck on that pretty calm, you fuck. Alright, let's. Ooh, round three. Huh? Mother. God damn it. Alright, chip damage then. I'm done. What the fuck? Everything went wrong. Insistent upon it. Fuck you. Ooh, this is delicious. Oh, awesome. This is the one, boys. This is the one. Fuck you, cunt. I'm holding block here, you motherfucker. Shut the fuck up, 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 shut the fuck up. Ah. Uh. Ooh. Ah, uh, I can't do that. Chip, chip, chip him, chip him. He's done, chip him. There you go. Grants IV back. <laughs> it's comfortable to me, it was It really is. Ah! Fuck yeah. Shut the fuck up! It's the one I told you. I done told you. This shit, bitch. Oh! <laughs> fucking kick him! Yeah! Give me the flawless. Give me the fucking flawless. Mm. Give me the flawless, you cunt. I'm chipping it a flawless bitch. Watch. 
flawless. Get out. Good shit. Good to have you here. Uh, here. La, 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 la. <laughs> Good to have you here, Gaff Crasher. Good shit. We'll play a tiny bit more of the hack. I don't see why not. And hey, dude, I know you're exhausted, right? Anytime you want to go to bed, that's fine. Don't don't fear. There's no fear of abandonment here. I'm I'm here my own volition. Yeah, Shao Kahn can be a bit of a con sometimes. You just, the whole deal is, this game, that's the thing that pisses me off about, I love this game, but I hate this game. It's like the AI is fucked. And you have to do nothing but exploits all the time. It really pisses me off. I just want to play the game. I want to try some strats. And the game doesn't let you. you. You just have to do exploits time and time and time again. Just no end to it. I, lo I really love the game because I, I don't know, it's, I think it's nostalgia. I just, I grew up with it and I played with a lot of cousins and friends and it was so awesome. Playing this game two player with people that are on the same level as you, it is fucking awesome. But when you go against the AI, you're just clinging on to the dream, you know. Cat Crasher says, uh, no, trust me, I enjoy your company. I want to go to bed, go to bed. I'm always up around this time. But if I want to go to bed, I go to bed. Okay, I got you. I'll be up another hour or so. Oh, Amiga Cam is here from Australia. I remember you. And let's make sure. Are you, Are you? Uh, if you don't mind me asking, are you a chick because of the name Cammy? It always reminds me of Street Fighter. So you're Cammy for, from Street Fighter. And it, she's got the Scorpion emote. Look at that. Scorpion from Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3. I'm here to keep you company now. I'm playing the, Mo the Super Mario World hack, but I got fucked so hard I, I came here and and play a bit of Mortal Kombat because it's my comfort zone, you know? Mortal Kombat 2 is just... I'm so familiar with it, so I want to have... I know it's insane, but I want to wanna have... If you heard about the AI of this game. But if I want to... If I want to have like a, a comfort time like eating fried chicken or something I, I go to i go to mortal kombat 2 as my go-to whenever i'm confused i just <laughs> i just default to mortal kombat 2. every crt i get new i play this game to inaugurate it you know and yeah you were a chick cosplay is cammy that's pretty fucking awesome oh god I love Cammy. She's awesome. I remember my cousin who was a chick. She was awesome. She was like obsessed with Cammy when she came out. Super Street Fighter. Because we had Street Fighter 2. And then Super Street Fighter 2 came out. I bought. I had the cartridge. I got it. And it was like Cammy and Fei Long and DJ and Thunder. No, Thunder is fucking killer instinct. You're fucking racist. What is the name? <laughs> T-Hawk. Okay. I got, <laughs> I got it. Uh, T-Hawk. Yeah, Thunder is Killer Instinct, you Gavon. Mixing up the games. Uh, yeah. I, I I got I got your Mortal Kombat by the ways of uh, Street Fighter, that's for sure. I got the Super Nintendo with a copy of Street Fighter 2, World Warrior. And to this day I can't take Turbo. I mean I'll get you it, but uh, for me, World Warrior is the one that feels normal. So she says when I fell when I saw Cammy, I fell in love with Street Fighter. I I would say not Street Fighter, but I did fall in love. <laughs> she is awesome. I, I'm i completely out of touch with anything past Street Fighter 2, but when I see her on Street Fighter 6 with a British flag jacket, goddamn. <laughs> she is out there looking fine. Cheers. Looking fine. Uh... 
I don't know, play some of the motherfucking hack again? You know why? Uh... Now I'm in a mood. Play some uh, Street Fighter 2 World Warrior. Why not? I'm in a mood for it. Fuck it. Yeah, fuck the heck. I'll play sometime. Uh, Street Fighter 2 World Warrior. It has to be a World Warrior for me. It's what I, it's what I know. Yeah, I know the left side of the screen is eating up. It's not, I know. I'll, I've been living with it. The World Warrior. There we go. Let's play some World Warrior. Fuck it. That's what I want to do. This is my childhood here. This is the first game I had on Super Nintendo. Sorry, there's no cami here, Amiga Cami, but it's Street Fighter. The music, man. I sit back here as I get in a blowjob. It's heaven. Listen. Oh man, this game. <laughs> this is. Look at it. It's so iconic, man. And Cammy says this game sold a lot of Super Nintendo, but I got to sell mine. I was into this. This is what I wanted. I want to, and I got it. I, I got it like a break as a kid. I had a fucking bullshit childhood, but that day, I was, I was, I was on top of the world. I was like fucking Leonardo DiCaprio on the Titanic. I was, I was there, man. Play it as were you. Uh, oh, can uh, they change the sprite? Is very cool. His wife is all fucked up. <laughs> the sprite. Let's stick with can him here. Dawson. What's a Dawson? <laughs> Ugh. Oh. Fucking supposed to be sure you can hear. Damn it, I'm trying to grab you, motherfucker. Fuck you. Motherfucker. You know what I just did? I press uh, R as block. That's a Mortal Kombat in me. I literally tried to block with R, and I did a a hard kick here, a strong kick, and that was <laughs> Mortal Kombat. Ah! Oh! Fuck you, dude. Oh, bitch, you got fucked. Hoo, 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 hoo. Awesome. <laughs> Get up. It's too early for you to be defeated. Oh, she can be tricky. God, look at, listen, listen to the music. I'll shut up. I get caught up on the background. <laughs> Somebody comes in here and go, Super Mario World Hack, call a Cthulhu, they don't look like it. I see no Mike Mate. Oh. Oh, bitch. Ah, oh, sure you can raise it. Oh. Oh. Fuck me up there. Foots is bitch. That's what I was trying to do earlier. Good B.
I'll fix your ass, Kami. Come here. Let me show the taste of America. Yeah. Mm, grab him. Grab that motherfucking Kami. Oh! Get out. Uh, this game is good shit. It is a lot more fun than Mortal Kombat. I like Mortal Kombat more. And there's me right here. I like Mortal Kombat a lot more, but uh, this game just... You can actually play instead of just doing exploits. That's the thing that always burned me about Mortal Kombat. Uh, Street Fighter, I feel like I can't get out. Get the perfect. I feel like I can play the game and be free, you know? I'm not just doing fucking exploits all the time. Attack me if you dare. I will crush you. You Honda, isn't it? That's real. Yeah, he just... He's a t I, I hate playing as him. Oh, shit. Are you crazy? Do you know who... who do you know who I am, Ryu? Fuck, I hate when they fucking uh, recover so quick. Break the sign. Oh, you want to get in this dispute? Oh, you you chicken out? Well, too late now. <laughs> Strange sound in the puff of... <laughs> That's funny. I forget sometimes that I vape and people might not be used to the sounds. Footsies! Oh, you fuck. Come, I want to do the same. Oh, you want to get into that? You can't keep up. You don't have the testosterone, dude. Yeah, I got, I got that too. Look. Yeah, I smoked Marble Reds for 15 years, then vape came along. I've been following vape since the cigar likes, you know, the ones that look like cigarettes. Fiddling with it, you know, fucking cigarettes are expensive. Vape, best thing I ever did for my life, you know. Probably keep me around this miserable planet for a while. There you go. <laughs> it's funny. What was that puff of smoke and that sound? Little atmosphere. My dear. Oh, your Honda can be tough. He, he likes that attack. Oh, you fuck. That one. That one. You ain't got no projectiles. Gotcha, bitch. Gotcha, bitch. Get the fuck out. Has <laughs> the Halloween smoke machine. I want to get a smoke machine here. I heard they leave residue on stuff, so I'm a bit hesitant about my hardware. But if I could get a, uh, and I know you got to do some of my corner shoot. Hold the, hold up the smoke. Get him. Mm -mm. Jump, motherfucker. Jump. Come on, do it. Oh, he got me. A little weak kick there to fuck you up. Attack me if you dare. I will crush you. I guess you could set up the exhaust fan. Yeah, I'm thinking of doing something Halloween. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know if I get anywhere. Oh, God, God, he likes that fucking kick of his. Look. Every time you jump. Oh, his second fucking shit, I forgot. He likes that shit, man. He likes it. 
You sure? You got to charge though, right? You know what I hate about a Street Fighter charging attacks? Fuck him up. Ah, oh, damn it. That shit of it is hard. He came... Gao came hard because he likes to spam that shit. Oof. The same party as Tom on fuck him. <laughs> All right. What's this bitch? Damn it. Get him. Motherfucker. Oh. He's gonna get me. Ah, damn it, that shit of his. <laughs> Don't touch the trap out, asshole. Ow. My knee. Hit the table. Go home and be a family man. And I was fucked up. He says that to Chun Chun Lee. Go, go home and be a family man. Okay. Fuck him up. Your bitch. Wake up to that shit. Fucking, you gotta charge. I don't. You gotta charge. I don't. Gal, you do the math. I know your AI is cheating. You don't need to actually charge, but in technicalities here, you have to charge. I don't. So. Blanca? Brazil. There we go. Give me that flawless fuck. Ooh, you motherfucker. Took it away. Ah! You wanna do the shock thing, huh? Fuck off! Oh, you fuck! Blanca's so fun in the new Street Fighter game. I never play anything. I play a little bit of Street Fighter, the, the third strike thing. Uh, always trying to do shock. Uh, but other than that, I'm pretty just for me to. Ah! Oh! Fuck off, you fuck. Ooh! You got me. Take the Hadouken. No. No, 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 it's not. Fuck off. Oh, I died? It was double KO. Fucking double KO. God damn it. 
Round four, motherfucker. You're stretching this shit, ain't you? Foots is bitch. Get off. Get off me! Get off me! What? Oh my god, I'm getting fucked here. You. Oh shit. Cunt. You fucking cunt! Shut up. You big dumb animal. Aruken. Why am I can? Why? Didn't I start as Ryu? I'm losing. Okay. <laughs> Default to American. Fuck you, you bitch. Get out of here. Wake up. Wake, wake up and smell that coffee, you fuck. Spam that shit, man. Wake up to that shit. Get out. I'm a 99% retro gamer, but I made an exception to Street Fighter 6 on a modern game. I'm, I'm bought. It's lapping, isn't it? I heard I heard a lot about it. People are excited about it. I like Luke. Luke. In the top cover. Do that. I'm like, I... I don't know. I'll, I'll play more modern games. It's funny. Some of the best games I played were modern. Technically. Hollow Knight. Uh... Get out. Get out. Get out of here. Just... There you go. Hollow Knight. Astroneer was fucking awesome. My daughter has been playing Astroneer recently. It's awesome for her. I mean... Oh, that game slaps, man. I played 300 fucking hours, which is not common for me. Bosses. Oh, shit. Bought it for full price, yeah. I got a Horizon Chase Turbo, Art and Santa Forever. Art and Santa Samper. Fuck off, you fuck. block this asshole. Look at him. Like, what the fuck is this? What are you doing? Get out of here. Get the fuck out of here, man. Fuck was that? Gotcha's hot. The chick here. Look at that bald fuck. He's got a fucking massive bobble's head. The chicks are hot. Look at that. Tell me that's not... Fuck off. Oh. Pressure. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Trying to do the little. When he goes nuts, you gotta. Oh, fuck him. Fuck him. There we go. Yeah, my daughter's getting into it. Yeah, look at that chick. Damn. I know it's pixel art, but fuck. Ken's out here with the spaghetti hair. <laughs> oh, you fuck! Motherfucker! They knew how to picture some beautiful women, eh? Yeah. That later when I was a kid, no? Ooh. Madam. <laughs> Good shit. Oh, this guy's a fucker. You got a pressure. Got. Oh! Forward, Ken! Come on! You can't fucking jump. Get in that. Oh. Stop jumping up, dude. Get him now. Mmm. Fuck you. Gotta keep that pressure on him. Slunch of a salute. Pendejo de mierda. Come on. Fuck you. 
Oh, 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 oh! Ah! Oh my god, that's close. Okay, okay. Now, mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, back off, back off! Ah! Get him, get him, Scooter, get him! Get him again! Get, oh! Oh man, that was close. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Cat Crash said there's all, there are all sorts of flashers. <laughs> what? It was a joke. I was here. Come on, man. Do the. Do, do you fucking jump, you cunt? Dump. Do it. Do it. No, no, no. What the fuck? Ah! Mmm! It's just gotta be right. It's gotta be just fuck. Oh, get him! Oh! Oh shit! It's on top of him. Ooh. Mm. Get fucked, motherfucker! No! Ah. Mm. Come in! Come! Come! I want to finish this with a gold star. Come! Oh! You fuck! Who wins? Nobody wins. Ah, fuck off, draw game, come off it. You fuck, you got lucky. Get off me, you fuck. Oh! Oh! It's just the timing. Oh, gotcha! Fucker, fucker! Oh yeah, come, come, come. I want you. Come here. Oh, you fuck, you got me. Oh! God, Vic, you gotta get him just right. Get off me, you fucking freak! Get off me, fuck! Motherfucker. Urgh! You fuck! Come on! Damn it! Fuck! Asshole. I love Sopranos, man. <laughs> hey! Vito, your fag? Uh. <laughs> it was a joke! I was here! I love the top comment on the video I watched. Like, it was a joke. He was there. <laughs> I love it. I love Sopranos. I was watching last night. All the killings and shit. The Vito. <laughs> Johnny Cupcakes. Ugh. Come on, man. Mm. Fuck. Oh, gotcha. Fuck. Fuck. Got Vegas hard. He is hard. He gave me a fucking pain in the ass. The fuck? <laughs> yeah, Vito when I get him in the nightclub. That was hilarious. Come on, dude. Fuck. Oh, oh! Got you, bitch. Got you. Mm. <gasps> Fucking got you again. Mm. Get fucked. Get a whore you can. Sure you can, whatever. Get fucked. Vegas fucking hard. He's not. He's he's fucked up. Get him. Oh, okay. You gotta be like oh, like that. Yeah, there you go. Oh, you got fucked. Give me. Oh. Come on, bitch. Die. Oh, what the fuck? God damn it. You're done. Get out. He's, he's out. Cheers, bitch. So many. There's one thing that it got me like, uh, uh, Polly. 
Right, and he kills the old woman. Shut that mouth of yours. And he puts a pill on top. Oh god, this guy. Oh god. Tiger, you will get it. You fuck tigers. Okay. Everything's tiger with this guy. How do I? Mmm. Oh my god, the range of that shit. My fucking cigarette's fucking. There we go. Guess who was my favorite character back in the day when I played this game? Him. So I got. Jesus, man! It's spamming and there's, there's insanity. Look at Flawless Victor. You fuck. God. King of the Bradstick. <laughs> I know some old people who are inspiring. <laughs> the intervention with Christopher. You fucking taking a side. Fuck you, you fucking whore. And they start beating the shit out of him. The motherfucker was a... He was an interior decorator. Oh, really? Well, his house looked like shit. Get him. Mmm. Fuck him up. Motherfucker. Fuck off. I said my piss, Gracie. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, we could cause some uh, dysentery in the ranks. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, fuck off. Mm. Fuck you, dude, come on. God damn it, he's abusing now. Watch it, Chrissy. <laughs> I like that that one time. Uh, who was it? I forgot his name. Ralph, Ralph's uh, kid, stepkid or something. Fuck off. Oh, fuck you, bitch. Come on, dude. Ah! Mm. Get the fuck out of here. I got you writing on the wall, you piece of shit, you bald motherfucker. Polly. <laughs> God damn it, I love him. Uh, he's fucking, fucking around the mall. Good morning, Rat. You piece of shit. You, you punk ass piece of shit. You forgot I'm a captain? I say that all the time. Uh, what's his name? Oh, God, this guy's fucked. Oh, fuck off, I have that. Oh my god, no. Pussy bump on Sierra. Gotcha. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Get rabbit, grab him! Fuck him up! Fuck him! No! Supposed to be a Hadouken. Fuck controllers, man. I like sticks. I should grab on a, a stick, a big fucking stick, you know? <laughs> you fuck. Oh, you got fucked, bitch. <laughs> ah. Get fucked. Fuck him. Fuck him. Fuck him up. Yeah, cunt. Junior's fun at you. They're dropping like flies. <laughs> <laughs> Pokemon cards are fucking awesome. Oh, fuck you, man. Look at it. This guy starts with a bullshit. It's fucking annoying. Fuck him. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Trying to recover him out of. No. No. What the fucking cunt. 
God. Look at this guy. Look at him. Oh. Get lost. You can't compare it with my parents. <laughs> Fuck you, M. Bison. Barog. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just laughing at his shitty word. Junior is fucking awesome. Sitting here for six months farting through the cushions. Ah, oh, fuck off! What the fuck? God, this game. This game does cheat sometimes. Mm -hmm. Grab him! Grab him! Grab him, motherfucker! Damn it. Fuck! Ah, uh, when Richie gets shot by uh, Soprano sister, that was pretty cool. You forgot when his uh, what's his name again? Ralph, Ralph. Ugh. Fuck. Look at this guy. Look at this motherfucker. Look at him. Look at him. Look at this shit. Oh yeah. Look at this. No fuck. Sometimes he goes nuts. I'm a registered nurse, not maid. <laughs> come here, come here, fucking refugee. <laughs> With the Russian chick. God, she was hot. Damn, some of the chicks in that show. Uh, the lady with the one leg. I think in real life she has probably both legs, right? Uh, that uh, Tani fucked at one time. And then the the one he had with the... With the well, oh, when he whips the senator. Or whatever, the guy that was banging it. What the fuck, dude? Are you fucking joking me? And Bison went nuts. Drunk with power. For him, it was a choose. The fuck, the fuck. Oh, Hadouken, motherfucker. Get out. She does have she likes you confirming the posse. She is so fucking hot, man, that chick. And the, the other one? Uh, that soprano, the one with the, uh, the brunette. Damn. Fucking hell. So much beauty in the world. Fuck off. Hey! What the fuck? Look at this! I, I couldn't even fucking move. Yeah, she's from... Uh, I can't remember. She's from Ukraine or Russia. I can't remember. And I know those are very... Two very different things now, but they should be... Fuck off, fuck off. Look at this guy. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Look at him. It's like the. Don't tell me just is Mortal Kombat 2 and that's it, because Street Fighter does. Oh! Damn it! They cheat and cheat a lot here. M. Bison cheats a lot. Holy shit, he cheats. Like, you win around and then he goes fucking nuts sometimes. And thank you for telling me, Cat Crasher, because I wouldn't have known. I can't remember if she had the two legs. Sometimes they do get actors don't have the two legs, right? Uh, zombie movies, they, they uh, tend to uh, hire a lot of amputees to do the scenes. And there's a whiskey going. What the fuck? You're crazy? Svetlana. Oh, Svetlana, I think was the name of it. Yeah, I'm a piece of shit. What you call uh, Soprano's wife, Tony Soprano? Oh, fuck you, you mother bullshit! I should have hit. Get out! Come on, dude. Let's finish the ship, yeah? Fuck you. You're done. You're done. Get out. Wash in! in.
Awesome shit. All right, let's go back to the heck a tiny bit more. Let's fucking do it. Oh, whoa, whoa. Take it easy. See, recent Call of Cthulhu. Let's go. Let's, uh, let's do a tiny bit more before... Oh! What the fuck? What was that? My remote. See if I can... See if I can do something with this here. It's a bit... Oh, and it plays the intro here still. Cool. Cool, cool. Ah, man, I'm not up, up to for this. Damn it. Mulligan. The music is awesome here at the beginning. Ah, oh, now that's the music. All right. Fine. Suit yourself. There you go. I can hear nothing, but you can. You should be hear something here. Ah! Oh! Damn it, motherfucker. Okay, cut the music now. You piece of shit. I'm looking, Cat Crasher says, I'm looking for movie posters to buy. It's about fucking time. Decorate my space a little bit more. I live here over in a year. What are you looking for? What kind of posters? I'm curious. What movies would you have in mind to have decorating your walls? I wonder. Scarface. Alien. Uh, what kind of movies? Can you watch out this guy here? For fuck's sake. No, no, just one time, son. Just one time. Whew. There we go. And now we head on back. Did you get the cat? You didn't get the cat fucking... Now put, put the shit down. <laughs> Motherfucker. Thank God I'm holding away. There we go. You forget that you're done. There's nothing you can do. You get to the end, it's like, haha, you didn't get all the things. There's some music on. Ah! You fuck, I knew it. Come on, man. Okay, so where? Where the fuck do I go? Mm. This is so weird, dude. What the fuck? What do you want me to do here? This game is kind of weird sometimes. It says 70s, 80s, but not too obvious stuff. I want to get the Evil Dead. Oh, Evil Dead is so awesome. I have such a passion. Come on. Oh, you fucked up? All right, whatever. Happy birthday. Why are you not loading? Load my shit. Motherfucker. Uh, Evil Dead is cool face. Fucking love that one. Oh, yeah. Fucking love that one. Yeah, that's, uh, that's an awesome one. Yes, 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 sure, all those things. Oh, fuck off. Yeah, Evil Dead is awesome. I played, uh, there's a, uh, Evil Dead game on the, on the PS1. That's the only one I played. And it was awesome. I had a, a hell of a good time. It was actually pleasantly more, like, longer than I thought, right? Did I get the cat? No, it's up there. I like the organ. It's like the pipe organ. <laughs> Get out of here, man. Ah! How can you always forget? It's not... Why? Okay. Uh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. Ho oh, ho, hello. Huh? 
How would I? Hmm. Oh, okay. Ah, fuck. I didn't know. No, let's. Okay, okay, I got you. Yeah, but then I threw this up here and then I died, right? Okay, so maybe. Ah! La, 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 la. So jump up. So that's what I died last time here. Uh, that doesn't help me though. God damn it. What the fuck? Ah! Ooh. Shut up! <gasps> no! No! Uncle Philly, my ass. I get off my fucking st <laughs> feel magical turns into a house. <laughs> You're like, oh, I'm, I'm still alive here. Oh, I okay. Well, you know, I uh, was 100 percent sure I'm dead. It's a lot of it is puzzling here. It's like where. Where the fuck do you go, you know? Kind of thing. Oh shit, this fucking statue here. Wee, wee. Okay. There we go. Ah! Fucker! Damn you. What the fuck? What is this place here? I don't. I don't get it. You get a check checkpoint to save state. Uh, so let me see if I start a game here for you. Andy Reid, Chase. Blah blah blah. Tribute, someone please help me. This game encourages save states. Basically, without safe states, you can you can beat the game. Basically, every time you die, this is the first stage. So every time you die, uh, you go back to the very beginning. Not every game over. Every time you die, every single fucking time. So this game is made with uh, safe states in mind. And if you don't use them, which I, you know me, I hate I hate that. But if you don't use it here, uh, you there, there's just no way. Get it. Fuck you. Die eternally then. Yeah, whatever. So this is the, a safe state. Yeah, you need a safe state in this game. It's just not possible without it. It's just the game is made with safe states in mind. Which is sad. You know, he could have done a checkpoint system, but... Nope. This way. Ah. 
Oh, ooh, you fuck. Come on, dude. Get up there. This is done a sound effect. Oh, it's playing the music now. That's a fucking miracle. Ah! Shit. Can I kill him? Yes. <gasps> ah! <laughs> Damn it, fuckers. <gasps> oh. Okay, and then sun do this here. <gasps> ah! Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> oh shit, come on. <gasps> I don't, I don't get it. I, uh, the problem with this game here a little bit is the puzzles. I like, I'm not, what do you want from me? I'm not sure I understand. Well, there's no checkpoint. I'm gonna use it. Now, nah, yeah, they, 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 the game literally says you should use a save state, but I'm not uh, sure what you do here. Uh, I don't know. Uh, the puzzling is kind of annoying. You know. Getting primal. <laughs> I just had enough of the hack. It's enough. Uh, I enjoy uh, like platforming puzzle, like uh, challenges. But when you, I don't know where to go on a shooting game, I I I feel annoyed. I played enough of the hack. I, I had enough. It is an awesome hack. I'll give you that. But. 
I don't know how to eat the human. I don't know much about the, the moves of this game here. You're done. Come off it. I don't know the fatality, sorry. All I know is I like Sauron. The god of hunger. Cat Crash, are you going to sleep? To be honest, that hack looked unbearable. <laughs> <laughs> really cool hack is it, is it's cool i like when they had the with the physics you know fuck you you fucking armor down bitch ah, i love the music all right get me the fuck out of here uh, let's play some uh killer instinct cinder spam the same fucking shit let's see let's see how far i get with that where is it? Knights. Yeah, there you go. Now I just wonder if you're still here, Cat Crasher. That's all if you fell asleep or something. This is not my usual me. I usually like to play just one game. I'm just gonna spam with Cinder. I'm a piece of shit and I, I don't know. Cinder! Cinder. Orc. Orc. Oh, she's hot. Mmm, perky. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, the music, man. That's all I do, I spam the shit. <laughs> Not in this game. Learn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Inferno. Inferno. God, the music in this game, huh? Listen to it religiously. God, Orchid is so fine. Fuck off, bitch. Damn, she got me. Fucking Sundays is hard to enjoy. Damn, what do you know? It's not. It's, it's fucking horrible. Yeah, because you know Monday's coming. I know what you mean. I've always hated Sundays because of that. I like. I like. My favorite time of the week is uh, Friday night. You got the whole weekend ahead of you. Sundays are fucking depressing. I. <laughs> I can I can help but think of oh man. I can help but think of uh you know Monday. It's there we go, get it bitch. Oh she's so cute. Fucking orchid. Get getting fed up with overtime. You know, I wish you work in DPD. Uh, it's like a a mail company here, and they'll fucking bully you to overtime. And I, you know, I gotta say, I'm not. I, I work hard, but for me, the eight hours, I, 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 I don't like the overtime. I don't like. I don't want to do it. If there's an option to do overtime or not. I'll always choose not to. I'd rather, I'd rather leave. Get me out of here. And they kind of bully you to overtime sometimes. It's fucking annoying. 
Oh! <laughs> Boom, bitch. I hear it, Cat Crasher. Supreme victory! Perfect. Jag off. <laughs> this is such a weird combo. I just <laughs> I just spam this shit. It's the easiest combo in history, and then I finish with an inferno. I know I told you I'm shit at this game. That's why I'm not playing it seriously. I'm not I I I I'm not good at it. You know. Fuck, oh, fuck off, you bitch. Overtime sucks. I, I don't like overtime at all. Oh, there we go. Pop, 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 pop. <laughs> Just skip sp Ah. Winner. Supreme victor. I love this shit. What a game this is. I, I should, I'm sorry. I, I, I don't know how to play well. Pink center, center here. Purple. GameCube center. Listen to this music. Let's have a small can listen to this shit. Oh man, good shit, good shit. I love that riff. Cat Crash is going to bed. You know, I think I probably should call in the night too. Uh, yeah. Call in tonight. Fucking hell, it's, uh, it's 5 10 a.m. here, and the cat crasher should be 6 10 a.m., right? I do my hardware as I usually do. It's for the YouTube. Uh, I don't blame you if you leave. Uh, it's fine. I show the hardware, blah, 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 talk about it. Yada, yada. I don't know if I go back to this, uh, this thing. Uh, let me go turn on the light. Yeah, no, 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 I'm done. Sorry, we hit the crap out there. I see it. I am gonna be out of here as well. I love Rex. We really had a good time tonight. <laughs> I the love Rex. I'm a sentimental guy. Don't worry. As long look at this. Uh, there's people that are sentimental and they have a lot of emotions. There's people that are rough and ratty like I am. And as long as we respect each other, that's fine. That's how I think about the whole thing, you know? Like, oh, like you're, uh, I don't know, you're toxic masculine and all that. <laughs> you, well, and, and let's say you're a very sensitive type of guy. I'm not saying it's your case or mine. I'm just saying an example. Uh, we respect each other and that's it. Yeah, that's, uh, that's how it goes, man. As long as you, we all different. And that's what makes us unique, isn't it? You know? Imagine if we were all this fucking same, it'd be fucking boring, wouldn't it be? You know, I'll stick around if you want to raid. <laughs> Thanks, bud. I uh, I appreciate it. I, I tried to raid you yesterday. I failed miserably. I'm very fucking sorry. I couldn't. My, I didn't fail, to be honest. I know where to go. I know about the parachute thing, the parachute little icon thing. But my internet just, it wouldn't cooperate. It just fucked up and it wouldn't do it, you know? It wouldn't. It wouldn't load the page. You just. You just wouldn't do it. I tried. I saw you were live, and I wanted to send send you my viewers, the little few viewers I had, and it just. It wouldn't fucking work. The damn thing, you know. It really pissed me off because I, I felt bad, you know. Because like, well, there's finally I get somebody online when I'm about to finish the stream, and the damn fucking working all the time. I was streaming for fuck's sake, so that means that there is internet, right? It, it is working. And then I go to fucking raid somebody and the fucking thing quits on me. Just, you won't, you wouldn't load the damn page. 
But uh, yeah, I'll uh, I'll be yeah I'll be streaming tomorrow something. I feel bad a bit about this hack that I didn't finish. It's a it's a very good hack. It's just I don't know I I just couldn't hack it. <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> mm. You get yourself to bed, my friend. You're you're a tired man. You gotta you gotta get yourself to bed, Haas. You gotta get some sleep, you know. Sleep hygiene. I'm all fucked up here. I wasn't expecting today to sleep at fucking five. Get out of here. But it just happens, you know. What are you gonna do? Listen, I'm gonna do my hardware usual shtick that I do here. Okay. Talk soon. Have a good night, my friend. Thank you for stopping by. Always a pleasure to have you around here. Thank you so much. All right, it's set here. Talk soon. Have a good night, bud. Let me see if I can uh, change the CRT info here. Uh, I go here, browse, and let me see. I recognize them once I see the number. Uh, M14MU, I don't, is it? Is that it? Let me pop it on here. If it's the wrong one, forgive me. Here's the one. There you go. This here set, it's, uh, blah, 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 blah. come on, CRT Rex. Yeah, I know you're tired, so am I. There you go. The info's on the screen. M14U. United Kingdom model. Leave the fucking overlay there. Okay, fucking thing came out. So, there you go. Uh, ha, there you not go, because it's fucking dark as fuck here. You piece of shit, you're always fucking getting tangled up somewhere, ain't you? Holy fucking canola, man. There we go. Uh, it's got a card in the back, RF, that's it. That's a set. It's, there's nothing magical about it. Uh, but it's, it's RGB, RGB card. It has a little three dots here. Usually that denotes RGB here, by the way. Uh, and, uh, yep, and there's a side of it. Uh, the wooden side, I did it myself. It was boring as fuck. And many models in the States back home they look the same with the wooden paneling, and I did that, and it looks fantastic. So, okay, and in the front, you have yourself some, uh, sorry I didn't do the screen close-ups, I'm not doing it today, I'm going to be using this monitor galore, so it'll happen, okay? So here you get composite, you get your audio, you get your brightness, and here you get changing your channel, TV, all the other fucking controls you need. Uh, there's a remote, uh, the TV does accept remote. Uh, volume, this is programmed, so I'm, I'm assuming channel, and that's it, and there's the power, the standby button. So I'll leave a composite ready here. There we go. And turn the shit on. Boom. And it's black and white because this, this here set does not accept NTSC uh, via composite. It just doesn't. Please stop telling me about the discs. It, it, it doesn't do it, so it doesn't like it. Uh, RGB, no problem. Uh, composite, no NTSC. TV doesn't like it. It's a PAL model, so. Okay, and uh, there's a sound going to you. And let's turn this fucking thing off. There we go. Okay, so uh, sound gets you here. SCART. If you ever want a sound out of SCART, this year would do. So here's a SCART audio extractor. So basically, SCART goes in here goes into your TV, 
And this here will get you uh, sound out to whatever device you're using. In my case, an RCA to USB. Okay. Uh, C-Sync, SCART, retro gaming cables, always. Put this here back in the bag. There we go. Console. I'm going to be quick today. It's, you know. Like, uh, so this here is a uh, one chip O3 uh, Super Nintendo, as sharp as you can get. Okay, and uh, it has all the fixings brightness fix, ghost fix, blah blah blah, yada yada. C Sync restore, that's why I'm using the C Sync. But if you have uh, one chip O3 specifically and you don't want to do all that shit inside because it is some soldering that I have to do with a very tiny motherfucking ass, uh, you know, uh, resistors, they're very tiny, right? So if you don't want to deal with solder, you don't want to do soldering, get sync on them and you're done. Yeah, you know, as far as I know, uh, especially if you're using flashcards, it has a, uh, what's it called? Um, a brightness fix. So the fix is basically one chip O3, one chip O1, one chip O2, it don't matter. One chip consoles, they have a brightness that's too jacked up and you want to be, you want to be able to fix that and get rid of it. And even flash cars sometimes. And also if you have uh, HD retrovision cables, uh, they'll sort of, uh, they have an option. You can turn down the brightness, you know. So I'll leave my sign out right here because I'm ready to get the fuck out and go to bed. Nope. Shut up, you son of a bitch. There we go. Okay, just trying to shut this thing up. Control is stuck. Uh, as I always say, focus, motherfucker. There we go. I love the concave and the convex difference. Tactile buttons. You can feel them when I play the... Super Famicom, I always say that is a bit. Yeah, I feel like I'm touching me and they when I'm touching Y and X. Okay. Other than that, that's it. I am gonna play my signing off routine and I am out of here. My good sir. Uh, it's been a pleasure. I'm sorry I couldn't beat the hack. You know, yeah, I'm gonna get in focus here. I'm sorry I couldn't beat the hack. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. I, I did try my best. Uh, maybe someday I'll go back to it. Maybe never. Uh, there's another hack that I want to play. It's called Il Maniero Spetrale. And it's an Italian hack of uh, Luigi. It's got the same kind of vibe, but less of the bullshit. Okay? Or maybe not. I mean, all of them have some sort of bullshit at the end. Okay, so turn down the brightness here. Because it's, uh, the brightness usually is too high. There we go. And I see a refresh rate line right here. And we'll take care of that right now by changing the synchro scan. Boom, 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 boom. That motherfucker. Get in there. And we'll put down the six there. Is that it? They're gone? Uh, kind of. It's, it's good enough. Okay. And uh, my grand school here. It's been a pleasure. And I hope you enjoy the stream. I have no idea how long I stream for. Let me see here. Close. Nine hours. You f you're fucking joking. <laughs> okay. Didn't expect that. I thought it was like six hours or something. Fair enough. Uh, nine hours. Chase saying bye. Thank you for hanging out. And with that in mind, I reckon I am out of here. Thank you very much. And I hope you all have a good night. God bless and take good care. Thank you.